Chapter 401 Dao Zhang In an instant, a huge energy gushed out from Wang Ran's palm. Under Wang Ran's precise control, this energy directly turned into countless pieces, and instantly enveloped the gate of the college. It was just a moment of time and this energy was directly dissipated in the world. Zhu Shaiwai looked at Wang Ran suspiciously, wondering what the master of the prince wanted to do. Does it make any sense to just cover this gate with soul power like this? Wang Ran would naturally not explain Zhu Shaiwai's doubts, because the next second, he has already given the answer. Wang Ran waved his hand gently, and a breeze came out of thin air, blowing towards the gate of the college. With the breeze blowing, the door seemed to have been weathered for countless years and a large amount of powder drifted away with the breeze. When the powder stopped falling, the gate completely changed. Those stone pillars that were originally bare outside, at this time, were hovering a lifelike giant dragon with its head up. The delicate lines, if you don't look closely, are like a giant dragon hovering on the stone pillar. These stone pillars can already be called a work of art. If you hadn't seen it with your own eyes, anyone would believe that this was made by a famous engraver who spent countless hours and efforts. And at the top of these stone pillars, Longku looked up to the sky and roared against the auspicious clouds carved by a huge stone tablet. As for why Wang Ran chose to carve a giant dragon on a stone pillar, don't ask, the question is what Luxun said, and the question is the descendant of the dragon. Dot. Looking at this scene, Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong were acceptable. Wang Ran, is it so abnormal? However, Zhu Shaiwai did not have such blind worship of Wang Ran, therefore, he was not calm in an instant. What is this method? He thinks he is not weak. After all, it is impossible to be Xuai's guard without strength. However, he didn't understand anything at all now, and the door had changed a lot. However, what shocked him was much more than that. Looking at the auspicious cloud still held by many dragon mouths, Wang Ran turned his hands into sword fingers and pointed directly at the steel. With the shaking of Wang Ran's hands, Four big characters quickly appeared on the Xiangyun Steel Taoist Academy. Just four words are enough to give people endless awe. The four characters are like a whole, as if any one character is removed, it is incomplete. This is the reason why Wang Ran used the formation method in it. These four characters are not just the name of the academy. At the same time, these four characters also constitute a protective array. Even if Title Duluo came, he could never cause any harm to this gate. Guardzu who had been staring at Wang Ran's actions, naturally saw these four characters at the first time. With the first moment when the four characters of Zhangman College took shape, an invisible charm was born out of thin air. Zhu Shaiwai, who had been staring at the auspicious cloud steel, did not control his body at once with the birth of this charm, and knelt directly in front of the gate. Perceiving Zhu Shaiwei's movements, Wang Ran didn't feel any surprise. These four big characters themselves contained Wang Ran's own Tao, and it was also a formation. When it takes shape, it will naturally release a touch of Taoism. And Zhu Shaiwei, who had been staring at the auspicious cloud steel, was naturally affected when Dao Yun was released. As Xue's bodyguard, although Zhao's bodyguard was not weak, he was only at the level of the Soul King. If he could resist this Wang Ran's Dao Yun, maybe Wang Ran would just accept him as a disciple. However, Wang Ran knew the result a long time ago, and Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong didn't. They are not as sad as Zhu Shaiwai, although they have been staring at the auspicious cloud steel, but they have a background. Under Wang Ran's protection, they did not receive any influence at all. Therefore, after seeing the guard slap on his knees, Li Ying asked suspiciously, Shaiwai Zhu, what's wrong with you? Are you feeling well? Ning Rong Rong also looked at Zhu Shaiwai with a puzzled face. Her little head couldn't understand at all. How could this uncle who is obviously a big man kneel down inexplicably? When Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong looked like this, Zhu Shaiwai flushed with embarrassment. He really didn't expect that he would be so unbelievable, he just read a few words, and he just knelt down. Quickly got up from the ground, Zhu Shaiwai waved his hand towards Li Ying, and said in embarrassment, it's okay, it's okay, I'm not in good health, my legs are always weak, and I'm sick. Is that right? Li Ying murmured suspiciously when he heard Zhu Shaiwei's answer. Why is there this strange problem? If your legs are soft, don't you just kneel down at every turn? It would be embarrassing if it were on the street. Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong thought silently in their hearts, but they did not ask. Wang Ran looked at Guardian Zhu who was embarrassingly hiding himself, but smiled silently, and didn't try to expose him. Masters. They all want face. Shai Wai Zhu, who stood up, also quickly adjusted his awkward state of mind. It may be that the embarrassment just now aroused the pride in Zhu Shai Wei's heart. After all, he was also the emperor's bodyguard, the powerful soul king. Some unbelievers raised their heads again, 
staring at the four big characters of Dao Zhang Academy. Because Dao Yun had already concealed into the auspicious cloud steel, this time Zhuai Wai was not forced to kneel. However, just staring at the steel for a few seconds, Zhu Shai Wai felt like he was hit by a heavy stone in his chest. That kind of depression almost made him spit out a mouthful of blood. He understood that Wang Ran's methods were not something he could speculate. If you continue to stare at those big characters, you will definitely get hurt, even if it hurts the foundation. It is not impossible to be unable to practice in the future. Therefore, Zhu Shai Wai quickly turned away his gaze and took a long breath. At this time, he felt that the depression just now disappeared, and his body became brisk again. Looking up again, Zhu Shai Wai gave Wang Ran a secret glance. Sure enough, it is worthy of being able to make His Majesty pay so much attention to the existence of even the prince's teacher. The strength is so powerful, just a few words, it even made him feel an endless sense of powerlessness. Such strength is probably one of the best among title Du Liu O. Oh. Zhu Shai Wai sighed inwardly. Chapter 402 Kian De Liu The Guardians who actually had no idea about title Du Liu O. Oh. After all, in Du Liu O oh Continent, the probability of seeing a title Duluo was too low. The probability of being able to see title Duluo's shot is even lower. Even if I knew title Duluo was very strong, I couldn't imagine how strong it was in my mind. Therefore, at the beginning, Zhu Shai Wai only respected Wang Ran habitually because of Wang Ran's title Duluo's strength. But after seeing Wang Ran's little tricks, he now looked at Wang Ran's gaze. In addition to respect and fear, originally Zhu Wai Wai didn't dare to cause Wang Ran's displeasure. But now he dare not even dare, just as Zhu Shai Wei's thoughts were aging, the situation here was also discovered by the workers in the training academy. Not dare to neglect, the steward rushed towards Wang Ran and the others. As soon as he stood firm, the steward said to the guard Zhu, Shai Wei Zhu, why are you here today? I wonder who these adults are? The steward's voice is very respectful, and he cannot tolerate his disrespect. He knew Zhu Shai Wei, Emperor Xi still attached great importance to the construction of Taoist Academy. Therefore, I directly sent my own guards to form this project supervision team. As the personal guard of the Xuai Emperor, Zhu Shai Wai was naturally in this rank. Therefore, the steward here knows Zhu Wai Wai for them. Zhu Wai Wai's status is already noble. However, in front of Wang Ran and the others, Zhu Shai Wai's posture was obviously very low, as if he were a servant. This kind of posture, except in front of Emperor Xuai, Zhu Shai Wai would almost never show it. After all, as the Emperor's personal guard, under certain circumstances, it represents the Emperor's face. But now he is in this posture, so the identity of Wang Ran and the others is definitely not simple. If possible, the steward did not want to open this mouth. But there is no way. Emperor Xuai attaches great importance to the cultivation of the Taoist Academy, so the steward can't pass by casually. In order to prevent accidents, he can only ask questions. Dot. Hearing the steward's question, Zhu Shai Wai showed a respectful expression, and replied to the steward, Manager Ao, let me introduce to you first. This is the master of His Royal Highness, Wang Ran. At the same time, my Yanxia is also the master of this college. As for these two children, they are both disciples under the crown. I came here this time, also on the order of Your Majesty, to bring the crown to see the progress of the construction of the college. Upon hearing the words of Guardian Zhu, Manager Ao was shocked. Manager Austrian had long wondered why the Empire had a Tandy Royal Academy and why he had to make a fuss about building a new academy. He is a smart person, otherwise it would not be possible to get into such an important position by virtue of a white body. Therefore, as soon as Zhu Shai Wai said what he said, he wanted to understand the key. Emperor Xuyi, this is showing good wishes to Wang Ran. Moreover, the title Myanxia is not something anyone can afford. By saying this, Shai Wai Zhu also told manager Ao, Wang Ran's identity as Du Liu O. Oh. Regardless of Wang Ran's status, Ao Guan didn't dare to slack off. So, Guan Shi hurriedly said, it turned out to be Wang Ran, you can rest assured that the training in the academy is very smooth. With the support of your majesty, you have already practiced for the most part. Only the layout of the mimicry practice environment is left. Hearing what Ao Guan said, Wang Ran nodded slightly, and then said, I see. Go ahead and work on it first. I just want to stroll around by myself. After finishing speaking, Wang Ran glanced in the distance inadvertently. They felt that there was a human being there, and it was not weak. That huge energy fluctuation could be sensed even if Wang Ran didn't deliberately probe it. Moreover, he felt a familiar feeling from that person's energy, which was somewhat similar to Kian Renxu's energy. Kian De Liu, Wang Ran thought silently in his heart. However, he didn't say much, no matter who it is. Now is not the time to meet him. In the same way, Wang Ran's seemingly inadvertent gesture was also caught by Kian Daily Liu, 
who had the top strength of Duluo continent, because, when Wang Ran looked at him, he felt as if he was seen through by an unspeakable existence. Originally, when he heard the report from Snake Lance Duluo and Swordfish Duluo, Kian Daeliu didn't believe it in his heart. He even thought that Kian Renxiu, Siberian Dolphin Duluo, and Snake Lance Duluo had been deceived. After all, no one in this world knows things about God's mansion better than him, and no matter what, he is also a person who has been favored by God's mansion. Although the Divine Residence really existed, he also knew that the Divine Residence generally would not come to Duluo continent. It can even be said that in tens of thousands of years, no Divine Residence has ever descended on Duluo continent. Therefore, Kian Daily U habitually believes that the Divine Residence will not descend from the Divine Realm. And the Divine Residence that can walk on the mainland, apart from the newly succeeded Divine Residence, is impossible. But if a new divine residence is born, not to mention he will feel it himself, even the evangels will tell him. But none of this, so he doubted in his heart. But now, the doubt in his heart has disappeared, not to mention anything else. Just because Wang Ran gave him that look just now, even if it wasn't God's mansion, it was not far away. In this case, he should have taken the initiative to go out and see him. However, since Wang Ran didn't expose him, he could guess Wang Ran's thoughts so he still waited with peace of mind. As for the existence of Kian Daily U, apart from Wang Ran and Kian Daily U himself, naturally no one had discovered it. At this time, the Austrian manager who heard Wang Ran's words, looked at Zhuaiwei asking for help. Wang Ran's identity, how dare he be so slack. However, he didn't understand Wang Ran's character, so he could only turn to Zhuaiwei, who was fairly familiar. When Director Ao saw this, Zhuaiwei nodded directly towards him and said, my Anxia told you to go down. You don't have to be so entangled. Zhu Shiwei didn't think Wang Ran cared about this little thing. Besides, Zhu Shiwei didn't dare to violate Wang Ran's words. When he heard the words of Zhu Shiwei, Director Ao was relieved and left and went on to supervise. Wang Ran didn't care about the trivial meaning of Zhu Shiwei and Director Ao. After Director Ao left, he directly said to Zhu Shiwei, Guardians are troubles you. You should also return to the palace. I will stay here for two days. Upon hearing this, Zhu Shiwei's face became serious, and he quickly said, My Anxia, what are you talking about? Chapter 403 God Test. It is my honor to be able to serve you. However, you said you want to stay here for two days, so please think twice. After all, the college has not been built yet, and many things are incomplete. Compared to Tanda City, the conditions here are a bit worse and your majesty definitely hopes to give him a good treat. Hearing this, Wang Ran waved his hand indifferently and said, It's okay, I just plan the college well these two days. Seeing Wang Ran's decision was made, Zhu Shiwei couldn't help but say goodbye and left. Wang Ran didn't stay in place any longer, and took Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong, and walked towards the depths of the college. Although the Daozang Academy occupies a large area, it is nothing in front of the Soul Master. Soon, Wang Ran came to the back mountain of the college. This is used as a training ground in the planning map of the college. Therefore, after the construction is completed, there are no more workers here. Wang Ran came here to see Kian Renxiu's grandfather Kian Daeliu, the great worship of this Yuhan Hall. Come out. Standing on the top of the back mountain, Wang Ran spoke calmly. Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong gave Wang Ran a surprised look, not knowing who he was talking to. However, just as the two were still surprised, a figure suddenly appeared in front of the three. The long golden hair was half draped behind him, and although the precipitation of the years appeared in his eyes, he could not conceal the image of his handsome middle-aged man, and he could not see that he was an old monster who had lived for hundreds of years. With Kian Dalius' appearance, Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong's eyes were immediately attracted by him. Really someone? This thought flashed through the minds of Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong. However, Kian Daily Wu didn't pay attention to the meaning of the two little guys, bowed directly to Wang Ran, and said, The angel worships Kian Daily Wu and has seen adults. Kian Daily Wu didn't introduce his identity as the great worship hall of Yuhan Hall, but instead used the identity of the of angels to worship Wang Ran, because he had already believed in the identity of Wang Ran's divine residence, for the divine residence, no matter how powerful the Yuhan Hall was, it was nothing more than a human power. But the sacrifice of the angel god is different. It represents the face of the angel god. With the identity of the of angels, Kian Daily U not only has a certain right to speak, but also only needs to bow. But on the other hand, if you don't talk about the right to speak, you have to kneel down and worship even when you bow. Wang Ran didn't care about Kian Daily's thoughts. 
whether it is a great worship in Yuhan Hall or a sacrifice to the of angels, it is no different to him. With him, these two identities are not as good as Kian Renxiu's grandfather. Therefore, Wang Ran just waved his hand it gently, signaled the exemption, and said, Kian Daily U, are you here this time to verify my strength? Why, is it confirmed now? Kian Daily U didn't feel embarrassed when Wang Ran exposed his thoughts. Although he loves face, it's not a shameful thing. If he is seen through, he will be seen through. What's more, the one who saw through him was still a divine residence, there was no need to be surprised or embarrassed. Therefore, facing Wang Ran's question, Kian Daily U just answered calmly, my lord laughed. Xiexiu is my only granddaughter. As a grandfather, I have to worry about whether my granddaughter has been deceived in the face of such things. But now it seems that my worries are unnecessary. Hearing Kian Dalius' words, Wang Ran nodded without refusal, and then continued to ask, Then what do you think of Xiexiu worshipping me as a teacher now? Upon hearing Wang Ran's words, Kian Dalius showed a joyful smile on his face, and said respectfully, it is Xiexiu's blessing to be able to worship adults as a teacher. Originally, I was worried that Xiexiu would not be able to inherit the position of God of Angels. After all, adults also know how difficult and dangerous the God test is. But now, with your training, I believe Xiexiu will definitely pass the test. When it comes to this, even Kian Dalius Xing Xing can suppress his joy. Becoming a is his biggest dream in his life, but because of his talent, he finally did not take that last step. But now he sees this help in his granddaughter. At the beginning, he was still struggling. Although Kian Renxiu's talent was very good, his original talent was not bad. If Kian Renxiu didn't get the Angel's Nine tests, wouldn't his fate be the same as him? Even if Kian Renxiu got the Angel Nine exam by chance, is it really possible for Kian Renxiu to pass? You know, at the beginning, he only had eight tests, and he almost died in the tests. But now it's different. With the training and help of Wang Ran, the master of God's residence. The chance of Kian Renxiu becoming a god has almost doubled. Even though Wang Ran's position may not be too strong, but what is it? Even the weakest divine residence, it is also a divine residence, which is not comparable to their mortals. He wanted Kian Renxiu to inherit the of angels, not Wang Ran's. With Wang Ran's training and help, it is enough. However, after hearing Kian Dalius' words, Wang Ran did not show any relief or satisfaction. On the contrary, after hearing Kian Dalius' words, Wang Ran frowned slightly. He still knew that the Duliuo plane was a divine residence, although it was powerful, but to be honest, it was much more restrictive. If you choose to inherit the divine residence and become a god, unless you find an heir in the future, your destiny can only be tied to this plane. Therefore, Wang Ran said straightforwardly. God test. To be honest, if it is not a last resort, I don't want Xiaxia to become in this way. Hearing this, Kian Daily U who was still in joy just now, was stunned for an instant. What is not a last resort? Don't you want Xiaxia to become in this way? Is it possible that Wang Ran hopes that Kian Renxiu can gather faith and gather the gods with her own strength? But now it's different from the ancient times, so there is a radish and a pit. The current god realm is almost full. A powerful position has a master even earlier, let alone the difficulty of condensing the position. Even if Kian Renxiu can become in this way, the condensed position will not be too strong. It is a fluke to be able to have the position of a second level divine residence. However, even if it is a second level divine residence, know that the of angels is a first level divine residence. Going out of the legendary god king's position is also a top notch existence in the god realm. Perplexed, Kian Daily U asked directly in doubt, My lord, what do you mean by saying that you don't want Xiexia to become a through the test? Chapter 404 God's House Seeing Kian Daily's puzzled look, Wang Ran hesitated slightly. He was a little entangled whether to tell Kian Daily U the reason. Anyway, Kian Daily U was also the spokesperson of the angelic in the world. In case his remarks were learned by the gods of the god realm through Kian Daily U, then he will definitely not be calm in the days to come. However, this hesitation was only a moment. Although Wang Ran hates trouble, it doesn't mean that he will escape trouble. If you just retreat in the face of such a small risk, will you still retreat when you encounter this situation again? What's more? Although Kian Daily U is the spokesperson of the angel in the world, he is also Kian Renxiu's grandfather. If he understands the pros and cons of the matter, I believe he will also make a wise choice. Therefore, after Wang Ran made a decision in his heart, he slowly asked Kian Daily U, since you are a sacrifice to the of angels, you should understand that many of the gods in the gods are looking for heirs. You don't think they just want to find an inheritor? Hearing Wang Ran's question, Kian Daily U was stunned for a moment and then said with some doubts, is not it? Upon hearing this, Wang Ran shook his head with a chuckle, 
and continued, if there is no special reason for the divine status that I have cultivated and inherited, how can those divine residences be passed on to others for nothing? The biggest reason why there are so many is to pursue a higher realm and for freedom. Free? Hearing this, Kian Daily Uplant help but asked. Wang Ran didn't hide it either, nodded and explained. Yes, although inheriting the position of God can easily become a God, but correspondingly, those who become gods will also be bound by this position. Part of the reason why God's mansion is so powerful is because they can mobilize and control the laws of heaven and earth. With the addition of the laws of heaven and earth, every divine residence will be greatly enhanced under its own domain. However, the benefits will inevitably pay a part of the price. The price of becoming a divine residence is that one's own soul will merge with the will of this world. If there is no successor, then this divine residence will be bound forever, and even the upper limit of practice will be restricted. You should also understand how difficult it is to find an heir. That's why I can't say that it is a last resort. I don't want Xiuxiu to become a by inheriting the position of God. After listening to Wang Ran's words, Kian Daily Wu was also lost in thought. This was the first time he heard this kind of thing. However, he did not suspect that Wang Ran was lying to him, because Wang Ran also said that his idea is not a last resort. He doesn't want Kian Renxia to become a by inheriting the divine position instead of not allowing Kian Renxia to become a through this method. If there is really no way in the end, Kian Renxia can also become a in this way. Besides, Wang Ran didn't have to lie to him. With such preconditions, Kian Daily Wu naturally recognized Wang Ran's statement. After all, this is also a double insurance. However, Kian Daily Wu also had a lot of doubts in his heart. So after a moment of contemplation, Kian Daily Wu said directly, My lord, I naturally agree with you. It's just that I don't know how you want Xiaxu to break through to become the last step of God. Upon hearing Kian Daily's words, Wang Ran also gave a relaxed smile. Sure enough, even though Kian Daily's status and status was special, he still valued Kian Renxiu's granddaughter. He will not refuse anything that is beneficial to Kian Renxiu. It is precisely because of this that Wang Ran's impression of Kian Daily Wu has improved a, a lot. A person who values family affection is worthy of recognition in some respects even if he is inexcusable. Dot. Naturally relying on our own accumulation to forcefully break through this barrier. Of course, compared to the title of God's mansion, I prefer to call a person who breaks through like this to Kian Daily's question. Wang Ran answered with ease, and this answer made countless thoughts flash through Kian Dalius' mind. Sin? Can human beings really break through the barrier of becoming a with their own accumulation? Also, does Wang Ran exist like this? At this point, Kian Daily Wu fell silent, and at the same time, a touch of excitement was slowly brewing in his eyes. After a while, Kian Daily Wu couldn't suppress his fluctuating heart anymore, hesitated and asked, Could it be that, my lord? Did you also break through this way? Regarding Kian Dalius' question, Wang Ran didn't mean to conceal it, he nodded and admitted it. After Wang Ran admitted, the excitement in Kian Dalius' eyes broke out instantly. With Wang Ran's example of being able to break through the divine mansion by himself, can he also try to touch the legendary realm as long as he has a corresponding method? Once this idea was born in Kian Dalius' mind, he couldn't calm down anymore. Looking at Wang Ran excitedly, Kian Dalius said in a trembling voice, My lord, please dare to ask. In your opinion, do not know if I have a chance to take this last step. After saying that, Kian Daily Wu felt that his mouth was very dry, and his heart was beating violently, as if he was about to jump out of his throat. He was expecting, or praying. Pray that you can hear the answer you want from Wang Ran's mouth. Dot. Wang Ran looked at Kian Daily Wu calmly with his eyes, and those eyes seemed to see through Kian Daily's whole person. The environment suddenly fell silent, Except for Kian Dalia's heartbeat so clear, no one said anything. Even the youngest Ning Rong Rong, holding Wang Ran's hand at this time, stood by his side honestly. After a while, Wang Ran slowly nodded towards Kian Dalia Wu and said at the same time, If you have a chance, you may not be unable to take the last step. What Wang Ran is telling is the truth. With Kian Dalia's talent and accumulation, if he has the chance or can get Wang Ran's help, he can easily take the last step to become a god. But chances are hard to find and Wang Ran himself would not help such a stranger as Kian Daily Wu casually for no reason. Naturally, Kian Daily Wu didn't know about this, even if he knew it, he wouldn't care. Having been able to go to the present, he had no idea how many difficulties he had experienced. Naturally, his mind could not be shaken by this difficulty. After hearing Wang Ran nod and say the result he was expecting, Kian Daily Wu only felt a thump in his mind. Chapter 405 I want to fight you actually, it is really possible. At this moment, Kian Daily Wu felt that he had lost many years of youth and was rejuvenated with vitality. After swallowing, 
Kane Daly who felt that his dry tongue had returned to normal, and then opened his mouth full of expectation, wanting to ask about the breakthrough method. However, in the end he still did not ask, because he also knew that Wang Ran had no reason to help him. In the final analysis, his connection with Wang Ran was only based on Kian Renxiu. To Wang Ran, he was nothing more than a stranger, even, because of his identity as the spokesperson of his divine residence, he would be a potential enemy of such an unorthodox divine residence like Wang Ran. Thinking in another way, if it's yourself, when facing this situation, let alone guiding the cultivation, it's just the words before, I'm much lazy to say. If you really ask, don't say whether you are embarrassed or not, it is this little friendship that will probably wear out. Let's look for opportunities slowly in the future. Kian Daily Wu sighed silently. He didn't want to make a bad impression in front of Wang Ran because of this knowingly impossible thing. The change in Kian Daily's expression was naturally caught in Wang Ran's eyes. Wang Ran could naturally guess his thoughts. Regarding this, Wang Ran secretly admired Kian Daily Wu in his heart. After touching the obviously boring little head of Ning Rong Rong, Wang Ran spoke to Kian Daily Wu. Do you have any questions? Go back if you haven't. Kian Daily Wu gritted his teeth when he heard Wang Ran's intention to chase away guests. Although he knew that Wang Ran would not teach him the breakthrough method, he still had to fight for it in other ways. After all, Wang Ran might only meet this one in his entire life. Therefore, after Wang Ran issued the order to evict the guest, Kian Daily Wu gritted his teeth and said with some embarrassment, My lord, I have something to ask for. I don't know if it should be said or not. Hearing Kian Dalius' words, Wang Ran frowned subconsciously. Could it be that he guessed wrong? Kian Dalius really wanted to help him break through. I just praised him in my heart, but is he going to slap him so soon? However, despite this, Wang Ran still said, Let's talk about it first. It was not that he changed his mind, but that he wanted to confirm what happened to Kian Dalius. Seeing Wang Ran frowning, Kian Dalius' heart actually sank a little. But Wang Ran has said so now and he can only grit his teeth and continue to speak, my lord, I want to fight you. Hearing this, Wang Ran was slightly surprised. He didn't expect that Kian Daily Wu had already confirmed his strength, and he even wanted to fight himself. In fact, Kian Daily Wu was also very bitter. If there were other ways, he didn't want to fight Wang Ran. After all, no one likes to be abused. However, if Kian Daily Wu wanted to make a breakthrough, he had no choice but to make this move. On the one hand, I can peek into the gap between myself and God's mansion. On the other hand, with Wang Ran's pressure on him, maybe he could be one step closer. Therefore, he put forward this request. Wang Ran wasn't a stupid man, although he was a little surprised, but he soon understood Kian Dalia's thoughts. However, Wang Ran still asked with some uncertainty, Are you sure you want to fight me? Faced with Wang Ran's question, Kian Dalia who did not hesitate, nodded firmly and said, That's right, my lord. Although I also know that the gap between myself and you is definitely like a cloud of mud, I still want to be able to see how far I am from God's mansion. Moreover, I also hope that with the pressure from you, the cultivation base can be one step closer. Kian Daily Wu didn't conceal it, and directly spoke out his own reasons. Regarding this, Wang Ran was silent for a moment, then nodded and said, If you want, then I will satisfy you. Wang Ran didn't have any reason to agree, but he still agreed. Not because of how optimistic about Kian Daily Wu he is, but because of his recognition of a person who pursues his dream. Dot. After hearing Wang Ran's promise, Kian Daily's face instantly showed a joyful smile. Without hesitation, Kian Daily Wu retreated not far away. Upon seeing this, Wang Ran directly laid a magic circle, wrapping the entire back mountain. After fighting for a while, he didn't want outsiders to find out. After laying down the magic circle to wrap the back mountain, Wang Ran sent Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong two little guys far away, protecting them with energy. At this time, Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong had long since disappeared from their boredom, and their faces were full of excitement. Wang Ran shot, it's been so long, they really haven't seen Wang Ran shot. Especially Ning Rong Rong, who was still immature. His eyes were shining at this time. In her opinion, this is a rare and fun thing. Dot. Not paying attention to the thoughts of the two little guys, Kian Daily Wu saw that Wang Ran had arranged everything properly, and he arched his hand directly towards Wang Ran, and then said, My lord, please forgive me. In response, Wang Ran nodded gently, and then said, It's okay, just shoot. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Kian Daily Wu didn't speak anymore. His expression directly became serious. In the next second, a ray of light flashed directly from Kian Daily's body. As the light faded, Three pairs of wings flapped gently behind Kian Daily Wu. With the light flapping of these three pairs of wings, 
Kian Dalia's body also floated into the air. Eight black and one red, nine dazzling spirit rings floated up and down on Kian Dalia's body regularly. If this spirit ring configuration is seen by ordinary people, I am afraid that it will be shocked and speechless, but none of the people present would care about this. Not to mention Wang Ran, who had no spirit at all, and Ning Rong Rong, who was young and didn't care about them. Even Li Ying, who had already learned a lot about cultivation had no other ideas except for the envy of Kian Dalia's possession of spirit rings. Although Li Ying does not yet have a spirit ring, he still has a very high vision under Wang Ran's cultivation. But Kian Dalia, who had summoned a martial soul, did not stop his actions. He knew in his heart that the gap between himself and Wang Ran was like a gap. If you don't try your best, it will not only show disrespect to Wang Ran, but also irresponsible for himself. Therefore, the seventh spirit ring on Kian Dalia's body burst into black light instantly, directly covering the other spirit rings. New Hun real body, launch. With the display of the seventh soul skill martial soul avatar, a huge angel figure instantly appeared behind Kian Dalia, mysterious and holy. Chapter 406 Blood Abuse Part 1 Wang Ran looked at the phantom angel with the same appearance behind Kian Dalia and nodded silently in his heart. I have to say that the top martial soul is also different from the top martial soul. Even if he didn't touch the realm of the gods, because of the angel martial soul, Kian Dalia's martial soul still contained a trace of charm. However, no matter how the top martial arts soul, it just has a touch of charm. It was impossible for Wang Ran to pay attention to it. Kian Daily Wu obviously knew this too, so after releasing the seventh spirit ability martial spirit body, the first spirit ring on his body and the only red 100,000 year spirit ring also shone dazzlingly. Angel Blessing With the lighting of the two spirit rings, Kian Dalia's body was directly enveloped by a holy light. This is the reason for the Angel's Blessing. As Kian Dalia's first spirit ability, the Angel's Blessing has only one effect which is to strengthen oneself. Even if Kian Daily Wu was already a level 9 tiny in limit to Luo, he could still double his full attributes. All attributes are doubled, which in itself is an extremely terrifying increase. Moreover, this increase was still placed on a level 9 tiny in limit to Luo. After strengthening himself, a large amount of spirit power also spouted from Kian Daily's body, condensing into a sacred energy giant sword in the sky, and was tightly held by his martial soul. Moreover, on the energy giant sword, there is also the power of the law. Holy Angel decides. With the complete formation of the energy giant sword, Kian Daily Wu raised his hands high, and under the control of the angel phantom, the giant sword slashed towards Wang Ran quickly. The Holy Angel decided that Kian Daily's ninth spirit ability, because his ninth spirit ring was a bestowed spirit ring, so although it was an e hundred thousand year old spirit ring, there was only this one, but correspondingly, an e hundred thousand year spirit ring with only one spirit ability. The effect of this spirit ability is not comparable to that of an ordinary an e hundred year spirit ability. Moreover, the holy angel decision is still a powerful single soul ability. Although the giant sword is very large, it can attack many people at once. However, this does not affect the nature of it being a single attack skill. As the only spirit ability in the one hundred thousand year spirit ring, it is also a single attack ability. The Holy Angel's decision can be said to be the top of Kian Dalia's attack power. Even the attack power of this skill can be called one of the strongest in the entire Duluo continent. Not only that, the sanctuary decision itself also comes with a purification effect. If it is against the existence of darkness or evil attributes, the damage can be further increased. However, even though this was Kian Dalia's strongest attack, it was still vulnerable in front of Wang Ran, facing the sword of the Holy Angel coming towards him. Wang Ran slightly narrowed his eyes. To be honest, although the attack speed of the Holy Angel decision is very fast, it is nothing in front of Wang Ran, as long as Wang Ran wanted to. He could easily dodge this attack. However, he did not do so. What Gain Daily Wu expected was a head-to-head -head fight with Wang Ran, instead of seeing his strongest attack which would not even be able to touch the corners of the enemy's clothes. Out of appreciation for Kian Daily Wu, Wang Ran decided to satisfy his wish. Therefore, facing Kian Daily's decision of the Holy Angel, Wang Ran's right hand became a sword finger, and when the Holy Angel's sword was about to smash Wang Ran, he gently faced his right hand. The difference between Wang Ran's sword finger and Kian Daily's Holy Angel's decision is like the difference between an ant and an elephant. At first glance, Wang Ran pointed at the sword of the holy angel with his sword, which was tantamount to using a praying man's arm. However, when the two really collided, the whole world was quiet. Because the sword of the holy angel that was sinking rapidly, after meeting with Wang Ran's sword, it abruptly stopped in the air. Just above Wang Ran's sword fingers, 
he didn't say how much energy he possessed. However, an invisible rule of power is condensed on the sword. Relying on this power of law, Wang Ran was able to crack Yan Dahlia's strongest attack with only a small amount of energy. This is also the reason why God's mansion is completely different from mortal people. In the next second, Wang Ran's sword fingers moved slightly. Kian Dahlia's sword of the holy angel, like Tofu that had been cut with an unknown number of knives, was not full of broken marks. Immediately afterwards, the entire sword of the holy angel, like a broken star, turned directly into energy and dissipated in the air. Kian Dahlia's decision by the holy angel also failed completely with the breaking of the sword of the holy angel. Seeing this scene, Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong were naturally full of worship when pointing. The powerful enemy was wiped out, which is really too handsome. However, Kian Daly couldn't get excited anymore. At this moment, his brows wrinkled tightly. He never expected that his strongest single attack skill would break Wang Ran so easily. However, he was not discouraged. It was a fact that Wang Ran could not be defeated, and he never thought of defeating Wang Ran. As long as Wang Ran can be more serious, it will be his victory. Therefore, Kian Daly U did not give up after the ruling of Holy Angel was broken. On the contrary, the sixth spirit ring and the eighth spirit ring outside his body lit up at the same time. Angel's prison, angel trial. Following the use of the two spirit abilities, Wang Ran was directly surrounded by a cage completely transformed into golden light. The prison of angels, control skills, can not only restrict the opponent's actions, but also weaken the opponent's strength by 30%. However, this weakening had no effect on Wang Ran at all. This was caused by the difference in realm for this situation. Kian Daily who also expected, originally, he just wanted to try his luck, if he could weaken the final, it didn't hurt. The prison of angels is useless, and there are angel judgments. Just after the light prison took shape, a giant sword similar to the one just now appeared on Wang Ran's head. It's just that this time the giant sword's attack changed from hacking down to thrusting down. Lifting his head, watching the point of the angel's sword facing downward and thrusting it towards him, Wang Ran gave a soft smile. Although the power is good. It is not much worse than the holy angel decision just now. The holy angel's decision is not a threat to him, let alone the angel's judgment. Therefore, facing the falling angel's sword, Wang Ran pointed at the sword, and a sharp aura moved toward the angel's sword. In the next second, the angel's sword was directly divided into two halves and slowly dissipated in the air. Even the light prison around Wang Ran was directly torn apart and turned into light spots and dissipated. Chapter 407 Blood Abuse Part 2 Seeing this scene, Kian Daily U couldn't help being silent. Wang Ran was really too strong, so strong that even if he tried his best, he couldn't find anything at all. Moreover, now he has been launching attacks by himself and Wang Ran is just tactics. Although it verified Wang Ran's strength and his own weakness, he didn't feel any pressure at all. This situation is not what he wants to see. Therefore, Kian Daily U did not choose to continue to attack, but seriously said, My lord, I know that I may not be your opponent. I still hope that you can do your best instead of accompany me to feed. Hearing Kian Daily's request, Wang Ran gave him a deep look. Do you try your best, if you count it seriously? He has never tried his best since he reached the shadow rank on the plain of Naruto. To be honest, he doesn't even know how strong he is now. After a moment of silence, Wang Ran slowly said, In this case, it is as you wish. But, I hope your Dao heart will not collapse. Wang Ran did not refuse. The only thing he was worried about now was that Kian Daily U would collapse due to excessive pressure. At that time, no matter how good his talents and opportunities are, Kian Daily U will be abandoned. However, this is all Kian Dahlia's own request. Even if there is an accident, he can only bear it. Dot. Kian Daily U nodded solemnly when he heard Wang Ran's words. He didn't speak, but the high spirit and strong energy fluctuations in Kian Dahlia's body all showed that he was ready. Upon seeing this, Wang Ran sighed inwardly, and did not say much, but quickly mobilized the energy that had been condensed into liquid in his body. At the same time, the invisible law also showed its power under Wang Ran's mobilization. The aura on Wang Ran's body reached its peak almost in an instant. The terrifying coercion, even if Wang Ran had constrained, still caused Kian Daily Yu who faced Wang Ran to tremble uncontrollably. It's terrible, it's terrible. This is Kian Daily's only thought in his heart at this time. Just a little pressure from this leak made Kian Daily Yu feel like he was about to explode. At this moment, his soul can no longer control his body at all. The soul power in the body could not be mobilized at all. He wanted to open his mouth and say that he had given up, but his body and soul were out of touch, making him tremble involuntarily. If you want to speak, you can't do this behavior. However, 
Wang Ran did not stop his movements because of the trembling of Kian Dahlia's body. The right palm quickly shot out, and in an instant, a palm phantom composed entirely of energy and law was shot out quickly towards Kian Dahlia around this palm phantom. The entire space was torn apart, revealing patches of pitch black voids. However, Kian Dahlia, who faced this attack, felt that her entire life had not passed so slowly. In his eyes, the phantom shadow of the palm played by Wang Ran, like a page of paper falling in the air, came towards him lightly. However, with such a light palm, Kian Daily U felt endless horror. It seems that this palm can possess the power of the sky. As long as he touches it, his whole person will turn into flying ash in an instant. The entire world will not leave a trace of his existence. Kian Daily U wanted to avoid and resist. However, he can't control his body at all now. Even if he thought about it again, his body was still as heavy as a mountain. Will die. Definitely will die. Kian Daily U roared crazy in his heart. He tried his best to control his body again. His dream has just started again, and he hasn't found the road yet, so why must he die here? At this moment, Kian Dalia's mental power was burning crazily. He felt that in his entire life, he had never wanted to fight so hard today. Finally, he felt that he could control his body. But everything is too late. Wang Ran's palm has already come to his face. No matter how fast Kian Daily was and how strong his cultivation base was, there was no chance to dodge or resist. Instinctively, Kian Daily closed his eyes and waited for death to come. But after a long time, Kian Daily didn't feel the pain. When he opened his eyes again, the surroundings had already returned to the original. Where is there any trace of the palm shadow? Even the aura and coercion on Wang Ran's body had disappeared. The whole person, like the big brother next door, makes people feel like spring breeze. This situation occurred naturally because Wang Ran stopped. He didn't want to kill Kian Daily U. How could he really hit him with the attack? Just when Wang Ran's palm was about to reach Kian Daily's body, Wang Ran had already recovered. Moreover, under Wang Ran's control, that palm was also in front of Kian Daily U, dissipating completely, without causing any impact on Kian Daily U at all. At this time, Wang Ran looked at Kian Daily U with a slight appreciation in his eyes. Under his pressure, even if it was just a little bit, it was not easy enough for Kian Daily U to break free at the last moment. It can be seen from Kian Daily's performance that Wang Ran's initial worry was completely unnecessary. Not only did Kian Daily's Stauxin not collapse, but because of his experience just now, he had a tendency to move closer. A person with a strong cultivation base is terrifying but not the most terrifying. A person with a strong heart is the most terrifying. In particular, this man with a strong heart also has a strong talent. As long as there is a chance, no one knows where this kind of person will go. Obviously, Kian Daily U belongs to this kind of person. Seeing Kian Daily a slingering fear, Wang Ran withdrew his slightly appreciative gaze, and slowly asked, Now that I have fulfilled your wish, how do you feel? Hearing Wang Ran's voice, Kian Daily U finally recovered, opening his mouth. The residual fear still made him speechless, in other words, there is no idea what to say in that dry mouth. After a long period of time, Kian Daily U squatted and said, Strong. It's really? Too strong, even if it's just the breath that comes out, it still makes me feel like an end is coming. I can feel that the palm of your hand just now will turn into fly ash whenever I rub aside. However, because of the threat of death, I feel like I am a little stronger. Originally, Kian Daily U was still a little stubborn, but in the end, his spirit became excited. Chapter 408 Divine Law Enforcer This was not Kian Dalia's illusion. Although the time passed just now was very short, Kian Dalia's mental energy consumption was extremely terrifying, so he was not aware of his own changes. But Wang Ran was different. Kian Dalia's changes were all in his eyes. Just when Kian Dalia broke through his own coercion, his mental power also broke through the original level. Although it has only improved a bit, it is also a very good start. Therefore, Wang Ran gently nodded towards Kian Daily U, and then said, Your Daoxin hasn't been affected. Hearing that, Kian Daily U nodded seriously. To stabilize his mind, Kian Daily U slowly bowed to Wang Ran. Wang Ran didn't stop him, just watched silently. After Kian Daily U got up, he slowly spoke to Wang Ran, Thank you, predecessors, for your help today. Kian Daily U will remember it in his heart. Today, I won't bother seniors. If seniors needed in the future, let them give their orders and will do their best. After finishing speaking, Kian Daily U turned around, preparing to leave the college. But at this moment, Wang Ran suddenly said, Three years later, Zhang Men will officially join the WTO to recruit disciples. If you don't find a chance to make a breakthrough, then come and try. After saying this, 
Wang Ran did not continue to speak. The reason why Qian Dali U was invited was not only his recognition of Qian Dalia's talent and strength, but also his appreciation for himself. Of course, if Qian Dali U did not choose to seize this opportunity, Wang Ran would not be disappointed. At best he would be a little emotional. Seeing Qian Dali U who turned around to say something, Wang Ran waved his hand gently to stop him. Upon seeing this, Qian Dali U just glanced at Wang Ran deeply and didn't say much. He bowed to Wang Ran again turned around and disappeared in place. At the same time, near Duluo Star, somewhere unknown in the universe, a tall man was standing in the void holding a blood-stained sword. Not far from him, a corpse was lying in the cold universe. The man's name is Ross, one of the law enforcers under the of law enforcement Shura, a second level mansion. His mission on this trip is precisely the offender who has turned into a corpse. After three years of hunting, he was formally beheaded. However, just as he was about to return to the god realm, he suddenly felt a strange wave of fluctuations erupting from not far away. Fluctuations are born suddenly and disappear quickly. However, because the distance was too close, this wave of fluctuation was still caught by Rose. After feeling this fluctuation, Rose now closed his eyes directly on the spot. Divine sense is working at full force, searching for the strange fluctuation just now. Soon, he set the goal. Slowly opening his eyes. Rose looked at the dark universe with a thoughtful look in his eyes. If you remember correctly, it should be Duluo Crossing. The new offender. The breath of the law, but fortunately, the breath is not too strong. Since you were hit by me, you can only blame yourself for bad luck. Rose muttered in a low voice. After saying that, there were horrible fluctuations in Rose's body, and the whole person instantly disappeared in place, moving quickly towards Duluo Crossing. Naturally, Wang Ran had no idea about these. At this moment, he looked at Kian Dalia's leaving figure, waved his hand gently, and directly lifted the magic circle that had enveloped the entire back mountain. Then he took Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong, strolling slowly in the academy, walking on the road. Li Ying gave Wang Ran a sneaky glance from time to time. Wang Ran naturally saw Li Ying's small actions. With a helpless smile, Wang Ran suddenly said, Xiao, what's the matter with you? What are you doing sneakily? When asked by Wang Ran, Li Ying paused subconsciously. In the next second, his face suddenly became a little ruddy. After all, he was a child and couldn't control his own inner affairs at all. Coupled with the fact that Wang Ran took the initiative to mention it, Li Ying took two quick steps, followed Wang Ran and said with an expectant expression, Master, when can I absorb the spirit ring? Seeing Li Ying's appearance, Wang Ran said jokingly, Why, is this envious? Hearing Wang Ran's joking voice, Although Li Ying was a little embarrassed, he nodded honestly and said, I am a little envious. Upon hearing this, Wang Ran rubbed Li Ying's head gently. Li Ying can understand this feeling. It's like having Bosch arm but not moving. A child can India temperament. It is already very good. You don't need to be envious. You will be able to absorb the spirit ring after a while. At that time, your starting point will be much higher than others. Wang Ran said softly, regarding the nature of the spirit ring. His body in the depths of the Stardew Great Forest had already been studied. In a few days, you can officially start as long as the artificial spirit ring. Although for the people on Duluo continent, the spirit ring is very mysterious. But when the realm really transcended this world, and then looked back at the spirit ring, it was actually the same. The reason why Wang Ran took such a long time was that it was his first contact with spirit rings. Dot. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Li Ying's face instantly showed a joyful smile. Since Wang Ran said that, the time ahead would certainly not be too long. Nodded heavily, Li Ying let out a hum. Suddenly, Li Ying's walking pace became lighter. Feeling Li Ying's joy, even Ning Rong Rong's mood improved a, a lot. Looking at the two little guys jumping around, Wang Ran also had a smile on his face. Dot. Before long, Kian Ren Xiu also came back. It took a lot of time for the four people to watch the college. At this time, Wang Ran had almost thought about the college arrangements in his mind. At the same time, the sky was already dark. Wang Ran wanted to let a few people go to rest, but before he could say anything, his face suddenly became serious. He noticed that a strong outrageous energy fluctuation suddenly descended on Duluo continent. It was not Kian Dalia's kind of strong, but a real strong on the same level as Wang Ran. Even if you simply look at the energy base, Wang Ran himself is a little different from him. The divine residence is definitely the divine residence of this plane. Wang Ran frowned slightly and whispered in his heart. And he is very sure that the target of this mansion is likely to be him. Although it is not clear why the god realm can find itself so quickly, these are no longer important. Chapter 409 Catch it? The top priority now is to make it clear whether this person's goal is himself. If it is his own, 
What is the attitude of the gods? Seeing Wang Ran who was smiling just now, his expression suddenly became serious, and even frowned slightly. Gain Renxiu, who has always been delicate in mind, quickly asked, Master, has something happened? There was no expected response. After hearing Kian Renxiu's words, Wang Ran just raised his head slightly and looked towards the distant sky. Seeing Wang Ran's behavior, his three disciples were a little confused, not knowing what happened to Wang Ran. At this moment, Wang Ran suddenly said, coming, sure enough, is the target oneself. Wang Ran didn't say much, he just thought to himself in his heart, coming, what's coming? Gain Renxiu and others, who were already puzzled, were even more confused by Monk Zhang Er's words, by Wang Ran's words. However, they soon knew the answer, because, within a few seconds, a figure suddenly appeared in the sky. The next second, the figure suddenly appeared in front of several people, looking at the man in armor, holding a big sword tall, and resolute face floating in the air, except Wang Ran, Kian Renxiu and others felt depressed, even the breathing is not smooth, upon seeing this, Wang Ran gently pulled several people behind him, blocking the coercion of this unknown divine residence, standing behind Wang Ran, Kian Renxiu felt that the depression just now disappeared, however, if their nervous mood has not disappeared, it was the first time they saw Wang Ran showing such a serious expression, I'm afraid that Wang Ran can only be treated like this by being at the same level as him, is it also a divine residence, such a thought flashed through the hearts of several people in Kian Renxiu, looking at the unknown divine residence, Li Ying asks in a low voice with some worry, King, Master will do nothing, Right? Not only him, but even Ning Rong Rong looked at Kian Renxiu with worry. Although Ning Rong Rong was still young, she knew what was dangerous. Now Wang Ran has no time to control them, and they can only ask Kian Renxiu, who has the most knowledge. Although the older Li Ying knew it, even if he asked Kian Renxiu, it was nothing. Kian Renxiu felt a little headache for Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong's worries. She was not a god, but she had a little bit more knowledge than Li Ying, so how could she know these things? However, Kian Renxiu shook her head gently, and said to Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong, Don't worry, the master is so strong, there must be nothing wrong with it. Hearing Kian Renxiu's words, Li Ying remained silent, but Ning Rong Rong relaxed. She didn't have so much thought, and directly believed Kian Renxiu's words. At this moment, Rose floating in midair suddenly said, You really are not the divine mansion of the god realm, even I can't understand your details. From the way you look, you should have discovered me a long time ago. You didn't even run which makes me look different, you know, other violators found us, but few dared to stay in place, however, although you don't know where you are, since you violated the rules, you can only accept trial, hearing Rose's words, Wang Ran glanced at him calmly, and then said at the beginning, run, why should I run, I didn't commit a crime, as the saying goes, whether it's a blessing or a curse, or avoiding misfortune, I want to see what you are going to do, but having said that, is your god realm so arbitrary? Seeing the process without asking, just draw a conclusion. For Wang Ran's question, although Rose didn't want to answer, but he couldn't help it. He had already gone through a battle, and he hadn't returned to his heyday after he was on the road. Although it's only a little too close, Rose is also a cautious man. To be able to return to the state of heyday, it is natural to return to the state of heyday. Therefore, facing Wang Ran's words, although Rose did not want to answer, he still said, the rules are not allowed to be trampled on. If you trample on the rules, it is a crime. Since you have violated the rules, as a law enforcer under the gods of the gods, my task is to bring you back to the gods. As for your crime, the god realm committee will naturally make a verdict. Upon hearing Rose's words, Wang Ran gave a disdainful smile, and then said, Trample the rules, I want to hear, what rules did I trample on? Hearing Wang Ran's words, Rose did not hesitate, and said directly, stay in the human world privately and affect the balance of the human world is one of them, it is not recorded in the god realm and poses a great security risk, this is the second, both are serious sins, what rules do you say you trampled on, hearing this, Wang Ran was speechless, what overlord clauses are these, forget the first one, what the is the second one, why, apart from your god realm, the entire plane cannot have a second god mansion power, frowning slightly, Wang Ran stared at Rose and said, it seems that you are determined to arrest me. Hearing this, Rose's eyes narrowed slightly, staring at Wang Ran and slowly speaking. Yes, you have only one destiny, and that is to be arrested by me and go to the God Realm for trial. You are not my opponent, so in order to avoid indifferent casualties, you'd better catch it with your hands. In this way, your crime can be lighter. Catch with nothing? 
Wang Ran laughed disdainfully when he heard Rose's words. He also has a very headache now. Rose is just a muscle, it's hard to get in. He determined that Wang Ran was guilty and wanted to bring him back to the God Realm. I don't know whether he is so stubborn by himself or the entire God Realm is so stubborn, but it seems that the entire God Realm looks like this bird. This makes people very speechless. It would be good if they had the ability to talk to the entire God Realm. But Wang Ran's current strength was obviously insufficient. I haven't heard Ross say that he is just an enforcer under the law enforcement of the gods. The top of the sky, it is a second level divine residence. But that's it. His strength is still similar to Wang Ran. If this were to come to a first level divine residence, it would surely be able to crush Wang Ran, let alone the law enforcement of the gods or even the king. It's impossible to go to God Realm with Ross. It is impossible for Wang Ran to overwhelm his own destiny over the God Realm's attitude towards him. If he really did that, then he would be really an Iron Man. So, looking at Rose's serious look, Wang Ran slowly said, In that case, let me see how good you are. Chapter 410 Wang Ran's plan Hearing what Wang Ran said, Rose was not surprised. It was nothing more than a try. Wang Ran agreed to be better, and it was expected that he would not agree. Nodding indifferently, Rose slowly said, In that case, don't blame me for being impolite. I'm waiting for you on it. After speaking, Rose slowly raised the big sword in his hand, and his whole body instantly rushed into the sky. It is impossible to do it on the ground, and Rose is not sure to take Wang Ran in one fell swoop. The aftermath of the battle between the two divine residences can cause terrible damage. Such a price, even Ross, will be punished after returning to the gods. Wang Ran is naturally aware of this point. He also didn't want to destroy the Duluo continent, so after Rose flew into the air, Wang Ran turned and spoke softly to his three disciples. You wait here, he'll be back soon. After speaking, Wang Ran burst into an astonishing aura instantly. The whole person turned directly into a streamer rushing towards Rose in the air, boom, with a muffled noise, Rose's big sword smashed directly into Wang Ran's palm, a dazzling light burst out of the originally dim sky, this kind of movement directly attracted the attention of everyone in several cities near Tanda city on the ground, subconsciously, everyone raised their heads and looked into the sky, even in the house, they all walked out of the house, wanting to see what happened, however, the height of the battle between Wang Ran and Rose was too high, even if it was a contra, it couldn't be real, let alone ordinary people. Dot. At this moment, on the sky battlefield, Wang Ran, who had fought with Rose, retreated several hundred meters before forcibly stabilizing his figure. On the other hand, Ross simply retreated a distance of tens of meters. Seeing Rose raising the big sword again, Wang Ran also had a general guess about the strength gap between the two. In terms of strength, Rose's strength is definitely above Wang Ran's clone, but compared with Wang Ran's body, there is not much difference. Thinking of this, Wang Ran also had a general plan in his heart. Rose must stay, if he is allowed to return to the God Realm, he will definitely face the siege of the entire God Realm. With Wang Ran's current strength alone, it is impossible to cope with this situation. But if you kill Rose, that doesn't work either. By the means of the gods, if Ross died, they would definitely know. So now there is only one way left, and that is to capture Rose alive. In this case, at least it can be delayed for a while. Although this period of time may not be too long, it is better than nothing. However, this is indeed the most difficult choice. It is always more difficult to capture a person alive than to kill a person directly. After making the decision, Wang Ran did not head head to head with Rose. Although it was only a clone, Wang Ran naturally wanted to use this clone to consume Ross to the greatest extent based on the principle of making the best use of everything. Therefore, Wang Ran did not take the initiative to attack at this time, but stared at Rose closely waiting for his next attack. Rose was not surprised by Wang Ran's choice. He couldn't find out that Wang Ran was a clone. In his heart, Wang Ran was much weaker than him. Although it is stronger than most third level divine residences, it is still far away from him. Moreover, his purpose is also to capture the opponent alive, so naturally he has to attack with all his strength. Slowly raising the big sword in his hand, Rose swept directly, a huge sword at energy flew directly towards Wang Ran. This sword aura, even ordinary people on the ground, can clearly see it. When Wang Ran faced the sword energy that Rose swept out, his eyes flashed slightly, and his figure instantly became blurred. The next moment, Wang Ran disappeared in place, and when he appeared again, he had already come to the other side of Rao's. The sword energy that did not hit the target also burst in the distance, causing a roar. Ross was not surprised that Wang Ran was able to avoid this attack. The only thing that surprised him was Wang Ran's use of the law of space. However, 
the accident was an accident, as early as the moment when he swung his sword aura, Rose was ready for the next attack, I saw Rose's figure quickly disappearing in place, and the next moment, a big sword beside Wang Ran slashed at him fiercely, sky shaking, Wang Ran's complexion remained unchanged, and he slapped Rose fiercely, the palm print and the big sword slammed together, and a storm erupted fiercely, the attack was blocked, Rose did not stop, flipping his wrist, and stabbing another sword, naturally, Wang Ran couldn't be hit so easily, every time Rose's attack was attacked, he easily resisted it, although it consumes more than Ross, but the two of them are you and me, and they fight back and forth, both of them attacked very fast, but within a few moments, they had already fought hundreds of times, the aftermath of the battle made the entire sky gloomy, at this time, the humans on the ground all looked at the sky with serious expressions, completely unclear of what happened, but this scene like the doomsday made everyone's hearts extremely depressed, dot. In the palace of Heavender City, Emperor Xi stood in the courtyard, looking at the sky with a serious face, he was also a spirit master, and he could see that this scene was caused by two extremely powerful beings, however, the clearer he is, the more depressed his heart is, can such a scene of battle really be caused by humans, and why did the two sides of the fight start fighting, after the battle, will Tender City become their next target, all of this is an unknown number for Emperor Xi, Uncle Emperor, can you tell who are the two parties in the fight, Xi asked in a low voice, beside him, an old man with grey hair was also solemn, he is Emperor Xi's uncle Xi Yun, who has always lived in the palace to guard the safety of the royal family, if it weren't for his enthusiasm for cultivation and his unwillingness to participate in imperial politics, the position of the emperor might not have fallen into the hands of his father Xi, however, it was precisely because of this that he was able to become an 86th level soul contra, the most powerful soul master in the entire heaven do imperial family, however, even he couldn't see anything at all, even the fighting figures of Wang Ran and Rose could not be seen clearly, slowly shook his head, and Xi Yun said solemnly, it's too strong, I can't see their movements at all, I suspect that they are beyond the scope of human beings, chapter 411 alternate graduate hearing Xi Yuan's words, Emperor Xi's face changed drastically, someone looked at the snowy field in disbelief, the Emperor Xi asked in shock, it's beyond the scope of human beings, Uncle Emperor, you mean those two are, gods, Xui Yun nodded solemnly when he heard Xie's words, he had also seen the battle between title Duluo, but compared to the present, it was almost like a family, seeing Xui Yun nodded, Xie's expression was a bit sluggish, Shindi, he had only heard of it in legends, but he didn't expect to see it today, moreover, I still saw two divine residences in battle, Uncle Emperor, what do you say their purpose is, what impact will it have on our heaven do, Xui whispered in a low voice, her sluggish face didn't know what she was thinking, Xui Yun only shook his head solemnly when he heard Xui's words, looking at the still fighting in the sky, he whispered, who knows, but in any case, this is not something we can intervene, what we can do now is just waiting, Xui Yuan's words seemed to be answering Xui, and they seemed to be telling myself, when Xui heard what Xui Yun said, Xui also nodded, raised his head to look towards the sky, and fell silent, this kind of scene not only happened to Xi, Yuhan Hall, Blue Lightning Tyrant Dragon Sect, Kibao Glaze Glass Sect, every power or individual who has the strength to observe this scene is reappearing this scene, it's just that the Kibao Yulai Sect and Kian Daily Yu who had been in contact with Wang Ran already had some guesses in their hearts, dot. At this time in the sky battlefield, the battle between Wang Ran and Ross had also entered a white hot stage, because neither of them had any plans to keep their hands, the consumption of Wang Ran's clone was already huge, of course, Ross consumption is not small, but at this time Rose's view of Wang Ran has completely changed, in the battle just now, Rose became more and more frightened, because Wang Ran's performance was completely different from that of ordinary divine residences, although his control of the laws was not as good as him, and it was even inferior to ordinary three level divine residences, however, Wang Ran can control too many laws, not only that, but his various methods are also emerging in endlessly, it's as if there is no end at all, far inferior to his strength, Wang Ran actually did not want to get up and down with him by virtue of these endless rules and methods, boom, after another blow, the two separated in an instant, after the separation, the two stood in the air and looked at each other, seeing Wang Ran who was panting, Rose's face showed a look of admiration, although he was a little panting, he was far better than Wang Ran, at this time, Rose shouldn't actually stop, only by continuing to attack without leaving Wang Ran a chance to breathe can he further expand his advantage, however, 
Rose did not choose to do so. He has always admired the strong, although Wang Ran's cultivation base is not as good as his, but this method alone has been approved by him. Putting down the big sword of the mobile phone, Rose said to Wang Ran with a serious face, You are a respectable opponent and you are qualified to know my name. Listen, I am the second level law enforcement officer of the Shura, the of law enforcement in the realm of God, Ross. I know you are at the end of the battle, but in order to show respect for you, I will still use my strongest blow. If you die, it will be fine. If you persist and wait to return to the God realm, I will personally intercede with Lord Shura and ask him to protect you. After finishing speaking, Rose's momentum continued to rise, and the giant sword in his hand also showed a scarlet light. Staring at Wang Ran, at this time, only Wang Ran's figure remained in Ross's eyes, and Wang Ran also felt a threat of death at this time. He could feel that his figure had been locked by Rose. Even the surrounding space has been blocked by Ross. With Wang Ran's control over the laws of space, it is impossible for him to break through Ross's blockade of space. Therefore, it is impossible for Wang Ran to hide from Ross's attack. However, Wang Ran at this time can already be said to be the end of the battle. If you insist on this attack, there is a great possibility that you will die. However, there was no trace of fear in Wang Ran's expression. On the contrary, there was a mysterious smile on his face. Is Wang Ran happy? Naturally happy. This is just a clone, the effect has been maximized. Moreover, it also led to Rose's strongest attack, which can be said to be a big profit. Although Rose's last performance made Wang Ran very much admired. However, this did not change his decision. At most, be nice to him then. Dot. This mysterious smile of Wang Ran was naturally seen by Rose. Although there was something wrong in his heart, it was already at this point and Rose couldn't stop. Therefore, Rose's attacks are still accumulating. It wasn't until Rose's body and power above the big sword reached a peak, the surrounding space became a bit distorted and fragmented, and Rose finally swung a sword in his hand. Zura, trial. This originated from the tricks of God Shura, which was swung fiercely from Rose's sword. Although it is far from the height of the Avshura, in the second level divine residence, there is absolutely no solution. It is really because of this trick that Rose can stand out among the many law enforcers. A terrifying sword light waved from Rose's big sword. As Jiang Wen passed, even the space was cut open. After this sword, even Rose's complexion became a little pale. Dot. With the swing of this sword, Wang Ran already knew that with the little remaining power of his clone, it was impossible to withstand this attack. However, Wang Ran did not wait to die. The few energy in the body quickly mobilized, and Wang Ran quickly slapped a palm in the direction where the sword light came from. There are countless runes in the huge palm prints, flying towards the sword light with the aura of death. With the shot of this palm, Wang Ran's clone became a little illusory, as if it would disappear at any time. However, in just an instant, that powerful palm print was torn apart by Jiang Wen. Unabated, the sword light quickly enveloped Wang Ran's figure. As the sword light disappeared, the chaotic space around it gradually returned to stability. Everything returned to the appearance of calm and calm, and Wang Ran's figure disappeared in place, as if nothing happened. However, Rose felt something wrong in his heart. He couldn't tell what was wrong. Chapter 412 The battle is over. Ontology debut floating in the air. Rose frowned in confusion. Do you died? Rose's heart murmured, seeing where Wang Ran disappeared. Rose stood there for a long time without moving. Dot. In the same way, as the sky returned to calmness, countless humans on the earth were guessing the outcome of this battle. At the Taoist Institute, Li Ying has been nervously watching the changing scenes above the sky. As the sky returned to calm, Li Ying said worriedly, Is it over? King, did you say Master One? Hearing Li Ying's question, Kian Renxiu shook her head solemnly. Do not know. Although she said that, Kian Renxiu felt a little flustered in her heart. The battle is over. If Wang Ran wins. Why doesn't he come back? Could it be that Wang Ran lost? Thinking of this possibility, Kian Renxiu felt a little uncomfortable. Although she has many thoughts, from another aspect, she is also the simplest person, especially in dealing with emotional issues. Although only a few days ago with Wang Ran, the time to get along with him was not long. But from Wang Ran's body, Kian Renxiu really felt the concern from her elders. This kind of care gave her an indescribable feeling in her heart. Since childhood, apart from Kian Daily U, Wang Ran can be said to be the one who cared about her most. But now, thinking that Wang Ran might fail and be arrested, or even lost on the spot, Kian Renxiu felt a panic in her heart. Even the brain, which is usually so calm, can't calm down. In the same way, Li Ying is not a fool. What Kian Renxiu could think of, he had already guessed. Moreover, the time he spent with Wang Ran was much longer than Kian Renxiu's, and his relationship was deeper. However, 
wrong guesses fall into guesses, but they can't believe it or say it, not to mention anything else, it was because of the little Lolita waiting eagerly behind them, they couldn't tell the worst guess, therefore, after Kian Renxiu's voice fell, the two did not speak again, but stared at the sky closely, praying silently for Wang Ran in their hearts, pray for nothing, pray for him to defeat a powerful enemy, dot. Not only Wang Ran's three disciples, but in the Kibao Glazed Tile sect of Kibao City not far from Danda City, Ning Fengzi also looked at the sky with doubts, beside him, the two superpowers, Bone Duluo and Sword Duluo, also looked up silently at the sky, Uncle Bone, Uncle Jian, do you think one of those two is really Senior Wang Ran? Ning Fengzi once again asked Bone Duluo and Jian Duluo, although the three had already discussed this matter before, but the worry in his heart still made Ning Fengzi couldn't help but ask again, there is no way not to worry, Ning Rong Rong has already been apprenticed to Wang Ran, and it can be said that the Seven Treasure Glazed Tile School is already a comrade in the trench with Wang Ran, if Wang Ran is really fighting again and the battle is still lost, then can their Seven Treasure Glazed Tile sect survive a catastrophe, both Bone Duluo and Sword Duluo knew Ning Feng's worries, however, they were not sure whether Wang Ran existed among the two fighting, it is even more unclear, if it is really Wang Ran, what the result will be, therefore, after hearing Ning Feng's question, Bone Duluo and Jian Duluo could only look at each other, and then comforted, sect master, although it is very likely that there will be senior Wang Ran on both sides of the battle, senior Wang Ran will not necessarily lose, hey, hearing the comfort of Bone Duluo and Sword Duluo, Ning Fengzi could only sigh in a low voice, and then continued, help so, after speaking, Ning Fengzi was not ready to wait any longer, took a deep look at the direction of Tanda City, and said solemnly to Sword Duluo, Uncle Jian, believe this to you, go to Heaven to City as soon as possible to find out the news, understood, Zong, before Jian Duluo's words fell, the sky that had just calmed down for a while suddenly burst out with a dazzling golden beam of light, Jin Lun reincarnated, this attack was naturally issued by Wang Ran, but the power of this golden wheel reincarnation explosion was more than a little bit different from the golden wheel reincarnation explosion of the Naruto plane, it was simply the difference between cloud and mud, at this time, Rose in the sky also changed a lot, he just felt something wrong, staying in place and preparing to carefully sense what went wrong, however, no matter how he probed, he couldn't find the problem, just when he was about to give up and return to the god realm, the surrounding space fluctuated again, immediately afterwards, a golden beam of light rushed towards him with a destructive aura, without any defense, he suddenly felt shocked, he could sense the strong law of gravity from above the golden beam of light, moreover, the light beam itself also contains terrifying energy, if he was hit in the body, even he would be seriously injured instantly, therefore, Rose did not dare to be careless at all, the energy in the body was circling so fast that Rose didn't even think about it, so he held the giant sword in front of him, in the next instant, the beam of light immediately hit the body of the huge sword in Rose's hand, accompanied by the violent explosion, Rose's figure followed the beam of light and flew directly away for a distance of several kilometers, when the beam of light disappeared, a shallow crack had appeared on the giant sword in Rose's hand, not only that, but a mouthful of blood spewed out of Rose's air, this is, is there a helper, Rose wiped the blood from the corner of his mouth, although he spouted a bit of blood, Rose suffered only a minor injury and did not hurt the root cause, compared with this injury, what made Rose feel more distressed was that his weapon was damaged, although it's just a shallow crack, if you want to repair it, the cost is absolutely huge, however, he didn't have the mind to think about it at this time, at this moment, the thought of Wang Ran and a helper flashed through his mind, however, as Rose fixed his eyes, the resistance from that attack, where was Wang Ran's helper, only one Wang Ran, who was determined by Rose to be wiped out, floated peacefully in the air, if there is any difference, it is that Wang Ran now holds a weapon similar to a staff in his hand, and his aura has increased several times, ow, oh, that's not right, Wang Ran really has it if he wants to say a helper, however, this helper was not here to help Wang Ran deal with Rose, but to travel with Wang Ran to the mainland and take care of the children, that's right, Wang Ran's helper is Datong Mahuii, although Datong Mahuii could be called a divine residence on this plane, it was still quite different from Wang Ran and Ross, chapter 413 fight Ross again at this time, Datong Mahuii, who had come over with Wang Ran, was in the Taoist Academy, feeling helplessly comforting Wang Ran's three disciples, Datong Mahuii, who came with Wang Ran, did not fight Ross with Wang Ran, instead, under Wang Ran's sign, he came directly to the Taoist Academy, in front of the three little guys, seeing the woman who suddenly appeared next to her, 
especially this woman who was still so strange in appearance, the three little guys instantly had their hearts beating, and at the same time they were also instantly alert. Gain Renxu and Li Ying directly protected Ning Rong Rong behind them. Who are you? Gain Renxu and Li Ying frowned at the same time, staring at the figure of Datong Mahuai, and their bodies directly assumed a defensive posture. What they worry most now is that Datong Mahuai is an accomplice of the mysterious divine residence at the beginning. But fortunately, at this time Wang Ran had also launched the Golden Wheel reincarnation detonation so that Kian Renxu and the others knew that Wang Ran had not failed. Seeing the alertness of the three little guys, Datong Mahuai barely smiled to release his kindness, and then said, You are the disciples of the sect master, don't be afraid, I am also a Zangman. Although he is smiling, because he is not very good at expressing feelings, especially when the target is still a few children, Otsuki Teruya's smile feels awkward. But facing Wang Ran's three disciples, Datong Mahuai still wanted to express his kindness. Therefore, there will be such a scene. But the smile is awkward and not awkward. Kian Renxu 3 will not care. What they care about is the message conveyed in Datong Mahuai's words. After hearing Datong Mahuai's words, Ning Rong Rong ran directly in front of Datong Mahuai under the protection of Kian Renxu and Li Ying. Seeing this scene, Kian Renxu and Li Ying were shocked. Just now, because they were digesting Datong Mahuai's words, the two didn't notice Ning Rong Rong in time. At this moment, when Ning Rong Rong ran directly in front of Datong Mahuai, the two of them frowned. The matter has not been determined yet, although Datong Mahuai said that she and herself and others are in the same group, but what if? Therefore, Kian Renxu and Li Ying hurriedly said, Rong Rong, come back quickly. However, Ning Rong Rong simply ignored the calls of the two. After running in front of Datong Mahuai, Ning Rong Rong's little hand directly grabbed Datong Mahuai's skirt and said with some excitement, Big sister, go and help master beat the bad guys. Being pulled by Ning Rong Rong like this, Datong Mahuai's body instantly stiffened. She was not the kind of character who is good at communication, otherwise she would not have been driven to ruin by her two sons. Faced with a little guy like Ning Rong Rong, she didn't even know what to do. However, Datong Mahuai's inner feelings are very delicate, and he loves a child like Ning Rong Rong with a pure mind. Therefore, as soon as Ning Rong Rong held him like that, Dia Tongma instantly didn't know what to do. There was also a trace of flustered expression in his eyes. If Wang Ran saw this scene, he would definitely be surprised for a while. Fortunately, Wang Ran is not here. And his three disciples couldn't see anything in Datong Mahuai's white eyes. After hesitating for a long time, Datong Mahuai's mouth just popped out. It's okay, the master can handle it. She really didn't know how to comfort these three little guys and make them feel at ease. However, with Datong Mahuai's words, Kian Renxu's hearts became quite stable. Although they were still vigilant, Kian Renxu and Li Ying had already believed in Datong Mahuai's identity. Dot. Looking back on the sky battlefield, Rose, who was injured by Wang Ran's blow, looked at Wang Ran in disbelief. How come, how can you be safe and sound, and you are so much stronger? Rose's shocked voice rang in Wang Ran's ear. Wang Ran smiled relaxedly at Ross's shock. However, he didn't mean to explain. Although his senses for us were pretty good, Wang Ran would not forget the theorem that the villain died of a lot of talk. Although he does not consider himself a villain, he will not make such a mistake. Without pause, Wang Ran held an injured refined from Naruto world in one hand, and headed towards Rose a golden wheel reincarnation explosion. After such a long time, the quality of the ninja rod after Wang Ran's warmth is very good. Moreover, because of the existence of the reincarnation I, the ninja rod itself contains many laws of power. Using him as an attack weapon not only can increase the power of the attack, but also save a lot of effort. At the same time as Jin Lun reincarnation exploded, Wang Ran's other hand did not relax. A large number of formation runes hit Wang Ran's hands, forming a chain of mysterious fluctuations in the air. As Wang Ran launched an attack, Rose's expression instantly became serious. Wang Ran didn't open his mouth to explain to him, this was what he expected. But the crux of the problem now is that his current state is very bad. If it were his heyday, his face would certainly not be so solemn. But it doesn't work now. Wang Ran has become stronger, not to mention, his current strength has been weakened a lot. In this state, his odds of winning have been greatly reduced. And most importantly, because the weapon was damaged, his assassin was no longer available. Because once the strongest attack is used, the damaged sword will definitely shatter on the spot. It would be okay if he could destroy the enemy with a single move, but if it didn't work, Rose, who relied on a big sword for most of his strength, was definitely not Wang Ran's opponent. At this point, 
Rose's heart has come to a conclusion. Facing Wang Ran's golden reincarnation explosion, Rose did not choose to hardwire, but chose to temporarily avoid the edge. With a dodge, Rose directly avoided the reincarnation explosion that came straight in. However, how could Wang Ran let him go so easily? As Rose escaped the impact of the Golden Wheel reincarnation explosion, Wang Ran smiled slightly on his face. As the arm turned, the beam of Golden Wheel reincarnation exploded like a sharp sword, leaning toward Rose's body. Rose frowned. He didn't expect that this type of attack could be controlled like this. How strong this person's divine power is. Even in a dangerous situation, Rose still sighed with emotion. However, with emotion and emotion, Rose directly blasted towards Jin Lun reincarnation and swept a sword. It's too late to hide, so I can only do it. Chapter 414 Beat Rose Although Rose's strength has been depleted to a certain extent, no matter how much he is able to become a second level mansion for law enforcement. Although Wang Ran's Golden Wheel reincarnation explosive power is not bad, it is impossible to win Rose just by this trick. Sure enough. As Ross swept out a sword, the terrifying sword light directly collided with the Golden Wheel reincarnation burst. At this moment, the originally dim sky suddenly brightened like daylight. However, this light comes fast and goes fast. But within a short time, the two attacks dissipated in the air. After breaking up Wang Ran's attack, Rose had no idea of continuing to fight. On the contrary, the energy in Rose's body exploded and instantly fleed into the distance. How could Wang Ran allow Rose to escape? He had been prepared for this situation. I saw that chain of formation runes, under Wang Ran's control, rushed towards Rouse. The distance between the two was not far, and the chain only took a few breaths before it got entangled with Rose. For Wang Ran's entanglement, Rose just struggled to resist with a big sword. Although he didn't know what the chain attack was, the mysterious aura exuding from the chain made him dare not physically resist it. He had a hunch in his heart that if he were hit by the chain, something bad would happen. While resisting the entanglement of the chains, Rose also had to guard against Wang Ran's attacks from time to time. This made Ross, who was not a small consumer, even more embarrassed. Over time, Rose has felt that he has fallen into a disadvantage. He knew that he could not continue like this. If Wang Ran continues to consume it like this, he definitely won't have a chance to come back. After gritting his teeth, Rose stared fiercely at Wang Ran's body. Without hesitation, Rose's momentum instantly reached a peak. No longer paying attention to the harassment of the chain, Rose directly placed the big sword in front of him. In the next instant, Rose's body instantly turned into a stream of light and flew towards Wang Ran. The speed is like a meteor, fleeting. Even the chain controlled by Wang Ran could not keep up with Rose's speed. However, Wang Ran did not show fear on his face in response to Rose's attack. Facing the stream of light that Rose turned into, Wang Ran directly raised the ninja rod in his hand toward him. Immediately afterwards, an invisible wave emanated from the ninja rod, rushing towards the streamer of Ross transformation. Under Wang Ran's control, the originally terrifying repulsion almost completely turned into a straight line. Rose in flight as if being rejected by the whole world, instantly stalemate in place. Even because of this impact, Rose's face turned red. Watching this scene, Wang Ran made another effort. In the next moment, Rose only felt the repulsive force facing him, and it soared instantly. The whole person, instantly like a drowning person being shot by the waves, quickly flew out in the direction where he came. At this time, the rune chain had come to Rose's side under Wang Ran's control. Rose did not dare to underestimate this, he wanted to resist with his big sword. But how could Wang Ran give up this opportunity? The repulsive force instantly turned into gravity, causing Rose's figure to instantly lose its balance. Ross did not expect that Wang Ran could actually apply the law of gravity to this point. In other words, even if he can think of it, there is no way to make effective protection in this situation. Unable to control his body shape, the giant sword in Rose's hand was directly sent flying by Wang Ran. Although Rose recalled his weapon almost instantaneously, it was obviously useless. Because the moment Rose's weapon left his hand, the rune chain directly wrapped around Rose's body. In shock, Rose agitated all his powers instantly. But this rune chain is like a liquid. The first time it touches Rose's body, it turns into countless luminous runes and blends into Rose's body. Rose could feel that as these runes entered the body, his divine power flow was greatly hindered, and this is just the moment of entering the body. These runes continuously sealed Rose's divine power rotation. Not careless, Rose tried his best to resist the seal of these runes. However, one step is wrong and one step is wrong. Although Rose has tried his best to resist, but in this kind of emergency situation, at best, he can keep the situation from getting worse. But how could Wang Ran, who was staring at him, 
give up this opportunity. In the next instant, Wang Ran appeared directly next to Rose's body. The great sword that Rose had just summoned to meet was directly controlled by Wang Ran. The artifacts were all psychic, and the big sword held by Wang Ran spontaneously rebelled. But no matter what, weapons are nothing more than weapons, and they are also weapons of the second level divine residence like Rao's. Although Rose's big sword has resisted, it is like a three-year-old child in Wang Ran's hands. Just a thought. A large number of runes directly covered the entire sword body. In the next second, Rose, who was still struggling to resist Wang Ran's seal, felt that the connection between himself and the great sword was abruptly blocked. Puff. With the big sword being sealed, Rose directly spouted a mouthful of blood. This made Ross, who was already difficult, even worse. The physical stamina and divine power instantly rioted, and for a while, it suddenly suppressed the seal of the rune. Not daring to hesitate, Rose turned around as if fleeing. But Rose, who couldn't escape before, how could he escape under Wang Ran's hands at this time? Seeing Wang Ran's heart moved, Rose's big sword was received directly by him from the space in his sleeve. Then holding the ninja rod, he immediately caught up with Rose's fleeing figure. Without hesitation, Wang Ran directly slapped Rose's body with the palm. The huge palm print, like a mountain, directly enveloped Rose. Rose who was already seriously injured, was directly injured by Wang Ran's palm. Under the severe injuries, the rune that had just been suppressed because of the explosion directly launched a fierce offensive, and Rouse, at this time, could no longer resist the power of this seal. Outside, Wang Ran stared at him, and without the seal rune pressing on every step of the way, Rose was deeply plunged into the quagmire, unable to return to heaven. Wang Ran was even more chasing after victory and another rune chain broke into Rose's body. Adding the two together, the divine power in Rose's body was directly sealed by Wang Ran. Chapter 415 200 years with the divine power in the body being sealed, Rose couldn't control his body, and the whole person fell from the air in an instant. At this height, although Rose's body would not be said to be directly killed, it would definitely make his injury further. Regarding this situation, Wang Ran naturally couldn't sit idly by. Therefore, as Rose's body fell from the air, Wang Ran directly stretched out his hand and directly floated Rose's body in the air. After being controlled by Wang Ran, Rose sighed lonely, and then directly gave up resisting. Although he can still attack with his physical and mental power. But Rose also knew that this was just futile. I just don't know, what will Wang Ran do to him? Although Rose is not rebelling, Wang Ran is not too eager to deal with hidden dangers. Although Wang Ran didn't care. He wanted to bring Rose back to the academy after all. What if Ross does not pay attention to Kian Ren Xiu, Li Ying or Ning Rong Rong? Therefore, after Rose gave up resistance, Wang Ran shot again, directly sealing Rose's mental power. As for the physical body, there is really no way, compared with ordinary people, Rose's body has undergone a qualitative change. If you don't want to hurt Rose and you want to restrict his body, you can only directly seal his actions. But Wang Ran can't say. Just turn Rose into a living dead. If the brain is conscious but the body can't move, this kind of life is simply better than death. However, if only physical power is used, it is impossible to cause any storms. After being sealed by Wang Ran's mental power, Rose also knew that Wang Ran would not kill him. He sighed in relief, although he had lived for many years, he was not afraid of death. But no matter what, Rose didn't want to die so easily. Rose, who was relieved also accepted his fate of being captured alive. Looking at Wang Ran calmly, Rose said, Even though you defeated me, I still want to persuade you that you should come back to the gods and confess your sins with me. Although your strength is not weak, compared with the god realm, it is still far from enough. In the entire god realm, there are no fewer than hundreds of second level divine residences with my strength alone. Not to mention the second level divine residence that is stronger than me, even the first level divine residence and king. Although you can defeat me, but facing the entire god realm. Having said that, Rose shook his head gently. He didn't finish what he said, but Wang Ran also understood what he meant. With a light smile at Rose, Wang Ran asked seriously, You said, if I really went to the gods, how would those gods punish me? Hearing this, Rose froze slightly. He didn't understand Wang Ran's thoughts, but he still replied seriously, if you have a good attitude, you will at most abandon your cultivation. Abandon the cultivation base and still have a good attitude. Wang Ran shook his head with a chuckle, and couldn't see his inner thoughts on his face. Rose heard this and thought that Wang Ran was worrying about defeating himself. So he said seriously, if you are worried about defeating me just now, then you don't have to be afraid. My mission goal this time is someone else. Although I accidentally discovered your existence, 
No one in the entire God realm knows about you except me. Moreover, I will help you intercede, not to say that you will really be abolished and cultivated. Rose's words are very sincere, and it can be seen that he is completely sincere and not for anything else. He really admired Wang Ran's strength. And from Wang Ran's body, there was no evil aura. At the very least, this proved that Wang Ran was not a heinous person. Although Rose said seriously, Wang Ran's attention was not here at all. After hearing Rose's words, Wang Ran's brain was spinning fast. Ross Goal is someone else. No one knows his existence except Ross God Realm. With that said, I still have a lot of time. Moreover, even if Ross was killed, the God Realm would subconsciously think that Ross' mission had failed. Do you want to kill Rose? A multiple choice question popped out of Wang Ran's mind instantly. However, Wang Ran just gave up the idea of killing Ross. Let alone whether the God Realm had a means to locate the murderer, Wang Ran didn't want to do it just because of his original intention. Not only did Ross appreciate and admire Wang Ran, but Wang Ran also admired Ross very much. Therefore, Wang Ran just shook his head slightly for Ross' words, and then asked, If you were me, would you choose to go to the God Realm to accept that inexplicable trial? Hearing this, Rose was silent. Wang Ran didn't say a word just now. He thought Wang Ran was considering his suggestion. However, it seems that Wang Ran is mocking his innocence in his heart. Yes, if you were your own, you wouldn't make this choice. After all, to be able to cultivate to this level, although there may be various personalities, no one is suitable for fools. Thinking of this, Rose sighed secretly. He knew that no matter how he persuaded him, there would be no turnaround. So Rose chose to be silent. However, Rose did not speak, but Wang Ran spoke. You said? How long will the God Realm know about you being caught by me? Hearing Wang Ran's question, Rose looked up at him. He knew that Wang Ran was looking for news, but he didn't mean to hide it, because it is completely unnecessary. After all, it is just a small matter. The thing is there, it can't change at all. He has now become a prisoner, and there is no way to send news to the gods. What's more, he still has questions to ask Wang Ran. Therefore, Rose directly replied, if you still want to resist. I would advise you to give up. If I haven't returned to hand over the task in five days, the God Realm will start exploring. And I have been in the human world for three years. That is, three days have passed since the world. In the God Realm, there will be at most two days before my whereabouts will be investigated. Rose answered very simply. He didn't think Quang Ran could make any waves. Indeed, it was only two days in the God Realm, and it was only 200 years in the human world. In a mere 200 years, and still in the energy poor human world, what can you do? Even if it is a third level divine residence, I am afraid that even the first level cannot be broken. What's more, Wang Ran's strength, even if he is a Tanzong wizard, what can he do if he can break through? As for the escape, all the world is under the rule of the God Realm. Where can Wang Ran escape? Chapter 416 Do not know each other but where would Rose know that Wang Ran might really come back after seven years? Not to mention being able to resist the entire God Realm but it is still possible to make the God Realm jealous. Therefore, after hearing Rose's words, Wang Ran did not speak for the first time, but thought silently in his heart. Seven years, if you fight for it, you may not be able to fight the God Realm. Of course, it is impossible for Wang Ran to say such a thought. After a moment of silence, Wang Ran said to Rose with a chuckle, the matter hasn't reached the last minute, who knows the result. Seeing Wang Ran's free and easy manner, Rose did not take it seriously. However, for this respectable strong man, a little sympathy arose. Nodded irresponsibly, Rose spoke in a calm tone. Then good luck, but what do you want to do with me during this time? Wang Ran looked at Rose, shrugged slightly, and then said, I built an academy, and there is just one goalkeeper missing. I beg you for it. Hearing that, even Rose, who has existed for an unknown number of years, has a dull expression on his face. Putting a finger to his nose, Rose asked incredulously, goalkeeper, me, seeing Rose's performance, Wang Ran nodded indifferently, and then replied, yes, of course it is you, I can't say that I kept you in prison, although everyone still seems to be an enemy, they always make the best use of everything, besides, letting one's own enemies watch the door is a sense of accomplishment, Wang Ran's voice was very brisk, and he could hear the jokes in his words, Rose is not stupid, he can hear it naturally, not entangledly, Rose said with a complicated expression, that's how it is said, but are you not afraid of me making trouble for you? Although the strength is sealed by you, even if I only rely on physical strength, I am not comparable to ordinary people, am I? Upon hearing Rose's words, Wang Ran nodded in agreement. However, his expression was still indifferent, and he even asked, This is natural, 
Even if you only rely on physical strength, you will not be worse than the average title do you owe. But, will you take action against ordinary people? I think I still know a little bit of understanding. I believe you can't do this. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Rose fell silent for an instant. After a while, Rose sighed long and then said, All right, you win. However, you don't expect me to help you. Even if you put me in the position of guard, as an enemy, I will not help you a little bit. Upon hearing this, Wang Ran laughed loudly. He doesn't care about Rose's words. Although he doesn't help himself a little bit, he may not be able to control himself by then. A moment of loneliness can still be regarded as enjoyment, but if you are really lonely so that there is only one person, the whole world will probably become dark. Shaking his head indifferently, Wang Ran said, It's up to you, but I believe you will make a change. After just such a period of exchanges, Rose's attitude towards Wang Ran is not so happy anymore. Although not familiar yet, a faint sense of familiarity arose between the two inexplicably. The so-called friendship between gentlemen is as pale as water, maybe that's what I said. Obviously standing on an opposing position, it seems like a close friend of many years. This situation makes Rose feel very strange. After so many years of practicing in the God Realm, he is not without friends. However, most of those so-called friends are met because they have to perform tasks with them and most of them are not much different from their own strength. These people, at best, can only have a chat when performing tasks together. On weekdays, even the face is not seen for a long time. There is not much communication, let alone a heart-to-heart. -heart. As for the more powerful first-level divine residents, he couldn't climb high, and the third-level divine residences can't climb him high. Therefore, the friendship between Wang Ran, like a gentleman's friend, gave Rose an unspeakable sense of ease. Therefore, after hearing Wang Ran's self-righteous words, Rose curled his lips in disdain. Maybe he didn't even realize that Wang Ran in his heart is more than just admiration. It's the real thing, treating Wang Ran as a friend. Don't say so swearing, okay, you have captured me, is it possible that I still have to help you work? Rose glanced at Wang Ran, completely disregarding what he said just now. However, he didn't want to worry too much about this matter. After all, he was still very confident in himself. Wang Ran didn't force him to do things he didn't want to do. How could he do it? Could it be that his brain was kicked by a donkey, and his idleness hurts? Automatically ignoring that question, Rose continued to ask. Also, I have become your prisoner. Are you not going to tell me your identity? Hearing Rose's question, Wang Ran waved his hand indifferently. It's okay to tell Rose about his identity. It's not the time to fight just now. If you say a few more words, Rose can't come back. Therefore, Wang Ran directly said. Of course I can tell you, me, Zangman Sect Master Wang Ran. Of course, you can also call me Ran Taoist. Zangman, Ran Taoist. After hearing Wang Ran's words, Rose tried to search these two key words in his mind. Unfortunately, nothing was discovered. So Rose asked directly, Well Taoist, you shouldn't need to establish a sect with your strength. So, what is the significance of this Tibetan gate? Wang Ran didn't dislike Rose's questioning. Although there was some suspicion of inquiring about intelligence, Wang Ran was still ready to answer him. After all, Rose would not believe it even if he said it. Therefore, Wang Ran directly opened his mouth and went back. Although your words are very reasonable, but I can have this strength. The existence of Zangman is a reason that cannot be ignored. I am not the founder of Zangman but the second sect master. It is precisely because of the heritage of the sect that I can grow so fast. As for the significance of Zangman's existence, there is actually only one, and that is to save the world. Sure enough, things were as Wang Ran had expected. Ross didn't believe Wang Ran's serious answer. He even narrowed his eyes slightly. His face showed an expression that you were talking nonsense to me. Chapter 417 Bad guy if you don't want to say it, you don't want to say it and save the world, let alone whether the world needs salvation, it just needs salvation, what do you want to save, shaking his head, Rose said helplessly, that's it, you don't want to say it, I'm just curious now, my attack clearly hit you before, why you didn't have anything at all, moreover, has become stronger, hearing that Rose didn't believe his words, but instead took the initiative to change the subject, Wang Ran just curled his lips a little, without explaining much. These days, no one really believes the truth. Your move is really strong. If you insist, I will definitely get hurt. But what if you didn't hit me? Wang Ran asked back towards Rouse. When asked by Wang Ran, Rose frowned suspiciously. Seeing Wang Ran's somewhat joking expression, he asked inexplicably, It's not you? What do you mean? Although your aura was indeed much weaker than it is now, no matter what aspect it is, it is definitely you, 
and it cannot be someone else's. I still have this vision. Hearing Rose said this, Wang Ran smiled confidently. Then he said, Indeed, if I insist, that is indeed me. But strictly speaking, it's just my clone. Although the clone was destroyed by you, it didn't hurt my body at all. The clone, such a powerful entity clone. Rose looked at Wang Ran incredulously. It is not uncommon to find country novel www.xiangcon7.com and there are not no entity clones. However, it is very rare that the entity clones that can increase the strength to the strength of the body are so small, and can exist for a long time. In other words, Rose had never seen it at all, which led to him not thinking about it at all. Hey I should have thought of it long ago. Rose sighed and said, he now admired Wang Ran from the bottom of his heart. Not only because of Wang Ran's powerful strength, but also because of his endless methods and cards. At this moment, he even felt that Wang Ran's approach was correct. In the future, he might really be able to fight against the king of the gods. Shaking his head, Rose quickly threw this absurd idea into his mind. In seven years, how could it be possible to fight against the king of gods? Wang Ran didn't care about the thoughts in Rose's mind and took a deep look at the ground. His deep gaze passed through countless barriers and saw the three disciples in the Taoist Academy who were waiting anxiously. A smile appeared on Wang Ran's face, treating others sincerely, and people would treat themselves sincerely. Although he didn't get along for a long time, he gave his disciples sincerely, and those disciples would naturally treat himself sincerely. You have almost asked what you should ask. If you want to know something, you will find out little by little in the days to come. Now, I should go back. Otherwise, my three disciples would be waiting anxiously, Wang Ran said softly, with a smile in his voice. After speaking, Wang Ran didn't give Rose a chance to react, so he rushed down the sky directly with him. After a few breaths, Wang Ran returned to the ground. As soon as Ning Rong Rong saw Wang Ran came back, he immediately let go of his tightly held small hand. The two calves stepped away bluntly and rushed directly into Wang Ran's arms. Wang Ran was afraid that Ning Rong Rong would fall and quickly caught her, Master, you are finally back, can you bring Rong Rong with you next time you beat the bad guys? Ning Rong Rong lying in Wang Ran's arms, said a little coquettishly, but the little hand kept holding on to Wang Ran's skirt. Wang Ran naturally understood that Ning Rong Rong was worried about himself. A thick smile appeared on his face, he stretched out his palm and scraped Ning Rong Rong's nose a little bit, Wang Ran said, well, well, you must bring Rong Rong with you next time you beat a bad guy. At this time, Kian Renxiu and Li Ying also walked to Wang Ran's. The two of them are already relatively old, and their personalities are not that easy to leak out. Therefore, behaviors like Ning Rong Rong could not be done by the two of them. Therefore, the two of them just stood in front of Wang Ran and said softly, Master, you are back. Wang Ran also knows the personality of the two, and he does not think that they are not nervous. So for Kian Renxiu and Li Ying, Wang Ran still smiled. Looking at this harmonious Rong Rong side in front of him, Ross, who was defined by Ning Rong Rong as a bad person, had a complex face. He admired Wang Ran's caring life, although he also had a large number of subordinates who respected him. But those people, few people really care about themselves. Of course, Rose was not only envious, but also faintly relieved. Having such a sight shows that I have not seen the wrong person. Wang Ran, as he thought, was a truly respectable person. Rose is silent, but it doesn't mean that others can't find him. At this time, Ning Rong Rong was held in Wang Ran's arms and looked at Ross, who was silent on the side. She still doesn't understand any major principles, nor can she see clearly what is at stake. But she knew that Rose was Wang Ran's enemy. It was also because of him that he waited nervously for a long time. So how could Ning Rong Rong be polite to Ross? Ha, huh, bad guy. Angrily shouted at Rose, Ning Rong Rong stopped paying attention to him. Because the more I looked at Ross, Ning Rong Rong felt more angry. Ross, who was stunned by Ning Rong Rong's words, also couldn't laugh or cry. Bad guys? He really isn't. In other words, during so many years of law enforcement career, he has wiped out a lot of threats to the human world. But Ning Rong Rong was so stubborn that he couldn't help it. I have lived for so many years, so I can't say to care about with a four-year-old girl. No way, Rose couldn't refute, and could only silently accept the influence of the bad guy. Wang Ran just laughed helplessly at Ning Rong Rong's performance. He felt warm in his heart for Ning Rong Rong's performance of defending himself. At this time, like Rao's, Datong Mahuai, who had not spoken, walked to Wang Ran's side, and asked Wang Ran softly, Sect Master, how is the situation? She didn't ask Rose's question, Wang Ran left Rose with his life, naturally with his own plan. I am not good at this, 
So for Wang Ran's decision, Datong Mahui's idea is very simple, just listen to it. What she cares about now is what happened to Rose's attack. That so called God Realm, will it take any action against Zhangman next? Chapter 418 Taoist College Admissions Registration Coming to this strange plane with Wang Ran, there is a natural connection between Datong Mahui, Wang Ran, and Zhangman. What's more, now she herself is a member of Zhangman. How will I live in the future? I am tied to Zhangman. Wang Ran saw the serious face of Datong Mahui, first smiled lightly, and then said, It's okay, there is plenty of time. Just a sentence, it sounds like there is no information coming out. However, Otsuki Teruyu understood the current situation in his heart. Nodded, Datong Mahui didn't continue to ask anything. Dot. That night, the battle above the clouds spread throughout the continent. Except for most of the people who didn't know anything about eating up the masses, those few people who had guesses about both sides of the battle, all tacitly overwhelmed this matter. Therefore, although there was a conversation that swept the entire continent in Duluo continent, no one focused on the Taoist Academy outside Tanda City. Only after that night, a lazy gatekeeper appeared at the gate of the Taoist Academy that was just built. Dot. Two years later, Tanda City Way I doubt Tibetan Institute. Outside of the Taoist Academy at this time, it was enough to be called a crowd. A large number of horsey drawn carriages stayed under the gate of the Taoist Institute, and one after another, gorgeously dressed teenagers, accompanied by their parents, walked out of the horsey drawn carriage. These people are all upper class nobles of the Tandu Empire, and their scope covers almost the entire Tandu Empire. And this is only a small part of the countless people outside the Taoist Academy. More. It is the kind of little noble families and ordinary people. It was already very crowded. If everyone were driving here, there would be no resistance from even a standing person. Therefore, everyone has an unwritten rule. That is, except for the noble families whose titles are higher than earls, ordinary nobles and commoners are not allowed to drive here. Of course, the new regulations were not initiated by the Taoist Academy, but by everyone's acquiescence. After all, not everyone has the courage of a great noble to compete. If they offend the nobles because they are too crowded, their lives will be sad. Therefore, this unwritten rule is more of ordinary people's fear of the nobles. The purpose of everyone gathering here is naturally not to blame our Zhong. There is only one reason why there is such a scene today, and that is that the Daozang Academy is about to start enrolling again. This is the second time that Daozang Academy has enrolled, but compared with the first time, it is a heaven and an underground. When enrolling for the first time, only a few noble children and some civilian children who had sole power and wanted to become sole masters but had poor family conditions came to register. Countless civilians and ordinary nobles with small assets have simply ignored the admissions of Taoist Academy. After all, it was nothing more than a newly opened college. Although it occupies a large area, how could it be comparable to the Heaven Do Imperial Academy or those Soul Master Academies with profound foundations? However, this situation changed shortly after the first admission to the Taoist Academy. Ordinary people may not know the inside story, but those aristocrats who have a little relationship have discovered a shocking news. Among those who entered the Taoist Academy, except for the common people, all the noble students had some relationship with the royal family, not the son of the emperor's guard, but the queen of high officials. Even more frightening is that three of the four sons of Emperor Xuai entered the Taoist Academy. Among the three princes, even the prince of the empire, Xking, if it hadn't been for the imperial family to have a Tandu Imperial Academy, it is estimated that Emperor Xuai would even send his four sons in. Such a discovery directly made countless people dumbfounded. The emperor is not a fool and the people around him are even less likely to be fools. But such people have sent their younger generations to the Daozang Academy to study. This shows what? This shows that the Daozang Academy is definitely an extraordinary place. Otherwise, how could it have attracted such attention from the emperor? Even if these reasons are thrown out, it is a rare good thing to be able to connect with these top nobles and even princes. This is a top-notch network. When these people grow up, how much benefit can they bring to their family? Therefore, the nobles who learned the news regretted and cursed at the same time. They didn't get any news of such important information. What are they trying to get their children to study at the Tandu Royal Academy? In addition to the best educational resources, the biggest reason is not because they can accumulate a large number of contacts in the Tandu Royal Academy. But now, they actually missed an opportunity to soar into the sky. It was painful to breathe. Of course. They wouldn't know that the main reason they didn't get the news was because Wang Ran told Emperor Xuai to let everything go with the flow. With such an order, Emperor Xuai would naturally not be alright. Except for a few people around the Emperor, no one knew the inside information of the Daozang Academy, 
let alone spread it out. At that moment, these nobles, who were all aloof during the day, were extremely envious of those poor households who could go to the Taoist and Tibetan Academy to study. Therefore, for the second enrollment of the Taoist Institute, those who have younger generations at home must let their younger generations enter. And human beings are a bit of a herd mentality, especially in the Duluo Plain, a world where people's wisdom is common. Although ordinary people may not know the inside story, there are always one or two capable people who can get some more secret information from various places. For example, the nobles all want their descendants to enter the Taoist Academy. Then pass it ten, ten pass a hundred, until this secret spreads to the entire populace, and it becomes no longer a secret. It doesn't matter if these civilians don't know some inside information, just follow these nobles. These nobles may not have other abilities, but their ability to seek advantages and avoid disadvantages is worthy of recognition. There is definitely something unusual about the Taoist Academy, which can be sought after by so many nobles. These petty people, just like these nobles, there is absolutely nothing wrong with letting their children enter the Taoist Academy. One who does this will lead the people around him to do it together. In the end, abruptly created a situation that the whole people sought after. In addition, the Taoist Academy also collects civilians, so even if it is far away, as long as it is a small family with assets, they want to come and try their luck, let alone ordinary civilians nearby. Chapter 419 Kibao is coming it is for this reason that the enrollment of today's Taoist Institute is so popular. It can be said that in addition to the inevitable trend of the development of the Taoist Academy, it is more of an accident. However, as there are more people, various problems will follow. The registration time for the college was originally summer, one of the hottest times of the year. A large number of people gathered, making the already hot environment even more stuffy. In addition, it was the scorching sun at this time, and the surrounding environment was simply to the extreme. The common people can still bear it, but when did the children of those great nobles accept this kind of grievance? Although compared to the children of common people, there are soul masters around them to help drive away the heat. Father Mother, how long do we have to wait? Why do we have to come to this Taoist and Tibetan Academy and go to the Heaven Do Imperial Academy where my brother sister is located? At this time, most of the noble children who had been waiting for a long time were complaining to their parents. They are still young and do not understand this kind of political investment. Coupled with their parents, it is impossible to tell them all the secrets they are still young. After all, Tong Yan Wuji, who knows where these little children will spread these words. Their ideas can be thought of, but they must not be spread. Otherwise, it will definitely become an excuse for political opponents to attack them. This is the truth that everyone understands. After all, who knows if you deliberately approached the prince with ulterior motives. Therefore, in the narrow worldview of these children, the Tandu Imperial Academy is the best academy in the Tandu Empire. In addition, everyone has one or two brothers and sisters studying at Tandu Royal Academy. So in comparison, they even more hope to study at Tandu Royal Academy. However, these nobles are clearly the same as Der Spiegel in their hearts. How could it be possible for them to give up this good opportunity? Although they are very uncomfortable in such an environment, their cities are well received. Even though he had already scolded Taoism Academy in his heart, he did not show any impatience at all. For the benefit of the family, let alone just the environment is not adapting, it is no problem for them to bow and bow their heads. As a result, all the complaints of their own children were unanimously blackened. He looked at his child seriously and told him seriously. Although the words are different, the core meaning is that they must perform well and successfully join the Taoist Academy. Although they are all accustomed to children at home, these children are still very scared of the elders. Therefore, after being so seriously instructed by their parents, everyone can only endure the uncomfortable environment and continue to wait. Even if he is reluctant in his heart, he can only hold it in his heart. Just when everyone was waiting under the scorching sun, a cry of exclamation suddenly came from a distance. Hearing this sound, even the top nobles present, subconsciously looked in the direction of the sound. As their eyes moved, everyone saw the extremely luxurious carriages, slowly approaching the foot of the mountain. Why is it extremely luxurious? Because these carriages and even their exteriors are all kinds of precious gems, and the horses that pull carts are even more so beasts. In particular, the carriage in the middle is even more luxurious and unattractive. Where is this carriage? This is simply a golden mountain. Among the carriages present, there is no carriage comparable to it. However, this is not what surprised everyone the most. What surprised everyone most was the sign of the Seventh Street Tower on the carriage. Because of this sign, it means that the person coming is from the Kibal Ulai sect. These people present are all somewhat knowledgeable, so they can all recognize this sign. Dot.
Unexpectedly, even the Seven Treasure Glaze Tile School was here. Sure enough, my decision was not wrong. If my child is admitted, the future will definitely be boundless. Yes, the Seven Treasure Glazed Glass Sect is worthy of being the most wealthy sect in the world. These luxurious carriages alone cannot be supported by ordinary forces. Among the noisy crowd, these words came out from Twitter. It's not just one person, but countless people sigh. Of course, those who said this were all civilians and little nobles. Those powerful nobles were shocked. Unlike ordinary people and little nobles, their vision is broader. They could have expected that the Kibau Glazed Glass sect would send juniors to join the Taoist Academy, but they didn't expect so many people. Moreover, they are all riding in such luxurious carriages. Although the Kibau Yulai sect is very wealthy, such a carriage is not something ordinary people can ride. These people in the carriage are definitely the core disciples of the Seven Treasure Glazed Tile School. Especially the carriage in the middle, the identity is even more expensive. If nothing else, they are definitely the elders of the Seven Treasure Glazed Tile School. And this is what really surprised the nobles. Did the Kibau Glazed Glass sect move all the core of the entire sect? Looking at each other, the nobles all showed this meaning in their eyes. They simply can't understand the operation Kibau Yulai uses, and even if they pay attention to it, they can't send in the entire sect's core disciples. The poor still knew that they couldn't put their eggs in the same basket. How could the Kibal Yulai sect act like this? In case something goes wrong, the Seven Treasure Glazed Glass sect is basically half abolished. Besides, with the exception of a few people, the Seven Treasure Glazed Tile School has always cultivated its core disciples personally. Is it possible that the information they have received is not comprehensive, and this Tibetan academy has other advantages? These great aristocrats were thinking carefully in their hearts and they suddenly felt that there were fewer juniors sent. Based on the performance of Kibal Yulai alone, the importance of the Taoist Academy must definitely rise several levels. While these nobles were still thinking, the caravan of the Seven Treasure Glazed Tile School slowly came to the foot of the mountain where the Taoist Academy was located. It stands to reason that with such a crowded crowd, it is absolutely impossible for a convoy to go so fast. But I can't bear the shadow of the tree, the name of the person. The Seven Treasure Glazed Glass sect is in Duluo Continent and the proper one is a golden sign, the world's first auxiliary sect, the world's most wealthy sect, one of the three sects and so on. Under the circumstances of being able to make good friends, no one person or force is willing to offend the seven treasure glazed tile school. Therefore, whether it was intentional or unintentional, everyone present took the initiative to give way to the Kibaul Yulizong team. Chapter 429 Treasure Glass Ning Rong Rong and as the Kibaul Yulizong's convoy stopped, the doors of those carriages were successively opened from the inside. One after another, gorgeously dressed children, accompanied by their parents, stepped out of the carriage. Unlike those of the same age whose hearts have long been anxious because of waiting, these seven treasure glass sect children are full of excitement. As for the details of Taoist Academy, Kibaul Yulai sect can be said to be one of the most familiar existence. Therefore, within the seven treasure glazed tile school, especially in the inner circle, these younger generations of the right age have been instilled into the Taoist Academy. Moreover, in the first year, they sent in several younger generations of the right age. The growth of those few people also confirmed that the Taoist Academy is indeed worthy of their treasure. Kibaul Yulizong's thinking was very clear, although Ning Rong Rong had already worshipped Wang Ran as his teacher, and he was still very favoured. However, they still have to get closer to Wang Ran, nothing else. Just for the Nine Treasure Glazed Tile Pagoda where Ning Rong Rong awakened, Zangman and the others are temporarily unable to join in, but it is still worth trying to send their juniors to the Taoist Academy. Dot. The appearance of these boys and girls naturally attracted everyone's attention. The most eye-catching ones were the people who got off the most luxurious carriage in the middle. A gentle and elegant man, under the guard of a middle-aged man with a fierce breath, led a six-year-old girl who was carved and jade and slowly appeared in front of everyone. At the first moment when they saw this man, all those who had some knowledge shouted out in surprise. Nothing else, just because this man is the master of the contemporary Seven Treasure Glazed Tile School, Ning Fengzi. Having confirmed Ning Fengzi's identity, the middle-aged man who guarded him was naturally the famous Saw Du Liu O. Oh. The identity of a girl is naturally Ning Fengzi's only daughter, Ning Rong Rong is undoubtedly. These melaniating people never expected that they could actually see the legendary title Du Liu O. Oh. Moreover, I also saw Ning Fengzi bringing his only daughter to sign up for the Taoist Tibetan Institute. Not only the people who ate melons, but also the nobles were extremely surprised. It was amazing that Emperor Xuai sent his sons to the Taoist Academy to study, but now Ning Fengzi is also doing the same. You know, the Seven Treasure Glazed Glass sect is one of the upper three sects, 
and unlike the Heaven Du Imperial family, it has two title duos properly. Moreover, Ning Feng's status as the only daughter is also destined for Ning Rong Rong to definitely have no shortage of educational resources. Emperor Xi sent his children to the Daozang Academy to study, and he could forcefully explain that he hoped his children could be taught by the strong. But Ning Feng's move completely explained that the power behind this Taoist Academy, or the Tibetan Academy, is definitely stronger than the Seven Treasure Glaze Tile School. Moreover, it's not a little bit strong, it's definitely on several levels top novel www.xbooks.me. Otherwise, the Seven Treasure Glaze Glass Sect could not attach such importance. But it's better than the Seven Treasure Glaze Glass Sect with two title duos. What kind of strength is that? Is it possible that it is an unknown force that can be compared to the Yuhan Temple? As for whether this strength might be stronger than the Spirit Hall, everyone didn't dare to think or believe it. But even so, the eyes of these great nobles are already flashing light. In any case, this opportunity must be firmly in hand. Not only can catch the line of the princes, expand the influence of the family, it is even possible for the family to cultivate a truly strong person. Dot. As for the thoughts of these people, the Kibao Glaze Tile School headed by Ning Fengzi would naturally not know, and Ning Rong Rong, it is even more impossible to know how many people's minds have been caused by his appearance. At this moment, Ning Rong Rong was full of excitement. In principle, Ning Rong Rong does not need to participate in the admissions registration of the Taoist Institute. After all, she was also Wang Ran's disciple, and she was a proper core figure in Zhangman. She still has this little privilege. However, two months ago, Kibao Yulai sect was the awakening spirit of all school-aged children in the sect. As the little princess of Kibao Yulai sect, Ning Rong Rong would naturally not be absent. Therefore, she was taken back to the Kibao Yulai sect by Ning Fengzi. Not disappointing everyone's expectations, Ning Rong Rong not only evolved his martial soul, but even his innate soul power reached a terrifying tenth level. This caused the entire seven treasure glaze glass sect to immediately plunge into excitement. Without any objections, the six-year-old Ning Rong Rong was directly confirmed as the next heir to the sect. The cumbersome procedures abruptly took a Balulizong a month. This directly made Ning Rong Rong unhappy, and now he was infatuated with the life by Wang Ran. Not only has the elders who love him, but also can find various interesting existences in the Stardew Great Forest. For two full years, her interest has not been lacking. This also led to the fact that every time she missed Ning Fengzi and others, it took only half a month for her to return to the Kibao Glazed Glass sect. After staying for more than a month this time, Ning Rong Rong had already missed the life in the Daozang Academy and in the Stardew Great Forest. However, Ning Fengzi had a way to deal with the unhappy Ning Rong Rong. At that time, Ning Fengzi directly said to Ning Rong Rong, Rong Rong, Dad knows that you really want to go back to your master, but don't you want to surprise your master? Think about it, your master will definitely let you enter the Taoist Academy. If you waited until the Daozang Academy enrolled and you went into study as the number one, then your master would feel very surprised and very proud. The innocent Ning Rong Rong, upon hearing these words of Ning Feng Si, instantly decided to surprise Wang Ran. Isn't it the first place in Tibetan school? Ning Rong Rong has decided on this status. When the time comes, Master will be proud of her when he sees himself appearing in this capacity. Therefore, Ning Rong Rong directly under the flicker of Ning Feng Si, stayed in Kibao Yulai sect with peace of mind. Of course, she actually didn't care about the trivial matter of completing a sectaire ceremony. Of course, the reason why Ning Fengzi did this was something of his own. Over the past few years, with the retreat of the Clear Sky School, the power of the Spirit Hall has grown stronger. Seven Treasure Glaze Glass sect did not seem to have been affected, but in the future, it was certain that he would experience the experience of the Clear Sky sect. At this juncture, Ning Fengzi directly let Ning Rong Rong's talents be exposed to the world. Also to prove one thing, that is the younger generation of their seven treasure glaze tile school, only getting stronger and stronger. The future of Zongman will only get better and better. Chapter 421 Soul Master's Law Broken Of course, the reason why Ning Fengzi did this is to trust Wang Ran's strength more, believing that he can protect Ning Rong Rong's safety. Otherwise, no matter how good it is, Ning Fengzi would not be able to expose Ning Rong Rong, who was far from growing up, to the eyes of the world. After all, in the unlikely event of someone playing a black hand behind his back, even if Ning Rong Rong was not harmed, that would be unacceptable to Ning Fengzi. As for whether the delayed two months will delay Ning Rong Rong's cultivation, Ning Fengzi is not at all worried. Although the spirit power reached a limit, it could indeed continue to accumulate spirit power. But the 10th level cultivation speed is definitely far inferior to the 11th level. But so what? These are small things, 
and he even hoped that Ning Rong Rong could accumulate more, nothing else. Just because Ning Rong Rong's first spirit ring could reach the purple thousand year level, Ning Fengzi hadn't forgotten that when he went to the Taoist Academy to pick up Ning Rong Rong, the boy named Li Ying gave him a shock. Not only did he become a 26th level spirit master in two years, but he also had two purple spirit rings. Even the second purple spirit ring was already deep purple. That is to say, Ning Fengzi knows a lot of inside information. If he changes to an ordinary person, he will definitely not accept it for a while because this has completely violated the laws of the soul master world, okay? Afterwards, Ning Fengzi also understood the reason why Li Ying could directly possess the purple thousand year spirit ring. In addition to Wang Ran's magical skills to make spirit rings, it was more because Li Ying had spent a lot of time training to improve his body's endurance for spirit rings. Therefore, with such a clear example, Ning Fengzi is full of confidence in Ning Rong Rong's future. Besides, Ning Rong Rong's talent is so good that he hasn't affected at all after two years of cultivation. Dot. Of course, these are not important to Ning Rong Rong now. At this time, full of confidence, Ning Rong Rong, who was about to win the first place in the entrance examination of the Daozang Academy, suddenly frowned, because she felt that as she appeared, countless eyes scanned her body. Of course, most of these gazes come from children of the same age. The gazes of those adults were mostly on Ning Fengzi and Jian Du Liu O. Oh. Only those children would be attracted to Ning Rong Rong, who was a good looking, well dressed, and very noble peer. Although they weren't very rich and noble among them, compared with Ning Rong Rong, it was like the difference between a princess and a maid. Although the actual identity is indeed similar. However, such a gap directly made Ning Rong Rong dominate among these children. However, Ning Rong Rong didn't like to be looked at as an animal, with a cold snort. The children nearby suddenly bowed their heads nervously. Only the little children who could not hear in the distance continued to observe the noble little princess Ning Rong Rong. As for the parents of young children who were nervous because of Ning Rong Rong's cold snort, they looked at their children angrily. Of course, they didn't open their mouths to scold their children. In the final analysis, this thing happened because they were on their own. If it were not for their low status, they would be far less noble than Ning Feng's status. Their children will not be crushed by Ning Rong Rong. At this moment, a sound of breaking through the sky suddenly came from the sky. As everyone looked up, a black dot slowly began to express. Finally, as the black spots got bigger and bigger, everyone discovered that this was a figure that was swooping down the mountain quickly. The speed of this figure was not slow at first, plus it was swooping down, so it quickly came to the front of everyone. At this time, the appearance of the figure's owner officially appeared in the eyes of everyone. A sturdy young man with a firm face is floating in the air, flapping his hands that have turned into wings. He was only 13 or 14 years old, but his eyes revealed maturity. Everyone looked at this young man with serious expressions. They all knew that the young man must have been sent by the Taoist Academy to guide them, so they did not dare to show any disrespect. Of course, the powerful aura exuding from the youth is also the reason why they value it so much. Of course, this breath is more from the young martial soul, which belongs to the power of blood. But it is precisely because of this powerful martial spirit that makes everyone's attitude towards the young more serious. Not to mention whether there is a strong family support, it is the young man himself, with such a powerful martial spirit, it is impossible to be an unknown person. Even the young people's future path might be farther than theirs. While everyone was still guessing the identity of the teenager in their hearts, a crisp voice with a little milky tone suddenly rang in everyone's ears. Brother Li Ying, do you miss me? The owner of this voice is naturally Ning Rong Rong from the Kibao Glazed Sect. The young man was Li Ying, who was admitted by Wang Ran and possessed the martial spirit of the Golden Wind Big Peng Bird. When asked by Ning Rong Rong, Li Ying's face instantly showed a petting smile and said to Ning Rong Rong, of course, Rong Rong has been out for two months, not only me, but even your brother King and Master want to be Rong Rong. Hearing the conversation between Ning Rong Rong and Li Ying, except for the existence of the Seven Treasure Glass Sect, everyone's eyes were secretly looking back and forth on Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong. They didn't expect that the two would still know each other, and they just thought they would still learn from one person. As for the brother King, wouldn't it be Dan the Prince's King? Li Ying and Ning Rong Rong didn't care about everyone's thoughts. Ning Rong Rong nodded happily after hearing Li Ying's answer. Li Ying continued to speak, Rong Rong, do you want me to send you up the mountain first? When asked by Li Ying, Ning Rong Rong instantly raised his head proudly. Like a proud swan, he shook his head proudly and refused. No, I want to take the entrance exam to give Master a surprise by Kaku.biz. Brother Li Ying, don't tell master. Upon hearing Ning Rong Rong's words, 
Li Ying suddenly turned to Ning Rong Rong in confusion, although he could understand every word Ning Rong Rong said, after connecting, Li Ying was a little confused. When Li Ying saw this, Ning Rong Rong directly gave Li Ying a disgusting look. Then, learning what Ning Fengzi was like, he explained to Li Ying like a little adult. Oh, why are you so stupid, brother Li Ying? Think about it, if I can get the first place in the entrance examination. Will Master be very proud and pleasantly surprised? Chapter 422 Ross and Ning Rong Rong Seeing Ning Rong Rong's appearance, Li Ying gave a helpless smile, with a petting smile on his face. After taking a look at Ning Feng Si, Li Ying knew in his heart that it was definitely Ning Feng Si who fooled Ning Rong Rong. Otherwise, according to Ning Rong Rong's personality, it would be impossible to stay honestly in the Kibao Glaze Tile School for more than two months. However, he didn't say it either. After all, Ning Rong Rong's enthusiasm was also very good. With a straight look, Li Ying said hello to Ning Feng Si, and after Ning Rong Rong encouraged him, he opened his mouth and said to the crowd of Jin Tu, Today is the day for junior students of the Taoist Academy to sign up. Parents, please take your children and follow me to Taoist Plaza in an orderly way to register. Today is, today is. After saying it three times in a row, Li Ying slowly fell on the ground, as Li Ying landed, his possessed spirit was also taken back into his body, a pair of wings was transformed into two arms again, and Li Ying turned and walked towards the mountain, seeing Li Ying's movements, all the parents at the foot of the mountain stayed with their children and followed Li Ying, in order to leave a good impression, the densely packed crowd is like a forbidden army, in order, of course, those who follow the front will always be the group of people with the highest status, for example, Ning Fengzi's seven treasure glass sect team, mage nobles and so on. The mountain is not high, but it is not low. Fortunately, Li Ying's speed is not fast, and ordinary people in the crowd can keep up. As time went by, everyone saw what the top of the mountain looked like. No, it should not be said that it is the top of the mountain, because the top of this mountain has been directly smoothed. Behind a solemn gate is the Taoist square inches Li Ying's mouth. The huge crowd, with the exception of a few people, was the first time to see the true face of the Taoist Academy. Everyone subconsciously looked at the gate of the Academy. The stone pillars of the dragon made everyone feel a sense of solemnity invisibly, and as they looked at the auspicious cloud steel with the four characters of Daozang Academy, they lifted this sense of solemnity to the top. At this time, Li Ying's spirit-powered voice also spread to everyone's ears. Welcome everyone to the Daozang Academy, walk through this gate, and it is the Daozang Square. I know that everyone is very curious about the Taoist Academy, but I still want to advise you, don't keep staring at the auspicious clouds steel, because in the four large characters on the stone tablet, there is a touch of Taoist rhyme. If we keep staring, we are not responsible for any accidents. Hearing Li Ying's voice, most people bowed their heads with interest and stopped observing the four characters. However, there are always one or two irons. Although Li Ying had reminded them, they just didn't listen, and even wanted to try it. They really did not give up on seeing the Yellow River. Because of this, within a few breaths, several people vomiting blood appeared in the crowd. Seeing this, Li Ying shook his head helplessly. He reminded me just now, but people didn't listen to what they could do. Wang Ran's Taoist rhyme has only a touch of management but that is not something that ordinary people can understand. Even their direct disciples, even the teachers in the college, dare not look directly at it for a long time. As for these people, if you just take a look, there will be no surprises under the shackles of the formation. If you keep staring at it, I'm sorry, and vomiting blood is considered good. Heaven is forgiven for sin, but you cannot live for sin. Ignoring those people, Li Ying directly led everyone into the academy. As soon as they entered the Taoist Academy, everyone instantly felt that the surrounding air had improved uh, a lot, and those soul masters were even more surprised to find that the concentration of heaven and earth aura here was much better than unknown outside the gate. Zhao Du Luo, who was walking in the front of the crowd, subconsciously looked at Ning Fengzi. He hadn't been to the Daozang Academy before, just heard Ning Fengzi mentioned that the concentration of spiritual energy here is much stronger than the outside world. He didn't care much at first, but when he felt it personally today, he was suddenly surprised. This is not much richer than the outside world, this is obviously a lot richer than the outside world. If you are cultivating here, the cultivation speed will not be doubled. It is simply sorry for the concentration of the spiritual energy. Feeling Jian Duluo's gaze, Ning Fengzi smiled awkwardly. He hasn't been to the Daozang Academy for a year. When he came last time, although the concentration of spiritual energy here was much stronger than that of the outside world, 
it didn't reach this point, otherwise, what he said would also ask Quang Ran to allow Bone Duluo and Sword Duluo to take turns to cultivate here. After straightening his mind, Ning Fengzi said to Sword Duluo, Uncle Jian, I don't know why the concentration of aura here is so high. When I first came, the concentration of aura here was far not so high. Hearing Ning Fengzi's words, Jian Duluo nodded softly, without saying much. Dot. While everyone was still looking at the surroundings of Dazang Square, a voice suddenly came from a clear spring rockery in the square. The people who signed up this year are here. With the sound of this sound, everyone's eyes were attracted to the direction of the sound source. At this time, they discovered that there was a middle-aged man lying on the rockery. However, this man is wearing a brown robe, which is too easy to be overlooked. And as the middle-aged man's voice fell, his body also sat up from the rockery. Li Ying looked at the middle-aged man and nodded with a chuckle, Yes, Senior Luo, the students who signed up this year are here. The middle-aged man is not a man, it is Rose who was captured alive by Wang Ran and became the gatekeeper of the Taoist Institute. Not to mention anything else, Rose still has some strength, so Li Ying still respects him. However, Ning Rong Rong was not used to him anymore. In Ning Rong Rong's heart, Rose's influence has not changed. Even if Wang Ran asks her to respect Rose a little, Ning Rong Rong just added the title of an uncle. With a cold snort to Ross, Ning Rong Rong spoke directly, Uncle Bad Guys, aren't you on holiday today? Why are you still here? Seeing Ning Rong Rong's appearance, Rose felt a bit of toothache. He didn't know why the little girl held such grudges. Two years have passed, and he has never gotten a good face from Ning Rong Rong. Why am I still here? Where else can I go? Really? If it weren't for your master, could I be bored to sleep here every day? Chapter 423 When registration is in progress Rose muttered softly, he didn't dare to let Ning Rong Rong hear him say bad things about Wang Ran, otherwise, the little girl would definitely not have a good face to catch him. Maybe it's because of trouble, or maybe it's because of something else. Ross is a little afraid of the little girl Ning Rong Rong. Of course, this fear is not that the other is afraid, it is more like petting. Ning Rong Rong heard Ross muttering something but did not hear clearly, frowned and asked, Uncle Bad Guys, what are you talking about? Rose heard Ning Rong Rong's words and quickly said, nothing, nothing. Seeing the appearance of Ning Rong Rong and Rouse, Li Ying couldn't help rubbing his head helplessly. The way these two people get along is really dumbfounding. When everyone's attention was on Ross, Ning Fengzi suddenly frowned and asked Saw so Duluo, Uncle Jian, what's the matter? It turned out that although Rose was sealed by Wang Ran, just like Rouse, the sword Duluo who used the sword to enter the road, he still noticed an abnormality in Rose. It was an unspeakable feeling, with fear and excitement, surrender and war. As soon as this complicated feeling came out, Jian Duluo understood that this person was definitely a strong, the kind of strong that was much stronger than him. More importantly, from Rose, Jian Duluo smelled the sword intent above the clouds two years ago. Therefore, from the moment Rose appeared, Jian Duluo's body suddenly tightened. This scene was also seen by careful Ning Feng Si, so he asked that sentence. Jian Duluo glanced at Rose, then lowered his voice and said to Ning Feng Si, Sect Master, this person is very strong. Moreover, it is most likely the one from two years ago. Hearing Sword Duluo's words, Ning Feng Si's expression instantly became serious. He understood what Sword Duluo was talking about, and looked at Rose unmovingly. For us, Ning Feng Si had also seen it before. The guardian of the Daozang Academy did not have a trace of spirit power fluctuation on his body. I thought this was an ordinary person with better luck, but I didn't expect it to be a god's residence. Perhaps he had noticed something. Rose also turned his gaze to Ning Fengzi and Jian Du Luo. However, he didn't say anything, just stayed on Jian Du Luo for a while. At this time, Li Ying interrupted the conversation between Ning Rong Rong and Ross. Now it's enrollment, not an internal tea party. Ahem, everyone. Please line up, there are eight teams in total, ready to register. After speaking, Rose directly took out a jade pendant from his arms, and then input a trace of soul power into the jade pendant. After finishing all this, Li Ying put the jade pendant in his arms again, and many hometowns, leading their children, lined up quietly. At this moment, a beam of light suddenly lit up in the center of the square. In just a moment, the beam of light disappeared, and just where the beam of light disappeared, Seven teenagers also appeared. Among them, Kian Renxiu is also included. Counting Li Ying, eight people are all senior students of the Taoist Academy. It's not that there are few people signing up, but because the requirements of advanced students are too high, only eight of them meet the requirements. After all, 
The purpose of the Taoist Academy is to select seedlings for Tibetans. Six-year-old children can be retrained, no matter their character or anything else. But teenagers can only look at the status quo. Otherwise, it may not be possible to succeed after expending a lot of energy, and the gain is not worth the loss. Dot. And with the appearance of these seven people, the crowd that was still a little noisy instantly quieted down. Although there are a lot of people this year, few people are nonsense. Even Kian Renks you just nodded turning wrong wrong. Eight people set up a table and chairs on the square, then took out the record sheet and the soul detection crystal, and sat down. Detect soul power and record registration. Li Yun, six years old, martial spirit lone wolf, spirit power level four. Ishan, six years old, martial spirit shaking mountain hammer, spirit power level seven. Dot. If a student is not recorded, the person in charge of the recording will read it out loud. In addition to proving that there is no shady, this is also a tradition in the soul master world. All the people present listened to the recording results of the eight people with their ears up, and wanted to compare them with their children. I laughed proudly when I heard someone worse than my own child, and I looked at someone who was about the same or better than my own child. As for if there is that kind of genius, it will cause a shock. For example, Ning Rong Rong, six years old. Yu Hun 9 Treasure Glazed Glass Pagoda, Spirit Power 10th Level. As Ning Rong Rong's name sounded, everyone's eyes widened in surprise. 9 Treasure Glazed Tile Tower, 10th Level of Soul Power. Everyone is you look at me, I look at you, they all look unbelievable. The 10th Level of Soul Power is full of soul power. Even if the innate soul power is full, although there are not many on the entire Duluo continent, there are dozens of them. But the 9 Treasures Glazed Tower. The weaknesses of the 7 Treasure Glazed Tile School have been heard by people across the continent. Although it is known as the world's number one auxiliary martial arts soul, it is a pity that the Kibao Glazed Glass Pagoda Soul Master is at most a 79th level soul sage. But now, the little princess of the 7 Treasure Glazed Glazed Sect actually possesses the martial spirit of the 9 Treasure Glazed Glazed Pagoda, and she is still full of spirit power. Doesn't this mean that the future 7 treasures will be used? and an auxiliary title duo with a glazed glass tower will inevitably appear. Ordinary people were okay, but looked at Ning Rong Rong enviously, and those powerful nobles also cast their meaningful eyes on the Kibao Glazed Tile School, quietly thinking in his heart, how should he further befriend the seven treasure glazed glass sect? Seeing this scene, even Ning Fengzi couldn't help but smile. Some proudly stood up, as if to say, did you see that, that was my daughter. At this moment, he was not the sect master of the Kibao Yulai sect but an ordinary father. Several senior students of the Taoist Academy did not pay attention to everyone's performance. After several people praised and encouraged Ning Rong Rong, they started the student registration again. This time there are a lot of students. If you don't hurry up, the next assessment may not be completed. As a few people speed up, the number of people in line is rapidly decreasing, and the number of children who have successfully registered is getting bigger and bigger. But unfortunately, when I knew it was about to end, there was still no genius who could arouse everyone's exclamation. Seeing the growing number of children, Rose couldn't help but grin. There are already thousands of people, and I don't know how many of these people can stay in the Taoist Academy. Chapter 424 Eric, Judgment Greats or just as Rose sighed in his heart, the appearance of a breath suddenly convinced him to pay attention. Not to say how difficult and powerful this breath is, but because it is a familiar breath. Rose's gaze moved quickly, and he directly focused on a child in front of Kian Renxiu. The plain clothes have been washed white. Even the parents who accompanied the child had several patches on their clothes. It can be seen that the family conditions of this child are not good. At this important moment of enrollment, I was still dressed in shabby clothes. However, even so, whether it is the child or his parents, the worn clothes are still clean. Of course, these are not the places that attract Ross' attention. What really attracted Ross' attention was the dark red sword in the kid's hand. The dark red sword is undoubtedly the child's martial arts spirit, but from the body of this sword, Rose can actually feel a familiar breath, a breath of the same origin as his weapon. After just a brief observation, Rose could see that the little boy's martial spirit was like the embryo of his own weapon. Unconsciously, Rose's brows raised. This little boy definitely has something to do with him. But here is the Duluo continent, he is not from Duluo continent, how could he have a connection with the children on this continent? Walking towards the little boy curiously, it was at this time that the boy's soul power test results came out. Gain Renxiu, who looked at the shining soul power crystal ball and made notes for him, couldn't help being a little surprised. Unexpectedly, this little boy, like Ning Rong Rong, was born with soul power. Moreover, 
above his martial soul, there is also a touch of God. Gain Renxiu, who possessed an angel martial soul and also placed Wang Ran as a teacher, was still very sensitive to the breath of gods. For example, Ning Rong Rong and Li Ying, there is also a touch of on their martial souls. But what are the origins of Ning Rong Rong and Li Ying? What is the origin of this little boy? After just a little investigation, Kian Renxiu knew that the boy's parents were ordinary people without spirit power. For such parents, it is already a fluke to give birth to a child with spirit power. If this child is still born full of spirit power, it can be a good story. However, if the child's spirit possessed the breath of gods, that would definitely be a miracle. However, although Kian Renxiu was surprised in her heart, she didn't show it, but she said loudly, Eric, the martial soul trial giant sword the tenth level of soul power. The Judgment Great Sword is the martial soul name of this boy named Eric. The boy had already told Kian Renxiu before testing his spirit power. Following Kian Renxiu's words, she was shocked to death by a huge wave. As if putting a red-hot soldering iron into clear water, a cry of exclamation came from the crowd. Innate full of soul power, see also innate full of soul power. Everyone looked at Eric, wanting to know what this innate soul power genius looked like. Eric was not Ning Rong Rong, and when everyone looked at it, he shrank his neck timidly. Even the parents who accompanied him were a little flustered. However, while panicking in his heart, Eric's parents are also extremely proud. But fortunately at this time, Rose has come to Eric's side. Seeing the tall man who suddenly stood in front of him, Eric raised his head subconsciously. He had seen Rose just now, although he just followed the crowd and watched from a distance. But he never expected that this man would appear in front of him. After all, from his point of view, Rose is definitely the kind of big figure above all, how can there be intersections in his small role? But now that Rose stood in front of him, Eric didn't even feel any nervousness. Even, looking at Rose, Eric still had a natural closeness in his heart. But the six-year-old Eric is not good at talking, so looking at Rose's eyes, Eric just stood blankly. However, although Eric's father is honest and honest, he still knows how to behave. So, just ascertaining that Rose is coming to them, Eric's mother hurriedly greeted them. This. This lord, I don't know what you have to order. Hearing the words of Eric's father, this honest man, Rose asked softly, I don't know if you have time, I have some questions I want to ask you. This. Hearing Rose's words, Eric's father looked at Kian Renxiu with some entanglement. Although he was older, he was just an ordinary person who had been barren for a while. Faced with this situation concerning his children, Eric's father didn't know what to do. After all, this has never happened before. Therefore, he could only ask for help Kian Renxiu, a senior student who had registered for Eric. Seeing Eric's father asking for help, Kian Renxiu smiled and nodded, and said directly, Since Senior Rose has something to ask you, you can go with him, and you can come back later. Hearing Kian Renxiu's words, Rose's father's expression relaxed. Taking Eric and his mother, a family of three followed Rose and walked to one side. Dot. Walking to a relatively quiet place, Rose didn't talk nonsense, and directly asked Eric's parents, What are the martial arts of the two of you? Hearing Rose's question, Eric's father scratched his head in embarrassment and said, Ah, uh, this lord, my spirit is an iron sword, and Eric's mother's spirit is a wooden stick. However, neither of us has spirit power and cannot become a spirit master. Iron sword, wooden stick. Hearing what Eric's father said, Rose did not wrinkle a little. Although the iron sword and Eric's judgment great sword are both swords, the gap is huge. As for the wooden stick, it has nothing to do with the judgment great sword. How could such a parent give birth to a child like Eric, who has a judgment great sword martial spirit? That is, his mental power and divine power were sealed by Wang Ran, otherwise he would directly investigate Eric's physical condition, it would not be so troublesome. However, there is no alternative to this. Although it is troublesome, it can only be asked little by little. In this case, do you know why Eric awakens a spirit like Judgment Great Sword? Rose asked again. And hearing Rose's question, Eric's father showed a puzzled expression. Chapter 425 Origin Two years ago why did Eric awaken the Judgment Great Sword? What is the problem? What kind of martial soul is awakened? Isn't it random? After all, he was just an ordinary person. In his heart, things like Wu Han were random. Seeing Eric's father's expression, Rose knew his thoughts. With a helpless sigh, Rose asked again. Then let me put it another way, has Eric had any special experience before? When Rose said this, Eric's father instantly showed a thoughtful expression. A special experience? There is indeed one special experience. Two years ago, there were two strong men fighting in the sky. Eric was more curious, so he ran out and took a look. Then, without knowing why, 
Eric looked at him and suddenly passed out. After watching for several days, Eric remained unconscious. Moreover, Eric's body has been feverish. I hired a lot of doctors and used a lot of methods. Even the soul master, I found several. It is precisely because of Eric's health that I still owe a lot of money, which leads to a very difficult life. With that said, Eric's father glanced at the shabby clothes of Eric and his wife, and there was a trace of guilt in his eyes. After all, it has been two years. He is a big man and he has not even bought a new dress for his wife. However, still answering Rose's question, Eric's father didn't dare to think much. He paused for a while, adjusted his mind, and quickly continued to speak. But no matter what method was used, Eric never came to his senses. Those doctors and master spirit masters said that there was no other way but to prepare for the funeral. However, when I was about to give up, Eric came to his senses. Moreover, after not eating for so long, Eric was not weak after waking up. On the contrary, Eric is in good spirits and his body is much stronger. Hearing what Eric's father said, Rose stroked his chin. The battle in the sky two years ago was between him and Wang Ran, and Eric also passed out in a coma during that battle. According to reason, the battle between Ross and Wang Ran could not affect Eric in any way, and the reason for this situation can only be found in the course of that battle. Ross thought in his mind, what at the time could affect ordinary people like Eric? He did not notice. In my mind, I was thinking over and over again about the battle with Wang Ran, trying to find some details. Suddenly, Rose's eyes lit up. The details that he overlooked that can affect ordinary people are really there. That is, some of the blood flowing out of his injury at the outset chased down the clouds. Although there may be only one or two drops, it is the blood of the second level he rose. To say that it can have an impact on Eric, it is estimated that this is the only place. Rose was right. The reason why Eric's martial soul could mutate was the drop of blood that rose down. After Rose's blood dripped, it happened to hit the curious Eric's eyebrow. And after dripping on Eric's body, Rose's blood was directly dissipated and integrated into Eric's body. At that time, Ross was at a critical moment of martial arts condensing. Under the influence of the law of the plane, coupled with the consumption of Ross itself, it is no small. That drop of blood was almost entirely used on Ross martial spirit condensing. The parents who had been standing by his side, because they were just ordinary people, didn't notice any abnormality at all. Eric was lucky, he just stood in his yard and looked up at the sky but was directly concentrated by Rose's blood. Fortunately, the blood of a second level divine residence was absorbed by him, and he had not exploded and died. Dot. After thinking of the reason, Rose couldn't help but glance at Eric. Although the cause was indeed Rose himself, Eric was able to get this opportunity because his luck was against the sky. All kinds of coincidences allowed him to absorb Rose's blood. If you change someone, let alone absorb Rose's blood, it would be good if you don't burst into death by the energy contained in the blood. Seeing Ross who was suddenly silent, the Eric family didn't dare to speak out at all, they could only wait in anxious manner. Finally, after the Eric's family had taken a few long and nervous breaths, Rose finally spoke. With a smile on his face, Rose looked at Eric and said, Eric, there is a good relationship between you and me. How about it? Would you like to worship me as a teacher? What? Eric was stunned when he heard Rose's words. At a young age, he had no idea what it meant to be a teacher. Eric is not a traverser like Tang San, he is born with an adult mind. He is not Kian Renxu's kind, since he was a child, he was much maturer than his peers. From an ordinary family, his thinking is no different from ordinary children. In doubt, Eric turned his eyes directly to his parents. Eric's parents were also surprised by Rose's words. However, after the surprise, the two were overjoyed. They are not children like Eric. They have lived for so many years and they know the role of birth. After all, he lives at the feet of the emperor and has more knowledge than ordinary people in remote areas. Combining their little half-life experience, those who came from nobles or large sects grew faster than those who worked their own. I don't know how much. Even those who can't cultivate and have a good background will be able to live a lifetime in abundance. Although they don't know the specific identity of Rose, from the perspective of Kian Renxu's attitude towards Rouse. Rose's status is absolutely high. Be able to worship such a person as a teacher, and there will be a backer behind Eric, and the future development will definitely be much better. Even if you don't say this, by Rose is a teacher, Eric will be able to take care of him in the college in the future. Of course, if Eric's parents knew that Ross Ming's identity was just a watchman at the Daozang Academy, I wonder if they would be so excited. However, there are not so many ifs in the world. After Eric turned his gaze to his father, Eric's father quickly said excitedly, Thank you, adults, thank you for your attention. Eric is still young, so I don't understand many things. It is an honor for Eric to be your student. If Eric grows up and understands a little bit more, 
he will definitely worship you as a teacher the first time. Chapter 426 Teachers at Eric's father said as he hurriedly asked Eric to apprentice, for fear that Rose would regret it. Although Eric was a genius full of soul power, but with Eric's father's vision, he did not understand that even if Eric did not rely on Ross as a teacher, there are a lot of strong people who want to accept him as a teacher. However, because of his narrow vision, he also got the best choice for his children because of his easy satisfaction. Indeed, there are many strong people who want to accept Eric as a disciple. But it can be no better than Rouse, but also as suitable for Eric as Rose. I am afraid there is no one. Eric on the side heard what his father said, so he knelt on the ground quickly. Originally, Eric had some natural closeness to Rose in his heart. Now that his father says so, Eric will not refuse. Rose nodded in satisfaction when he saw this scene. At this moment, Kian Renxiu came over from a distance. This scene of Eric's apprenticeship with Rose was captured by Kian Renxiu without any difference. She raised her brows in surprise, but although Kian Renxiu was a little surprised in her heart, she did not ask questions, but directly said, Senior Rose, are you over here? The students have already registered. Let Eric go over and take the assessment. Hearing Kian Renxiu's words, Rose nodded slightly, and then said to Eric who was kneeling on the ground, all right Eric, you go to the assessment first. Remember to do your best and perform well. If you can get a good ranking, the reward is still very good. Hearing Rose said this, Eric, who was kneeling on the ground, slowly stood up. As he got up, Eric said seriously, I know, I will do well, master dot 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 master. At the end, Eric's voice paused. After all, he was just a child who had just been apprenticed to a teacher, so it was still a bit unaccustomed to call Rose like that. Gain Renxiu looked at Eric's serious little face and smiled slightly. Gain Renxiu's impression of this gifted and clean child is quite promising. Without wasting much time, Gain Renxiu took Eric directly towards the students who had gathered together. Seeing his son being carried by Gain Renxiu, the faces of Eric's parents showed expectant expressions. They also hope that their children can lead a good ranking. Dot. As Eric returned to the ranks of students, all the students who signed up for enrollment gathered together, standing mightily in the center of Dazang Square. Looking at the mighty group of children in front of him, Kian Renxiu gently pinched a fingerprint with both hands. With the completion of Kian Renxiu's handprint, a peculiar wave went directly towards the back mountain of Taoist Academy. In the next second, a purple light flew directly from the back mountain of the Taoist Academy. While breathing, the purple light came directly in front of the student team in the center of the Taoist Academy. As the light faded away, everyone saw that a woman with a fiery figure and purple hair appeared on the spot. The most eye-catching thing about a woman, in addition to her hot figure and purple hair, is the diamond-shaped scales on her eyebrows. Women are not bystanders, but one of the fierce beasts in the core area of the Star to Great Forest, Zij. This soul beast, which had practiced for hundreds of thousands of years, was directly pulled over by Wang Ran and made a coolie since the establishment of the Taoist Institute. After the daily practice, we must also shoulder the responsibility of teaching students. Of course, it was far more than Ziji who was pulled over. Like Di Tan, as long as the beasts in the Star de Great Forest can transform into human form, they are all pulled over by Ross to do coolies. Although Di Shen and the others were not very cold about teaching humans, they didn't dare to refuse because Wang Ran demanded this. Fortunately, Wang Ran taught them a set of avatars. When they are teaching students, they will not say that they have lost their practice. Zhiji, who came to the center of the square, frowned as she looked at the densely packed students in front of her. These students, just looking at them, there are no fewer than two to three thousand. Although a large number of students will definitely be eliminated during the initial practice of the Taoist Institute, this will not change the fact that the base of these students is too large at the beginning. Even at the beginning of cultivation, there are not too many areas where teachers like them need to bother to guide. But thousands of students, three or four teachers of them, are really a headache. Moreover, this is only this year. It is impossible for the college to say that it only enrolls this group of students. There must be only a lot more people who come to sign up next year. So next year, next year, by the time there are tens of thousands of students, even if all of them will be clones, it will not be enough. It is not that there is not enough energy, but time does not allow. It seems that we should persuade the master to find more teachers. With her mind turning, Zij's brows just frowned and then stretched out. Although she was thinking a little bit in her heart. Zija still showed a gentle smile on her face. To the many students in front of him, Zija smiled and said, It seems that there are a lot of people who signed up this time. I am a teacher at the academy. You can call me teacher Zija. First of all, congratulations to you for successfully entering the Taoist Institute. Starting today, 
You are the junior students of the Taoist Academy. Seeing the smiled expression on Zijia's face, whether it was students or parents, I was relieved. It seems that this teacher Zijia, although young, is still very kind. However, Zijia's next sentence directly broke everyone's heart. Please come. However, don't be happy too soon. You are just students who can now be called Taoist Academy. Our Taoist Academy is different from other schools. In other colleges, no matter what you do, you still get mixed up until graduation. But at the Taoist Academy, you can have bad talents, because even ordinary people, the Academy can train you into rare talents. But you must take the ideal of helping the world and develop in the direction that the Dean expects. Otherwise, the only way to persuade you is to wait for you. Of course, fulfilling this ideal will inevitably have a lot of requirements. These will be mentioned in the school regulations after you officially enroll, and you will gradually understand what you should do. Don't think it's very simple. I guess at least half of your group of people were eliminated when they were junior students. Oh, forgot to tell you all. Only one year has passed, and an e-quarter of your last group of students, that is, your senior brothers and sisters, have been dissuaded by the college. Chapter 427 Ning Rong Rong's grievances for the first entrance examination she still hid a smiled expression, but Zij's voice became a lot more serious this time, and Zij's words directly shocked the students and parents who faced her directly. One year, a quarter of the dismissal rate, what this means is naturally self-evident. Although the number of students enrolled last year was small, the dismissal rate was too alarming. Moreover, listening to Zij's meaning, these people who were dismissed were not because of their talent. If only looking at talent, those noble children would not say the best, but they would definitely not be persuaded. Being dismissed for other reasons can only show that the cultivation of students in this Tibetan college is completely different from that of ordinary colleges that only look at levels. In this way, all the students are standing on the same level. Even the children of the nobles who are pampered may still be in a disadvantaged position. To be honest, this is very persuasive. After all, when you go to school, your child is dismissed by the college. It's so good to say it if it is spread out. However, none of the parents present wanted to give up. Even if it did, it didn't say it. This is true even for ordinary people with little knowledge. They may not know much, but for their children, they all have all the expectations. That parent didn't expect her son to become a dragon, or her daughter to become a phoenix. The more rigorous the training of students, the more worth looking forward to their growth. Looking at their children, they are scared or nervous. All parents gave their children a look of encouragement. Feeling the encouragement of their parents, all the children calmed down, even puffed up their chests, wanting to express themselves. Even if there are a few who want to retreat, they are infected by the mentality of the people around them. Dot. Seeing everyone with a nervous and firm expression, Zijia nodded in satisfaction. After a short pause, Zijia continued to speak slowly. Well, I won't talk more nonsense. Now that you have all gone to study, the entrance test still needs to be conducted. Although our Taoist Academy doesn't value cultivation talents the most, as a soul master, you can't live without the motivation to work hard. This test can be considered a ranking for you. In a while, I will slowly release the pressure and envelop each of you. The longer you persist, the higher the ranking. By the way, I would like to remind you that you must perform well, because in order to maintain your motivation for progress and cultivation, Every time you evaluate, the top ranked people are rewarded. Even this time, it is no exception. Of course, you can rest assured, that is, you are all standing on the same level, because there is only one opponent, and that is yourself. As the voice fell, Zidja slowly released a lavender light. This lavender light, as if it had grown eyes, slowly enveloped all the students. A very simple assessment is also the fairest assessment for new recruits. And the reason why Zidja came to preside over this assessment, not senior students like Kian Rengsu. The most fundamental reason is that there are too many new students. In addition to the extremely meticulous control of their own coercion, the host must always pay attention to the state of the students to avoid accidents. For this, only the few teachers in the current Taoist Academy can do it. After the purple light released by Zijia enveloped all the students, a coercion gradually emerged around all the students. The pressure is not strong, but it is slowly increasing until it reaches the maximum that each of them can bear. Although it has reached the maximum tolerance of the students, everyone can hold on for a while. However, as time passed, intensive sweat began to appear on everyone's foreheads. His own martial spirit was also uncontrollably released. In an instant, a variety of lights burst out from the bodies of many students. However, even if the martial spirit was released, they still persisted very hard. Did a sweat, like raindrops, fell from their immature faces. However, 
looking at the comrades around who are still persisting, they are extremely competitive and don't want to give up. However, human perseverance has its limits, especially for children who have not experienced training. At this time, it's not that they can persist without giving up. So, as time went by, one student after another failed. As these failed students slumped to the ground, the pressure on them disappeared instantly. However, compared to the beginning, their white and tender faces have turned pale. Seeing that their children became like this, the parents standing on the periphery couldn't help showing distressed expressions on their faces. However, the assessment is not over yet, and the failure continues. With the appearance of the first student who couldn't hold on, the rest of them fell down like dumplings. Soon, there were only four people who were still standing and insisting. Not surprisingly, Ning Rong Rong and Eric were among them. After all, one started practicing with Wang Ran when he was four years old. Although it takes more time to play than to practice, it is not something you can look at with ordinary eyes when familiar with it. The other, although he didn't practice with Wang Ran, but he was also a person who had been baptized with a drop of God's blood. The remaining two are impressive existences. A civilian dressed in plain clothes, a noble family dressed in luxurious clothes. However, although the two are good, there is still a gap between Ning Rong Rong and Eric. It didn't take long before the two were defeated. However, this is the case, and the two of them also got the attention of everyone. Ning Rong Rong and Eric were left, and Ning Rong Rong's lungs were about to explode at this time. Although she can hold on for a while, Zij's coercion is not fooling people, she is really very tired now. If it wasn't for Wang Ran to be happy to win the first place in the entrance examination, Ning Rong Rong would have given up long ago. It's not that Ning Rong Rong has no fighting spirit, but because it is completely unnecessary. She is Ning Rong Rong, the young master of the Kibal Yulai sect, and a disciple of Wang Ran. Regardless of cultivation resources or status, there is no need to fight with others. Can blow the cold wind comfortably and eat watermelon, why suffer this sin here? The more I thought about it, Ning Rong Rong felt more angry. He gave Eric a ferocious look, if it weren't for this guy. She wouldn't have to hold on for so long. Chapter 428 No Tuition Unfortunately, even though Ning Rong Rong's resentment was soaring, Eric couldn't feel it at this time. Although he had been bathed in the blood of gods, compared with Ning Rong Rong, Eric's background was still too shallow. It seems that now, Ning Rong Rong still has the energy to stare at him, but Eric can only support it hard. Even with the passage of time, Eric felt that his current sanity was a bit blurred. Finally, under Ning Rong Rong's resentment, Eric couldn't hold on anymore. As his consciousness became blurred, Eric's body fell straight, and the pressure on him and Ning Rong Rong disappeared instantly. Just as Eric was about to knock him down on the ground, a gentle force directly supported his body. It was Ziji who had been exerting coercion on him. Just after Ziji took the initiative to protect Eric, Eric's consciousness also recovered. Seeing Ning Rong Rong who stood firmly on the spot and stared at him viciously, Eric gave an embarrassed smile. He didn't know Ning Rong Rong's thoughts, he just saw this noble little girl and kept glaring at him. Eric's smile made Ning Rong Rong a little embarrassed, as if he was playing the piano to a cow. With a soft snort, Ning Rong Rong swung his head directly. Seeing Ning Rong Rong's appearance, Eric was a little confused. He didn't understand what Ning Rong Rong was thinking, so he scratched his head awkwardly. At this moment, Zij's voice rang in everyone's ears. At the end of the assessment, according to the time you insist on ranking, the first place rewards 10 bottles of Pu Andan, the second place rewards 5 bottles of Pu Andan, the third place rewards 3 bottles of Pu Andan, and the fourth to tenth place rewards one bottle. At the same time, your admission numbers are also arranged in order of ranking. King, I'll leave it to you next. I'll go first. Are five bottles of Pei Yu and Dan? Not bad. As Zij's voice fell, Rose, who was standing in the distance, nodded gently and murmured, Ross, who spent two years in the Taoist Academy, is still very clear about the effectiveness of Pei Yu and Dan, even in the realm of God. The pill for cultivation is a rare treasure for cultivating low-level cultivators. Although he is the gatekeeper of the Taoist Institute, he actually doesn't have any salary. Although you can ask Wang Ran for cultivation resources without being cheeky, it's really shameful. Fortunately, Eric is more competitive, and five bottles of Pei Yu and Dan have been enough for him to use for a while. As for the cultivation resources beside him, the public ones in the Taoist Academy are enough for him to use. Just as Rose muttered, Kian Renxiu nodded softly when she heard Zhiji's words, and then said, Good teacher Zhiji, just leave it to us next. Hearing this, Zhiji didn't stay much longer, and she was directly in place. As Zhiji left, Kian Renxiu turned around and looked at the newly enrolled students, and said softly, 
Now that the assessment is over, the top 10 awards will be distributed to you before and after. Now, all the new students gathered in the center of the square. At this time, all the students have stood up from the ground. Hearing what Kian Renxiu said, everyone gathered together honestly. And Kian Renxiu, after speaking to a group of students, directly looked at the many parents and said to them, As for parents, now that the students have enrolled, they can go back. The students can only go down the mountain when the college is off. Of course, if there is any accident, the college will notify you. As Gain Renxiu's voice fell, most of the parents were stunned. What does it mean that they can go back now? Is this over? They didn't do anything except to send their children to sign up. If nothing else, don't you have to pay tuition? Even if it is the most common soul master academy in the border, the tuition for a year requires one gold soul coin, right? In fact, if they had been inquiring about this kind of news before, they wouldn't be inaccessible. However, their previous attention was all on figures in Taoism and Tibetan Academy like the Prince and the Prince. For this kind of details, I didn't care at all. Finally, after a while of silence, one of the parents couldn't help but asked, Well, dare to ask His Royal Highness, don't you need to pay tuition? The person who spoke clearly knew the identity of Xking, he was a great noble in Tanda City, otherwise he would not dare to be the first to ask. It was precisely because of this noble parent's opening that everyone knew that Kian Renxiu's identity was originally the crown prince of the Heaven Du Empire. Suddenly, an exclamation sounded from the crowd. However, this exclamation was quickly suppressed by many parents consciously. Although Kian Renxiu's identity is amazing. She has nothing to do with them. What they are caring about is still the question asked by the nobleman at the beginning. Therefore, after suppressing the inner surprise, all the parents looked at Kian Renxiu with questioning eyes. Kian Renxiu stopped when she was about to pinch her handprint when she was asked this question. Looking at many puzzled parents, Kian Renxiu said softly, Don't worry about the tuition fees. These things need to be solved by the students themselves. This is also the training and requirements of the college. If they can't solve it, it can only show that they are not suitable for Taoism Institute. What? Let the children solve it by themselves. How is this possible? They are only six years old. That's so much money. How can the children solve it? Dot. Dot. Gain Renxiu's words were like a bomb, and a huge wave suddenly started. Countless parents are full of disbelief. It's like an ant on a hot pan. Restless. However, Kian Renxiu did not want to explain more to these parents. This is a rule and there is no need to explain. After dropping those words, a beam of light suddenly rose into the sky with a pinch. After the beam of light disappeared, there was no student left there. Ross is the only internal staff member of the Taoist Academy. The parents who were thrown in the same place, besides the surprise at the Taoist Academy's methods, all left with a face of imitation. They were surprised that they had no idea what method Kian Renxiu used to take all the students away. The imitation is that they don't know what the situation is. However, there are also parents who look calm. For example, the Kibaul Yulizong team are represented by Ning Rong Rong and her father. Either through the statements of Kian Renxiu, or the reports of the disciples of the Seven Treasure Glazed Tile School who enrolled last time, people like them already knew the rules of the Daozang Academy. Chapter 429 Freshmen into Taoism Therefore, in this situation, they are all the old gods calm and abnormal, even looking at the other parents who don't know why, there is still a little pride in my heart. Seeing the bewildered crowd, Ning Fengzi shook his head helplessly, and did not intend to take the initiative to explain, but said softly to the people around him, well, the children are also enrolled in school, whatever happens in the future depends on their good fortune. We old guys, let's go back first. Hearing Ning Fengzi jokingly calling them middle-aged men and old fellows, Everyone in the Seven Treasure Glaze Glass sect also chuckled softly and nodded in response. However, Ning Fengzi was not prepared to take the initiative to explain. The nobles were prepared to take the initiative to ask questions. You know, there are not a few students sent by the Kibal Yulai sect. From the beginning, their calm expressions were noticed by the nobles. Until now, Ning Fengzi and the others' light and breezy appearance has made them even more sure that Ning Fengzi and others know the inside story. Therefore, an aristocrat who was familiar with Ning Fengzi quickly ran to Ning Fengzi and asked, Sect Master Ning, wait a moment, I want to ask, what does this Tibetan Academy mean? Following this person's words, everyone's eyes turned to Ning Fengzi. After Ning Fengzi heard the words of the great nobleman, he paused for a while, and then said, Earl Shang, I can only tell you this question. It is definitely good for the children. Don't worry about that. As for the rest, wait until the children are on holiday and you can ask for it yourself, it can be considered a sense of expectation for yourself, after that, Ning Fengzi was not staying any longer, 
leading the people of the Kibau Glaze Glass sect and walked straight down the mountain. The many parents who were still in perplexity stood there blankly. At this time, someone found Rose who had been leaning on the rockery. In desperation, some bold people wanted to ask Rose. But Rose didn't give them a chance at all. Explaining these things to them was really too much trouble. He has been exhausted for many years, and he finally got down to leisure. Except for special circumstances, he didn't want to trouble himself. So, before these people approached, Rose directly raised his leg and walked towards the distant mountains. Some bold people still want to follow the past, but unlike Rose, they are like an invisible wall in front of them, and they cannot cross Tezang Square for half a step. In desperation, everyone could only give up. Standing on the square, all parents look at me with big eyes and small eyes, and I look at you. There is no way, after a period of silence, everyone can only go down the mountain. The leader is Eric's parents. After all, Eric was already a teacher by Ross, and he had a backer in the Taoist Academy. The two of them didn't worry about Eric at all. Dot. Not to mention the many parents. The freshmen at this time, when the beam of light was lit, only felt a moment of weightlessness in their bodies. When they reacted again, they suddenly realized that the environment around them had changed. It is no longer a huge and magnificent Dezang Square, but a palace building surrounded by mountains and forests. In front of them, there were dozens of children who were slightly older than them, standing in place and waiting in an orderly manner. These older children are all students who enrolled a year earlier than them. After seeing the surrounding environment clearly, a cry of exclamation came from the mouths of these new students. Without him, the Daozang Academy, which was built under the order of Emperor Tandu and was rebuilt by Wang Ran himself, was truly spectacular and beautiful, and its scale was extremely large. Even the palace is not as good as it is. Anyone who first sees the whole picture of the Daozang Academy will be shocked by its magnificence, let alone these six-year-old children. Only Ning Rong Rong showed an expression that he took for granted. Gain Renxu did not interrupt the shock of these newly enrolled students. Similarly, the students who enrolled a year earlier did not show a mocking expression. After all, they were no different from these freshmen now. After all these students were quiet, Kian Renxu said with a chuckle, this is the inside of the Taoist Academy. Of course, there are many areas outside. You will gradually become familiar with these in the future. Starting today, you will live and study here. After a while, your senior brothers and sisters from the previous session will take you to allocate their dormitories. However, you have just heard that the college does not collect tuition from your parents, and you have to deal with everything yourself. Of course, the academy has already helped you make plans for the way to earn tuition. I will tell you here first so that you can consider what you want to choose as soon as possible. In general, you have three major options, formation, equipment, and medicine. Among the three big options, there are many small branches. For example, you can choose the way of array formation or the way of Fuswan. You will gradually learn about these in the future, and your choice is related to your future development direction. However, you don't need to be too anxious because you are only eligible to make preliminary choices when you reach the third grade. Now you can only learn some basic knowledge and use them to earn contribution points to deduct your tuition. For example, picking herbs, moving mines and even chopping wood and vegetables. Only after a long period of study can you understand what your strengths are. Of course, there will be teachers who will give you suggestions during this process. I tell you now, but also to allow you to be prepared from now on. As for the specific matters. I won't say much. When you allocate the dormitory, your brothers and sisters will tell you in detail. Now, all freshmen are divided into two groups, one for boys and one for girls. Suddenly, Kian Renxu's voice increased by one degree. As Kian Renxu's voice fell, the freshmen who had just been immersed in the information in Kian Renxu's words instantly became nervous. I didn't care much about it, and all the new students moved instantly. However, because of the large number of people and the lack of experience of these freshmen, the scene was once very chaotic. It took five or six minutes for the freshmen to divide into two groups and calm down. Looking at the quiet freshman, Kian Renxu nodded, handed a list to the second year old students behind him, and then said to them, you group the freshmen by yourself, explain the rules and conditions, and then assign them dormitories. Chapter 430 Who is the interesting roommate? Having said this, Kian Renxu paused for a while, then continued to speak, remember to take notes and don't forget to remind them of tomorrow's freshman conference. Is there a problem? As Gain Renxu's voice fell, all the second year students shook their heads together, and then said, no problem brother. Seeing this, Gain Renxu nodded lightly, then turned and left. The other high level students were not prepared to stay longer, and were ready to leave with Gain Renxu. At this moment, Ning Rong Rong, 
who was among the freshmen, suddenly stopped Li Ying, and asked suspiciously, Brother Li Ying, do I want to live in a dormitory too? No wonder Ning Rong Rong was puzzled. As Wang Ran's disciple, she had her own room in the Taoist Academy. After hearing Ning Rong Rong's voice, Li Ying said helplessly as Ning Rong Rong, Rong Rong, Master said, let you live in the dormitory like other students. But don't worry, you can go back to your room after you finish third grade. Li Ying was also very helpless. To be honest, he also loved Ning Rong Rong very much. If possible, he didn't want Ning Rong Rong to go to the dormitory. After all, although the dormitory of Taoist College is also very good, in the first to third grades, there are four people in one dormitory. There will be single dormitories only after the third grade. This situation is definitely not as good as Ning Rong Rong's own room. But this was something Wang Ran explained, and Li Ying could not violate it. Dot. Hearing what Li Ying said, Ning Rong Rong nodded and gave a soft toe. But unlike what Li Ying thought, Ning Rong Rong didn't mean to be unhappy in his heart. On the contrary, Ning Rong Rong still had a little expectation in his heart, imagining what kind of person his roommate was. I have to say that Wang Ran's education for Ning Rong Rong is good. Despite his noble status, Ning Rong Rong does not have the lofty and domineering aristocratic children. Although she can't be said to be a good girl, she will never discriminate against anyone. However, when Li Ying saw Ning Rong Rong's appearance, he thought that Ning Rong Rong was a little unhappy, so he quickly explained, Rong Rong, don't be unhappy. Master said, there will be a very interesting little girl in your roommate, who should be a good playmate with you. Hearing Li Ying's words, Ning Rong Rong's eyes instantly lit up, curiously looked at the students around him, and wanted to find the person Wang Ran said. After all, Wang Ran said it was interesting, it must be very interesting, but I don't know who it is. Seeing this, Li Ying smiled softly and left. With the departure of Li Ying and other senior students, all the freshmen, under the leadership of those second year students, walked towards their dormitory area. At the same time, these second year students also explained to them the rules of the academy and what they can do to get contribution points and deduct tuition fees. Of course, this contribution value is not only able to deduct tuition fees, but also to exchange things. These, the second year students, also explained to them clearly. Over time, most of the freshmen have been allocated dormitories. The rest was Ning Rong Rong and two other little girls. Ning Rong Rong looked at the two classmates around him curiously, wanting to see which one could be said to be interesting by Wang Ran. It is a pity that no matter how she looks at it, she can't see from her two classmates what you are worthy of praise. As for the two little girls, because they were both civilians, they were a little at a loss when Ning Rong Rong stared at them. For these two little girls, the second year students who led Ning Rong Rong's way secretly cast envy in the past. Ning Rong Rong's identity is clear to the second year students, and the master in her mouth is the dean of the academy. Becoming roommates with Ning Rong Rong, you can get some light in any way. It can only be said that the luck of these two little girls is really great. According to the list, apart from Ning Rong Rong, there were just two of them left. Shaking his head, these second year students quickly threw out the thoughts in their minds. Studying in Taoist Academy, although all aspects are good, it is incredible. But this kind of thinking that you don't work hard and just wants to be exposed to others is too dangerous. If things go on like this, they can easily be eliminated. They have been insisting on this for a year, but they are very clear about this. I haven't seen those students who were dismissed, there has never been a shortage of children from great nobles. Even the prince was almost persuaded to return home. Ahem, three juniors, your dormitory is in front of you, and the daily necessities have been put in it. Go in by yourself. With a light cough, one of the second year students said softly to the three of Ning Rong Rong. While speaking, he pointed to a door of a room in front of him. Hearing this student's words, Ning Rong Rong and the others all looked in the direction he was pointing, and a room door that was the same as those in the previous room came into their eyes. As a dormitory area for freshmen, the buildings here are all row rooms. However, each room is very large, so the doors of the rooms are separated by a certain distance. Seeing his dormitory, Ning Rong Rong no matter which roommate Wang Ran said was interesting. He ran towards his room excitedly, although she has lived in Taoist Academy for two years, she really doesn't know what the dormitory looks like for freshmen. Therefore, Ning Rong Rong was still very curious about his dormitory at this time. Ning Rong Rong is like this, let alone the other two little girls. Although he couldn't let go, Ning Rong Rong's two roommates also walked quickly to his dormitory. Seeing the excited three people, the second year students didn't care, just said aloud, Don't forget the freshman meeting tomorrow morning. Oh. I got it. Ning Rong Rong responded without replying. The students in the second grade were not angry either, after all, 
The target was Ning Rong Rong. Several people looked at each other and left directly. Dot. At this time, Ning Rong Rong suddenly felt something wrong when he ran to the door of the dormitory. Thanks to Wang Ran's teaching, Ning Rong Rong is still very sensitive to the surrounding environment. Stopping at the door, Ning Rong Rong frowned slightly because she noticed the sound in the room. Someone, seeing Ning Rong Rong's stopped footsteps, the two little girls who followed asked questioningly, that, classmate Ning Rong Rong, what's wrong? Chapter 431 I can't beat you, but my disciple can beat yours. Hearing the voices of his two roommates, Ning Rong Rong made a shush gesture towards them. At this time, Ning Rong Rong's little head was full of brainstorming, and various ideas emerged endlessly. Is it a bad guy, or an intruder? Ning Rong Rong squinted his eyes and thought, a burst of excitement in his heart for no reason. Beat bad people? This kind of thing sounds very exciting. Excited, Ning Rong Rong clenched his small fist tightly and kicked the door of the room without even thinking about it. I just wanted to yell, ah, the bad guy is taking his life. In the end, before he could say anything, Ning Rong Rong's words were directly stuck in his throat. Because, as Ning Rong Rong kicked open the door of the room, a young girl with a scorpion tail braid caught Ning Rong Rong's eyes directly. The little girl was obviously taken aback by Ning Rong Rong's operation and stood still without speaking. However, she soon reacted and said to Ning Rong Rong and the two female classmates behind her, You are my roommates, hello, my name is Xiao Wu, Dancing Wu, Yu Hun is a soft bone rabbit. With that, Xiao Wu's face also showed a playful smile. Seeing Xiao Wu's smile, Ning Rong Rong's embarrassed face turned red at this moment. This means that the sentence just now has not been spoken, otherwise, if you are embarrassed, you will find a seam to get in. Ning Rong Rong scratched his head and said to Xiao Wu, Ow, hello, my name is Ning Rong Rong, Yu Hun Nine Treasure Glass Tower. Ning Rong Rong, you are the disciple of the master, I have heard of you a long time ago, but because I have been cultivating, I have never seen you. After hearing Ning Rong Rong's self-introduction, Xiao Wu said cheerfully. And when Ning Rong Rong heard Xiao Wu's words, she knew that she was the transformed 100,000 year old soul beast sister Xiao Wu in the mouth of Daming and Erming. At this time, she was not embarrassed anymore, and started talking with Xiao Wu curiously. However, Xiao Wu has a mature mind after all. Looking at the other two roommates who were left out in the cold, he quickly asked, How about you? Not going to introduce yourself? Hearing Xiao Wu's words, the two Xiao transparent quickly replied in a flustered manner, Ah. My name is Ellie. My name is Xuhua. When they heard the dry introduction of themselves, Xiao Wu and Ning Rong Rong didn't care. One person, one person, and the two of them joined the discussion. It is very simple for the little girls to establish friendship. Although most of the time it is the well informed Ning Rong Rong and Xiao Wu, and A. I. Li and Wang Hua listen again, but this does not prevent them from forming friendship. Dot. Regardless of the few girls who are twittering, Everyone in the male dormitory area at this time is excitedly talking about their dream of becoming a title do Liu O, especially in the dormitory where Eric is located. Some of Eric, who is the second place in enrollment, are even talking about it. Although Eric didn't speak much, he still couldn't stop the enthusiasm of the roommates. And faintly, everyone consciously or unconsciously took Eric as the leader of their dormitory. While everyone was talking enthusiastically, the door of the dormitory suddenly rang. The nearest to the door, a little boy, hurried to the door and opened the door of the dormitory. As the door of the dormitory opened, a tall figure instantly appeared in front of the little boy. Is Eric here? The visitor is not someone else, but Eric's master, the gatekeeper of the Taoist Academy, Rose. Hearing Rose's voice, Eric's voice rang before the little boy who opened the door could answer. Master? As the voice remembered, the lively dormitory instantly became quiet, and Eric himself ran to the door of the dormitory. Rose looked at Eric, waved at him and said, Eric, you come out with me. I have something to tell you. Hearing what Rose said, Eric didn't even think about it, and followed Rose out of the dormitory. When Eric had gone away, a shock of shock sounded in his dormitory. This uncle is the one in the square before, right? Should be. He is Eric's master? Didn't you hear it? Ah, my goodness, Eric is so great. Dot. Ignore the shock in Eric's dormitory, or what kind of interrogation Eric would face when he returned. At this moment, Eric was standing in front of Rose with his head down, looking a little blaming himself. Rose was also a little puzzled by Eric's appearance, and said in a puzzled way, What's wrong, Eric? Master, I'm sorry. Hearing Rose's words, Eric said with some self-blame. At this moment, Rose was completely dumbfounded and did not understand why Eric had to apologize. Ah. Eric, why apologize? Eric raised his head, and said with some reproach in his eyes, Master, 
I disappointed you and didn't get the first place. Roston was a little bit dumbfounded when he heard Eric's words. Of course he could see that Eric really thought so. Although a little dumbfounded, Rose still feels good in his heart. However, this is also a good opportunity to encourage Eric. Thinking of this, Rose shook his head and said softly to Eric, Eric, you don't have to apologize, it's good if you can get second. After all, Ning Rong Rong is that person's disciple, and it is strange that you are better than Ning Rong Rong now. However, you should also understand the gap between you and Ning Rong Rong. So, after you officially start the class, you will set aside one hour every day to learn from me. I hope you can defeat Ning Rong Rong in the graduation assessment for junior students in six years. At this point, Rose couldn't help but smile. In addition to cultivating Eric in doing this, he was also a little cautious. He can't beat Wang Ran, but if his disciple defeats Wang Ran's disciple, it can be regarded as a face for himself. Although Ning Rong Rong had a good foundation, he also had Wang Ran's careful training, but he felt that Eric had a high chance of defeating Ning Rong Rong. After all, what is being said, Ning Rong Rong possesses the martial spirit of the Nine Treasure Glaze Tile Pagoda, so what he has to go is to assist the Spirit Master. Although the assessment is not comparable to combat effectiveness, compared with the Auxiliary Type Spirit Master, Eric of the Power Attack Type will definitely have a bit of advantage. Coupled with his own teaching, Eric has a big win. However, Rose's smile faded quickly and a sigh flashed in his eyes, I just don't know, will the god realm find Wang Ran at that time, if you really find it, it's estimated that the graduation exam will be gone, right, seriously, Rose still likes life now, at least compared to the long draining and endless battles before, he prefers now, chapter 432 the development of the beast after hearing what Rose said, Eric nodded fiercely, his eyes full of determination, starting today, Ning Rong Rong will be his opponent for the next six years. What Eric didn't know was that in the next six years, he would always live in the shadow of Ning Rong Rong. Even the other little girl can't win. Of course, these are all things to follow. At this time, Rose left the freshman dormitory area after explaining some of Eric's precautions in the college. Dot. On the second day, the newly enrolled students of the Taoist Academy got up from their beds early. The excitement of going to school did not disappear, although I slept very late last night. But under the excitement of the spirit, the students look very good. After getting up, all of them consciously cleaned up their own room. This is also a rule set specifically by Wang Ran to cultivate their independence. Although most of the people looked very clumsy, it was obviously the first time to clean up the room by themselves. Many of the freshmen came from nobles but no one expressed dissatisfaction. In addition to their own sensibility, the driving of those around them is also indispensable. Sometimes, the impact of the environment on a person is so great. After most of the students awkwardly cleaned up their rooms, the second-year students also came to the freshman dormitory area. These veteran students led the freshmen to eat a meal in the college cafeteria, and then everyone went straight to the center of the college. By the way, the restaurant chefs of the Taoist Academy were carefully selected and sent in by M. Briggs Y. In addition, the ingredients are good, most of them are taken from the soul beasts, so the taste is good enough to make the students of civilian origin swallow their tongues. Of course, the price of the food in this restaurant is also very touching. Although it is consumed by contribution value, real money is not needed. But for the Daozang Academy, the Academy contribution points are more precious than the gold and soul coin. The current freshmen, because they have just entered school, after eating two meals, they are all in debt. Of course, the college lent 100 contribution points to the freshmen, and they ended up eating in the restaurant for two months. Just wait until later. There is not much digression, the freshmen at this time, under the leadership of the old students, quickly came to the center of the academy, where they just entered the academy yesterday. Here, Kian Renxiu and other senior students are already waiting here. With everyone on the scene, Kian Renxiu squeezed the seal and her spirit power penetrated the ground and touched a certain formation pattern underground. In an instant, a beam of light lit up on the ground. In a sense, the Taoist Academy is an existence isolated from the outside world. Because after Wang Ran built the Taoist Academy, he directly laid a formation covering the entire Academy. Without the token of Taoist Academy, it is impossible to enter the interior of the Academy through Taoist Plaza. This is also the reason why the parents could not walk half a step across Dezang Square. For those without a token, there is only one way to enter the Academy, and that is through the teleportation array that connects Dezang Square and the Academy. Although the students of the Academy have their own tokens, there is no way to transfer the array quickly. Therefore, at this time Kian Renxiu chose to use the teleportation array to bring everyone there. The illuminated beam is also a sign that the teleportation array is activated. As the beam of light lit and then fell, 
all the students instantly appeared on the Zhang Square. The newly enrolled students, taking the dormitory as a unit, gathered in twos and threes and were talking excitedly. Of course, because of birth reasons, most of the noble children gathered around are also noble children. Most of the students who came from civilians were also civilian students. This is also no way. After all, without the teaching and learning of the academy, even children will be affected in this world where the hierarchy is obvious. However, this situation will definitely change in the future. After all, there is a high probability that those who have not changed will be dismissed during the learning process. However, none of the students felt wrong at this time. Their energy has been put on the next thing. Because they all know that what is about to begin is what they said yesterday and belongs to their entrance ceremony. At this ceremony, they can also meet the dean of the college. Just as they were discussing what the dean was like and what college life would be like in the future, a shadow suddenly appeared in the mountains. As the freshmen looked up, a huge figure came into their eyes. It's the dragon, a black dragon. The speed of the black dragon is very fast, just before the students panic. The figure of the black dragon has already arrived on the square. Following this, a figure floated down from the black dragon. Not someone else, but an incarnation of Wang Ran, the dean of Taoist Academy. That black dragon is naturally the head of the beasts in the Star de Great Forest. With Wang Ran's fall, the Ditan in the form of soul beasts, his figure also rapidly reduced, transforming into a human form. At this moment, Emperor Tan didn't have the terrifying aura that Wang Ran would reveal when he first arrived in Duluo Continent, even if he didn't deliberately. On the contrary, the aura on Ditan at this time was very stable. This is exactly what the Emperor Tan has gained from practicing the heavenly demon Taoism in the past two years. Not only has his strength improved a bit, but his own breath has also stabilized. As Wang Ran and Dishan landed one after another, the noisy Daozhang square that had been chattering, instantly quieted down. Everyone's eyes were on Wang Ran and Di Tan. At the same time, three figures suddenly appeared beside Wang Ran, Ziji, Datong Mahuai, and an elegant woman. A woman with elegant temperament is also a fierce beast in the Stardu forest, and her body is the Emerald Swan Bridget. In the past two years, not only Dishan has gained, but the other fierce beasts in the Star to Great Forest have also been greatly improved. Although soul power has not been completely transformed into demon power, it has also made considerable progress, especially Bridget. Now he can switch between the spirit beast form and the human form at will. Although other fierce beasts can also switch human forms, they can't be as casual as Bridget. Therefore, the fierce beast teacher in the Taoist Academy now only has Bridget, except for Ditan and Zijit, who can be transformed from the beginning. However, other fierce beasts are coming soon. In less than half a year, Daozhang Academy will surely have a few more teachers who are born in the Star to Great Forest. Chapter 433 The Shortcomings of the Taoist Academy With the appearance of all the teachers of the Taoist Academy, the old students are okay, and the freshmen who are already nervous, dare not speak out. Except for the two Tibetan insiders, Ning Rongrong and Xiaowu, all the freshmen did not dare to breathe. Looking at the nervous students, Wang Ran chuckled and said, Hello classmates, I am your Dean Wang Ran. Following Wang Ran's voice, all the students felt like they were bathed in the spring breeze. The original nervous mood instantly relaxed. A simple sentence has such an effect. It can be seen that after two years, Wang Ran's strength has also greatly improved. Seeing the students who had relaxed, Wang Ran seemed to have expected it, and didn't care. With a smile still on his face, Wang Ran continued to speak. First of all, Everyone is welcome to study at the Taoist Institute. I hope everyone present can successfully graduate from the academy and become the elite of mankind. The few people around me are all teachers who will guide you in the future. I believe that under their guidance, each of you can grow into human pride. Next, Wang Ran talked freely on stage, and the students in the audience were also excited by listening. Under Wang Ran's guidance, all the students burst into infinite motivation. Of course, Wang Ran was not changing their will. This motivation is only due to the right time and place. Some people will maintain this motivation for a lifetime, but most people will forget these after a period of time. Wang Ran didn't have much to talk about. After the lecture, a teaching entrance ceremony was held and the students were disbanded. Originally, Wang Ran was going to go back to continue practicing and studying classics. After all, the threat of the God Realm should not be underestimated. Although a lot of progress has been made in the past two years, it is still far from enough compared to the God Realm. Therefore, his ontology has been practicing with great concentration, while the clone is in the Taoist Academy, studying classics that can quickly improve combat effectiveness. However, Wang Ran's idea was obviously going to fall, because when he was about to go back, Zijia suddenly stopped him. 
Saying that there was something to tell Wang Ran, taking Zhiji back to the palace where he practiced, Wang Ran sat on the futon, quietly looking at Zhiji in front of him. Zhiji didn't talk nonsense, and directly expressed her problem. Master, I think there are too few teachers in the current college. Hearing Zhiji's words, Wang Ran nodded lightly and said, Indeed, there are a lot of students enrolled this year, and relying on the four of you is indeed not enough. But you don't need to worry, Jun Xiong and the others are about to break through, when they come. It will be fine. Hearing this, Zijia shook her head. Wang Ran was stunned for a moment, looked at Zijia and asked, Why, isn't it enough? Hearing Wang Ran's words, Zijia did not nod or shook her head, but spoke, Enough is indeed enough, but the master, there will definitely be more and more students in the college. Although some people will be eliminated in the learning process, there will still be a huge base, especially when these students are in the later study, each of them will occupy more and more teacher resources. Moreover, Many things that students learn require us to learn first. In this way, the time we spend teaching students will be further reduced. And you emphasized elite education. We can't ignore any student. But in this way, there must be many shortcomings within the college. Such shortcomings will not get better until the first batch of students graduated and made some achievements, and then chose to return to the college to teach. Moreover, the teachers at the Taoist Academy are all Tibetans. Although I shouldn't say this, but the number of people in Zhangman is too small. And apart from Master Huai, you and your disciples, all belong to the Soul Beast clan. In this way, let's not say that it is not harmful to future threats from the gods, but the teaching of students is also limited. After listening to Zhiji's words, Wang Ran nodded gently. In the past two years, his energy has been mainly focused on improving his strength and he has not even traveled to the mainland. For Zhangman and Taoist Academy, there has been no vigorous development. What Zhiji said are indeed facts. Although Zhiji didn't know the divine battle that might occur in a few years, she was only faintly worried about the threat of the divine realm, but what she said was not unreasonable. Despite the threats a few years later, the people in Zhangman may not be able to intervene. However, you can't just look at the present, the future is also very important. Wang Ran is confident in himself, confident that he can survive the difficulties in a few years, but by that time, the first batch of students had already graduated. It is obviously too late to resolve these shortcomings by then, after all, the students of previous sessions have already been affected. Thinking of this, Wang Ran said softly, I know about this. I will go out to find more people who are suitable to join Zhangman and let them come to teach. A smile appeared on Zhiji's face when Wang Ran agreed. After arching her hands, Zhiji was about to retreat. But at this time, Wang Ran continued to ask, Wait a minute. Do you have a suitable recommendation for you? Zhiji was stunned when she heard Wang Ran's words. Originally, she was just making a suggestion, and she was not going to interrupt in such matters involving Wang Ran's decision. But now Wang Ran took the initiative to ask, she could only answer honestly. Sect Master, I have been cultivating in the Stardew Forest for these years so I don't know much about external affairs. There are even fewer things to know about the human world. However, I still know a thing or two about spirit beasts. In the far north, there are several fierce beasts. The strongest one, although he is not a god, but it is not a simple character. It's just that after so many years, I don't know if they are still alive. The far north, Wang Ran whispered softly when he heard Zhiji's words. Wang Ran is not very clear about the far north, although faintly remembered there were a few powerful soul beasts there, but they didn't know how strong they were. But now that Zhiji can mention it, those soul beasts are definitely qualified to join the Tibetan gate. With a light wave of his hand, Wang Ran said, Okay, I see. He'll go to the far north first. You can withdraw first. Zhiji didn't say much when he heard Wang Ran's words, and he bowed and exited the room. Chapter 434 Far North After Zhiji retired. Wang Ran sat on the ground and touched his chin, silently thinking about what Zhiji had just said. After a long time, Wang Ran stood up gently. He straightened his clothes and walked out of the room with his legs raised. After leaving the house, Wang Ran did not leave the Taoist Academy for the first time and went to the far north, but called several teachers from the college. Looking at Datongma Huai and others in front of him, Wang Ran said softly, I'm going out for a while and the college will be handed over to you during this time. Hearing Wang Ran's words, several people nodded, and Zhiji's eyes lit up even more. Wang Ran must have gone to recruit teachers for the academy when he went out. He didn't expect that Wang Ran was ready to act just as he finished talking about this matter. And Wang Ran, after seeing everyone nodding, spoke again. In addition, we will not recruit senior students for the time being in the past few years. In the past few years, you have studied the classics and improved your level. After that, 
prepare to recruit senior students. As Wang Ran's voice fell, everyone responded softly without any objection. After the explanation, Wang Ran waved his hand lightly, and then his whole person disappeared in the same place instantly. Seeing Wang Ran's sudden disappearance, Zijia laughed softly. It seems that in a while, we will have a few more colleagues. Hearing this, everyone looked at Zijin surprise. No one is a fool. If you want to be the opposite, the IQs of several colors are very high. With Zijia's words, everyone almost immediately understood what was going on. After getting in touch with Zijia, she had just approached Wang Ran, so don't ask. Zijia must have mentioned this matter. Li Tan smiled at Zijia, then said, You are quite courageous, but you did a good job. There is a real lack of teachers in the college. Hearing Li Tan's praise, Zijia waved her hand with a chuckle, and said, Master Edition has passed the award, but the sec master is gone, and then we will have to work harder. Hearing this, everyone nodded, and Datong Mahuii even directly said, That's right, let's go away if nothing has happened, and study the classics given to you by the bishop. Everyone knows Datong Mahuii's temperament, so as Datong Mahuii's voice fell, everyone answered, Don't worry, Master Huey. It's already lucky to be able to learn this kind of classics. How could we fall behind? Hearing what everyone said, Datong Mahui I didn't say much, nodded and turned around and left. As Huey left, the big beasts didn't stay, and turned around to go to their own affairs. Dot. At this time, Wang Ran, after he appeared again, had already come to the border of the Heaven Do Empire. Seeing the Baron scene round him, Wang Ran raised his head to recognize the direction, and his whole body instantly turned into a stream of light and galloped towards the far north. But in a moment, Wang Ran had already seen the snow and ice in the far north. The energy in his body exploded, and Wang Ran's entire body speed surged again, and he instantly entered the far north. As he entered the far north, the surrounding environment of Wang Ran instantly became a vast expanse of whiteness. The surrounding temperature also plummeted instantly. Wang Ran, in a long robe seemed a little out of tune with the surrounding environment. However, this biting chill did not cause any trouble to Wang Ran. Floating in the air, Wang Ran gently closed his eyes. The mental power was like a radar, burst out from Wang Ran's body in an instant, covering most of the far north. Wang Ran didn't know where the powerful existence Zijia said was, but he knew that there was absolutely no problem finding the strongest one in the far north. As Wang Ran's spiritual thoughts came out, the entire northern territory was like a naked little girl without a trace of secrets in front of Wang Ran. Wang Ran carefully searched all the energy-containing creatures in the far north, hoping to find the strongest existence. However, the far north is too big, even Wang Ran needs to find it slowly. Wang Ran just floated in the air like this, the snowflakes falling around, like eyes, did not fall towards Wang Ran's body. As time went by, Wang Ran suddenly opened his eyes. Looking at the other side of the far north, Wang Ran whispered with a chuckle, found it. You guys hide it quite deep. It's no wonder that Wang Ran said that. He just searched almost the entire Northern Territory, and indeed he found several good existences. One of them, even if the cultivation base is actually in the beast circle of the Star to Great Forest, it can still be ranked second, only under the Emperor Heaven. If it is calculated according to the age of the Soul Beast's cultivation, it is probably more than 700,000 years. Just when Wang Ran thought that this guy was the existence that Zijia said, and when he was about to stop, a strange energy fluctuation attracted Wang Ran's attention. It's not that this energy is huge, but this energy is too pure. Under curiosity, Wang Ran directly searched for the location of this pure energy. Originally, he thought it would be a kind of heaven, material and earth treasure, but as a result, his mental power went deep into the extreme north a few hundred meters deep, and Wang Ran found the source of this energy. There are indeed treasures of heaven, material and earth and there are countless ice chalcedony piles like ordinary ice blocks under the far north, among them, it is not even 10, 000 year level ice chalcedony, let alone other treasures spawned from ice chalcedony, it can be said that just the energy contained in the ice chalcedony is enough to create several divine residences, however, these were not what surprised Wang Ran, what surprised Wang Ran the most was the big sleeping snow white worm in the center of these ice chalcedony, although it was in a deep sleep, the ten pale golden round patterns on its body always flickered from time to time, exuding a stream of incomparable pure energy. The pure energy that attracted Wang Ran's attention just now was also this snow white insect. Wang Ran could feel an extremely huge energy from the body of this big bug. Even if it is only about the amount of energy, even Ross, who is watching the gate of the Taoist Academy, 
will not go. This kind of cultivation level has undoubtedly stepped into the level of the Duluo plane divine residence. Needless to say, this is definitely the powerful existence that Zuji said. As for whether or not to recognize the wrong person, although the circle of soul beasts is very large, there are only a few top ones. If there were spirit beasts at the divine mansion level in the far north, it would be impossible for Zuji, a fierce beast that had cultivated for hundreds of thousands of years, to know it and it was impossible not to tell himself in advance. I can't say that this big worm suddenly popped out of a crack in the rock. Chapter 435 Tanmin Ice Silkworm, Dream Emperor? Question mark. But what made Wang Ran a little puzzled was that Zijie said at the time that it was not as good as d -tan. But the current situation seems that Tishan's designation is unable to defeat this bug. Although d -tan's body is the golden eared Black Dragon King with strong offensive power, it can't stand the level of this bug has changed. However, when Wang Ran saw the dense ice chalcedony next to the big insect, he was a little relieved. It is estimated that this big bug has also made a breakthrough in recent years by relying on these talents. Although this big bug had a high cultivation base before, its combat effectiveness should be somewhat different from that of Ditan. After all, Zij also said, he didn't even know that the big bug was still alive. Thinking of this, Wang Ran also let go of the doubts in his heart, a flash, and headed towards the other side of the far north. While breathing, Wang Ran's figure appeared on an iceberg. Below the iceberg is the sleeping place of that big bug. Wang Ran didn't hesitate, with a single finger, and instantly a burst of energy gushed from Wang Ran's finger, and the iceberg at Wang Ran's feet, with the impact of this energy, broke through a tunnel directly underground. With the emergence of the passage, Wang Ran's figure did not stop, directly entering the passage. As Wang Ran deepened in the dark passage, a bright light suddenly appeared. When Wang Ran fell to the ground, the surrounding space was already very bright. These rays of light radiated from watching the ice chalcedony underground. Of course, what comes out with these lights is the cold that is unbearable for ordinary people. But these are not problems for Wang Ran. As Wang Ran fell into the ground, the scene below the ground officially came into Wang Ran's eyes. In the huge underground space, there are countless ice chalcedonies scattered everywhere. This scene is far more shocking than the one detected with mental power. However, Wang Ran didn't care about the treasures who could make people lose their lives and win. His gaze was fixed on the sleeping big bug not far away. After such a big movement, the big bug was still asleep and did not wake up, which surprised Wang Ran. Is it possible that he pretended? Want to be cruel to yourself when you relax your guard? When he found this place, Wang Ran suddenly became vigilant, although he didn't put the strength of Big Chong Tsai in his eyes. After all, Wang Ran's strength had improved a lot now. Even if it was his clone, Wang Ran was confident that he was not weaker than the second level he rose. However, if by any chance he is attacked by a big bug because he relaxes his guard, wouldn't it be very shameless? So, looking at the sleeping big bug, Wang Ran walked towards it carefully. The energy in the body was also mobilized at this moment to prevent the big bug from hitting himself hard. However, after Wang Ran was completely close to the big insect, the vigilance in his heart was completely dropped. No one because Wang Ran has already determined that the big bug is definitely still asleep, and it's the kind that sleeps soundly. This can be seen from the dripping saliva from the corner of its mouth. Wang Ran really couldn't imagine that a creature of this level would sleep so deeply. Is it possible that it has not experienced social beatings when it was young? Rubbing his eyebrows helplessly, Wang Ran shot a burst of energy at the big bug. In an instant, the big bug that was still asleep instantly ejected from the huge ice chalcedony. At the same time, a huge spiritual force burst out from the big insect. Wang Ran couldn't help but change his face due to this huge spiritual pressure. Although this is just a clone of Wang Ran, it can be so, and it can also be seen how huge the mental power of the big insect is. It is worthy of being a spirit beast of the divine residence divine residence level, and this mental power can already be comparable to the level 2 divine residence. Wang Ran softly said in admiration. However, another surprise flashed in his eyes. This time, it was a surprise. Being able to cultivate to this level in Duluo continent with the body of a soul beast, this big bug is really qualified to join the Tibetan sect. While all kinds of thoughts were still floating in Wang Ran's mind, the big bug who was awakened by Wang Ran also came from his background and said, Human, you are so bold that you dare to disturb the emperor's cultivation. Don't you know that this is the emperor's palace? What did Xi eat? They actually let you in. Believe it or not. I will eat you now, I. Hearing the crackling words of the big insect, Wang Ran couldn't help showing a black line in his forehead. He didn't know who the emperor was talking about in Big Chongzi's mouth, 
but it should be one of the several fierce beast level existences he had investigated before. But now he knows very well that this big bug is very long winded. Originally, even if the big bug chose to do it directly, Wang Ran understood it very well. But now, this big bug obviously didn't mean to do it. Instead, it kept talking endlessly and looking at the current situation. If you don't stop it from continuing to speak, it's probably going to be a long time to listen to him. The most important thing is that this guy is drooling because he just slept, and now his mouth is full of spitting. At this moment, Wang Ran said directly, Stop, stop, big bug, I have something to look for you this time. Unfortunately, D.A. Chongzai didn't understand the point of Wang Ran's words at all, or said it didn't believe Wang Ran's words at all. Therefore, the big bug did not stop but further released his spiritual coercion, threatening, who are you calling for the big bug? My name is Tanman I Silkworm, and everyone calls me Mendai. How dare you be so presumptuous? Do you really think I dare not take action? If you now kneel down and apologize to me, I can still consider whether to let you go. Although Tanman Binkin was making cruel words, a look of guilty conscience flashed in its eyes. Only it knows that it really dare not make a move, regardless of its high cultivation base. It is embarrassed to ask how it came from. If you really talk about combat effectiveness, he he, that would be really hard to say. But Wang Ran didn't know about these. When he saw the big insect, that is, the appearance of Tanman I Silkworm, Wang Ran was also speechless. He wasn't interested in the name of Tanman I Silkworm, no matter what name it is. Wang Ran must be unclear about it. What makes him speechless now is that Tanman I Silkworm clearly released his coercion and looked like he was going to take action at any time. But in the end he had to say harsh words here. This is really contradictory. Chapter 436 I slapped myself in the face Wang Ran didn't know Tanmeng Binken's guilty conscience, so he subconsciously believed that Tanmeng Binken was such a bad behavior. For this situation, Wang Ran felt that it was still easy to solve. It's not easy to communicate, so it's better to have a good meal. As for what Tanmeng Binken said to kneel down and apologize to him. Sorry, you are not thinking about fart. Therefore, Wang Ran looked at the arrogant Tanman Binken, and a little straightened his expression, and made a pleased gesture towards Tanman Binken. Seeing Wang Ran's appearance, Tanman Binken felt a little panicked. Who am I? Where am I? What am I doing? As the three questions of the soul appeared in the mind of Tanman I Silkworm, Tanman I Silkworm squatted and said, Well, what are you going to do? Is it possible that you still want to compete with the Emperor? Hearing Tanman Binken's words, Wang Ran nodded without denying and then said, of course, I will convince you to talk to me, do it, don't keep your hands, when you say you are not doing well, as Wang Ran's voice fell, Tanman Binken suddenly became confused, he did not expect that the first time he acted forcefully against humans, he would overturn the car, Wang Ran's reaction was completely different from what he thought, originally, in Tanman Binken's plan, Wang Ran would definitely not choose to do it, when he said two good things, he pretended to let him go. When Wang Ran is gone, he can sleep and practice happily again. As a result, Wang Ran didn't mean to regress at all. This was really a matter of disagreement. Wang Ran dare to do it. Does he dare to dream mice silkworm? That's definitely not dare. No one knows what level he is better than Tan Wang Binken himself, regardless of his cultivation base for millions of years. His energy is huge, but he will not mobilize at all and has no talent for attacking, even his body is like a ten perfect tonic to other creatures, in other words, he itself is like an oversized energy battery, which has no combat effectiveness at all, even a ten thousand year soul beast, even a stronger one year old soul beast, can rub him against the ground, under such circumstances, how could Tanman Binken dare to engage Wang Ran, as long as his attack power can match his realm, he doesn't have to brave a at first, therefore, facing Wang Ran who was ready to do it, Tanman Binken quickly said, wait, don't you have something to find the emperor? Let's talk about it first, let this indifferent fight aside. It's a pity that Tanman Binken's idea is good, but Wang Ran doesn't give him this opportunity at all. Wang Ran didn't have so much time to waste, and a match would not only be able to find out the strength of Tanman I Silkworm, but also convince him. Why not do such a thing? Therefore, Wang Ran frowned slightly when looking at the face of Tanman I Silkworm. No. I think after the fight, you can listen to me more. If you don't make a move, I will make a move. Hearing this, Tanman Binken suddenly panicked. Now he didn't care about any pretense, and quickly said, Don't, I can't wait for the treasures of heaven and earth here. It turned out that Tanman I Silkworm thought that Wang Ran came to divide the ice Kelsadni here. However, Wang Ran and Kiwi is such a superficial person. Although Tanman Binken's attitude change made Wang Ran feel weird, 
it didn't matter. Anyway, I decided to shoot. If there is something wrong, I will wait until the fight is over. At this point, Wang Ran didn't respond to Tanmen Binken's words at all, but instead sent a palm to him. Of course, Wang Ran didn't use all his strength, he just tried a little bit. After all, it would be embarrassing if the Tanmen I Silkworm was photographed into the Tanmen I Remnant. However, the 8th District www.dibux.top faced Wang Ran's light and fluttering palm, but Tanmen I Silkworm was unusually calm. It seemed as if Wang Ran's attack hadn't been put in the eyes, neither hiding nor counter-attack as if trying to carry it down with his body. Unfortunately, in the next second, the calm Tanwing I silkworm flew straight and horizontally like a kite with a broken string. At the same time, a mouthful of pale golden milky blood spouted from the mouth of Tanwing I silkworm. Seeing this scene, Wang Ran was stunned. Even the next attack that he had prepared was stopped in his hands. He really couldn't understand. Even if Tanwing Binken couldn't resist the attack just now, why didn't he avoid it? This kind of result always makes Wang Ran feel that he is a little bullying. Therefore, Wang Ran's brows were tightly locked together, and he looked at Tanmeng I Silkworm solemnly, and asked with some doubts, What do you mean, why don't you resist? Unfortunately, the Tanmeng I Silkworm was directly photographed back to its nature. He didn't expect that Wang Ran would be so strong. A slap, and such a casual slap, slapped himself seriously. If he hadn't cultivated for a million years, it was enough to be called a rough and thick skin, and Wang Ran's slap just now would definitely not have left any scum on him directly. Tanmen I Silkworm is a person who knows the time. Since he can't bluff Wang Ran, and can't beat Wang Ran, it's better to be a bit more conscious. As for face or something, he has never seen this thing before. Therefore, the Tanmen I Silkworm, who had slowed down, did not hesitate at all, and directly cried to Wang Ran and pleaded for mercy. Master, I was wrong so don't worry about me, you look at me, there is something you can see, just take it away, but, can you kill me, I have cultivated for so many years, it is really not easy, I have the old at the top and the young at the bottom, you just, the round body of Tan Mung Ice Silkworm, like a fat snake, writhed on the ground, Wang Ran had no doubt that if Tan Mung Ice Silkworm had a human form, it would definitely jump up and hug his thigh, while crying, he also wiped his nose on his thigh. A black line appeared on Wang Ran's forehead when he heard Tan Wing I Silkworm's words. Now, after hearing the increasingly outrageous words of Tan Wing Binken, Wang Ran's brows couldn't help but jump. He really couldn't understand why Tan Wing I Silkworm was so brazen. Aside from other things, there are old and small things. How did he say it embarrassingly? Tan Wing I Silkworm itself is already a million year old soul beast. So what price is his low see? I really couldn't bear the nonsense of Tanmen I Silkworm, Wang Rankian endured the idea of killing Tanmen I Silkworm, and said sharply, Okay, enough, talk again, I will make you fried Silkworm pupa. Chapter 437 Jiang Siwai can sleep hearing Wang Ran's threat, Tanmen Binken, who was still crying bitterly just now, stopped his voice instantly. Even Tanmen I Silkworm was so scared that he shrank his neck. However, at this time Tanmen Binkan's heart also relaxed. At least Wang Ran had no intention of killing him now, and his safety was already guaranteed. As Tanmen Binkan shut his mouth, Wang Ran instantly felt that his entire ears were clean. He didn't expect how the Tanmen I Silkworm, who had been pretending to be pretending just now, could cope so quickly. Seeing Tanmen Binkan, who was lying on his side, Wang Ran sighed with a headache. It's all right now. I was slapped in the face by myself. Tanmen I Silkworm is definitely not the existence that Zijia said. Even, this guy does not even have a name in the soul beast circle. Otherwise, relying on the bird look of Tanmen I Silkworm, it would have been swallowed into the stomach and turned into fertilizer. Thinking of his swearing look just now, Wang Ran couldn't help but touched his cheeks as if faintly aching. Looking at a group of Tanmen I Silkworms, Wang Ran said in an angry voice, From now on, I ask, you answer, you are not allowed to talk nonsense. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Tanmen Binken just nodded, not to mention how honest. Upon seeing this, Wang Ran's tone eased a lot. Although my heart was still depressed, it wasn't Tanmen Binken's fault. I could only break my teeth and swallow in my stomach. What's your name? My name is Tanmen I Silkworm, of course you can also call me Tanmen Brother. Tanmen Binken replied fluently, but in the end, his mouth began to scoop again subconsciously. Realizing this, Tanmen Binken hurriedly remedied. No, no, you can also call me Brother Tanmen. Wang Ran didn't care about Tanmen I Silkworm's mouth, and continued to speak. Who is the Snow Emperor in your mouth? How does it relate to you? Seeing that Wang Ran didn't care about his mouth, 
Tan Meng Bing Kan's face showed a sense of peace of mind. But in the next second, following Wang Ran's question, Tan Meng Bing Kan's face instantly showed embarrassment. Embarrassingly smashed his mouth, Tan Meng Bing Kan said in a serene manner, That Lord, Emperor Gzi was the overlord of the far north. It's just that I don't know Gzi. His name was also known from the soul beasts that came in by coincidence. Wang Ran was not surprised when he heard Tan Meng Bing Kan's words. It is not a shame for the weak to pull the banner of the strong in order to protect themselves. Therefore, Wang Ran didn't mean to laugh at Tan Meng I Silkwim. His current thoughts were all placed on this snow emperor, overlord of the far north. Not surprisingly, this snow emperor should be the person Zijie said. It's just that there won't be a new long like this time. Thinking of this. Wang Ran squinted his eyes and glanced at Tan Meng I Silkwim. After Wang Ran took such a look, Tan Meng Bing Kan's back instantly pulled cold. This human being, shouldn't it be the body of this handsome insect? Before Wang Ran said he wanted to make fried Silkwim pupa, Tan Meng I Silkwim felt that this possibility was really great. But Wang Ran still didn't allow him to speak at will, for fear that it would offend Wang Ran's Tan Meng I Silkwim and injured would be painful. Even the body couldn't control it, writhing on the ground. Seeing the appearance of Tan Meng I Silkworm, Wang Ran gave him a surprised look. What's wrong with this guy? What are you writhing around here? What do you want? Wang Ran asked Tan Meng Binken. Hearing this, Tan Meng Binken quickly shook his head and replied, No, nothing. It's just that I feel so honored to see you, and I can't help but want to move. Tan Meng I Silkworm didn't dare to tell the truth, if after asking the question, it turned the nothing into something, it would really have no place to cry. However, Tan Meng I Silkworm's blunt flattery almost hit the horse's legs. Cooperating with Tan Meng Bing Kan's movements, Wang Ran almost couldn't hold back and slapped him to death. He also saw that what Tan Meng Bing Kan was thinking was definitely not what he just thought, but he was also afraid that Tan Meng Bing Kan would challenge his bottom line again, so he wisely exposed this matter. After ignoring the flattery of Tan Meng Bing Kan, Wang Ran asked the question he was most interested in. Tell me honestly, how did you cultivate to the million year level? A dignified million year soul beast, whose strength is as low as yours, is also rare in the world. Hearing Wang Ran's question, Tan Wing I Silkwim was not ashamed. What happened to the million years soul beast? What happened to its slow strength? He is Tan Wing I Silkwim. As the Ice Silkwim clan at the bottom of the food chain in the far north, isn't it normal for his strength to be low? Besides, he has lived for so many years and has surpassed all the soul beasts in the world, shouldn't he be proud of it? But this process is a bit awkward. Therefore, Tan Meng Bing Kan felt embarrassed to answer Wang Ran's question. However, he didn't dare to go against Wang Ran's will. So after a moment of tweaking, Tan Meng I Silkworm replied honestly, My lord, let's not hide it from you. Actually, my cultivation base came to sleep. When I fell asleep and fell asleep, I would have broken through a million years sleep. Hearing Tan Meng Bing Kan's words, Wang Ran said in surprise, How can this process, this plot, be so familiar? Think about it carefully, isn't the hailing of the Hokage plane such an existence? But what was stronger than Tan Meng I's Silkwim was that hailing's attack power was still good. In this way, is there such a lucky person in every plane? The more I think about it, the bigger Wang Ran's brain is. But after Tan Meng Bing Kan heard Wang Ran's somewhat surprised voice, he thought Wang Ran didn't believe it. In order to prove his innocence, Tan Meng Bing Kan quickly said, My lord, what I said is true. Back then, I was still a ten-year level I silkworm, just to avoid the attack of natural enemies. I accidentally fell here. I didn't know what these ice marrows were at the time, it was just that I ate a little because of hunger. However, after I ate it, I felt sleepy, and then I fell into a deep sleep. When I woke up, my cultivation had already reached the hundred-year level. I didn't dare to go out. So I could only eat and sleep here, and eat after sleep. Later, I got used to this kind of life. The outside world is too dangerous. It is better to eat ice marrow here and sleep. I don't know how long it took, and I slowly broke through to my current state. Chapter 438 Bing by Emperor Scorpion Tan Wang Bing Kan's voice is very sincere, even a little excited. Wang Ran's divergent thinking was also pulled back by Tan Wang Bing Kan's words. Looking at Tan Wang Bing Kan, who was a little excited and afraid that he didn't believe it. Wang Ran smiled helplessly. In comparison, Tan Meng Bing Kan is the big winner in life. Dishan and the others have pursued the realm for hundreds of thousands of years, and this guy broke through when he fell asleep. This kind of life is quite enviable. Thinking of this, Wang Ran shook his head quickly and threw this unreliable idea out of his mind. Then he spoke softly to Tan Meng I Silkworm. Are you still going to keep sleeping here? That is to say, I didn't intend to kill you. If you changed someone, 
you would have been reduced to a spirit ring soul bone. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Tan Meng Binken felt a little indifferent. After all these years, no one except Wang Ran has been able to touch him in. As for the spirit ring spirit bone, just kidding, his Tan Meng brother's white and tender body can't produce spirit bone at first sight. His spirit ring is not something anyone can absorb. If you want to absorb his spirit ring, you are not afraid that you will be blown up. However, I think so, but Tan Meng Ice Silkworm dare not say so. Therefore, after hearing Wang Ran's words, Tan Meng Binken could only retort, My lord, do you think I should stay or not? When asked by Tan Meng Binken, Wang Ran was a little bit dumbfounded. How does Tan Meng Binken look like he is a villain? In desperation, Wang Ran said afterwards, Of course you decide on your own affairs, and I am not a zoo. However, if you want to leave, I can take you away, find a good place for you to practice, and improve your combat effectiveness. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Tan Meng Binken's heart immediately settled down. Powerful people of Wang Ran's level said that he had to decide for himself, so it was naturally impossible to be unbelievable. Therefore, no matter what choice he makes, there is no problem. So the question is, will Tan Meng I Silkworm leave? The answer is certainly number. He is Tan Meng Binken. Doesn't he smell good when he sleeps every day? Why should he leave? This place is safe and comfortable. How can it be changed? He dreamed of ice silkworms to die in the cold, to starve to death, or to be eaten by the soul beast, and it was impossible to leave here for half a step. Tan Meng I Silkworm, never a slave, is so hard spirited. Therefore, as Wang Ran's voice fell, Tan Meng Binken replied almost without thinking, My lord, thank you for your kindness. But I am used to living here and I am not going to. Who boom. It's a pity that the sky is unpredictable. And when Tan Meng Binken refuses Wang Ran, a sudden sound interrupted Tan Meng Binken's voice. In the quiet underground cave, any movement will be very obvious, not to mention the sound of the beating just now. Therefore, whether it was Tan Meng I Silkworm who was talking, or Wang Ran who listened to Tan Meng I Silkworm's words, he subconsciously forgot the place where his body sounds were made. The source of the sound was not from the sidelines, it was the passage that Wang Ran had just opened. At this moment, the originally empty passage came out, and a body was covered with hexagons one by one, shining with extremely bright luster, and the convex blue scorpion like a diamond appeared on the spot. Two pairs of huge front stings gleam with chilling light. However, the scorpion affected in this way does not look terrifying. If you think about it, the jasper cult scorpion gives people an indescribable beauty. The moment they saw this scorpion, Wang Ran and Tan Meng Ice Silkworm were both taken aback. Wang Ran didn't expect that he would be found here just after he finished speaking, and this was achieved. I'm afraid that this mouth is not completely opened. Moreover, this scorpion is one of the strongest existences in the far north. That's right, this jasper cult scorpion was one of the few fierce beasts that Wang Ran felt when he was exploring the far north. Unlike Wang Ran, the reason why Tan Meng I Silkworm was stunned was entirely because this jasper cult scorpion was so beautiful. Tan Meng I Silkworm, an innocent little bug that has lived for so many years, has no resistance to the beautiful opposite sex. Although, this opposite is not a race with him. But the next second, Tan Meng Binken suddenly yelled out, Bing by Emperor Scorpion. Wang Ran didn't know what race this scorpion was, but Tan Meng I Silkworm knew it. This jasper color is a scorpion, it is one of his worlds, the Ice Scorpion Clan and it is also the emperor of the ice scorpion clan, the ice scorpion emperor. Such an existence is at least 100,000 year level spirit beasts, a 100,000 year level soul beast, and also a Bing by emperor scorpion with extremely strong offensive power. It can be said that as long as Bing by emperor Xi thinks, Tan Meng I Silkworm is in front of it like a little chicken. Tan Meng I Silkworm is a little obsessed with the beauty of being by emperor scorpion, but that doesn't mean he wants to die. Maybe he will get acquainted later, he will be willing to die for the Bing by Emperor Scorpion. But now, they only met for the first time, so forget it. Therefore, Tan Meng I Silkworm was so flustered at this time. In addition to not wanting to die, it also comes from fear and panic about natural enemies. Tan Meng I Silkworm couldn't think of how Bing by Emperor Scorpion would find here. You know, here is the breath of 10,000 years of ice chalcedony. These ice chalcedony are quite dumb to cover up the breath. If it hadn't been for Tan Meng Binken accidentally exuding soul power before, even Wang Ran hadn't noticed it. Because of this, Tan Meng I Silkworm can hide here and sleep for millions of years. Suddenly, the flustered Tan Meng Binken suddenly thought of this. Looking at the passage above being by Emperor Xi's head, Tan Meng Binken suddenly looked at Wang Ran. He clearly remembered that there was no such passage before. Combined with Wang Ran's arrival, Tan Meng I Silkworm was quite sure that Wang Ran had definitely opened up the channel. After the passage was opened, 
The breath here leaked out, attracting the attention of the Bing by Emperor Scorpion, so it came here, thinking of this, Tanman I Silkworm felt abnormally wanting to cry without tears. Indeed, the facts are similar to what Tanman Binkin thought. After Wang Ran opened the passage, the aura containing the pure energy of Tanman I Silkworm leaked out a little, and there was a brief fight between Wang Ran and Tanman I Silkworm just now. Therefore, the attention of Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion, who was not far away from here, was directly attracted. Without hesitation, Emperor Bing Bai followed his breath and followed the passage left by Wang Ran to the underground cave. Chapter 439 Iron Bone Clank, Heaven Dream Ice Silkworm, the shock of the Ice Emperor however, what if Wang Ran caused all this? The result is already the case, is it possible that the Tanman Ice Silkworm can still blame Wang Ran for failing? Even if he thought so in his heart, Tanman Ice Silkworm didn't dare to show it. Bing Bai Emperor Scorpion can't afford to offend him but Wang Ran can't afford to offend either. He hasn't finished enjoying life yet, how could he be willing to die easily? Therefore, in order to save the life of Danman I Silkworm, he directly chose to hold the thigh. Bing by Emperor Scorpion is very strong, but he knows that Wang Ran is not weak either. In this situation, you can only choose to take a gamble. Without hesitation, Tanman Binken quickly said to Wang Ran, My lord, I won't stay here anymore. It's not good at all. It's boring and dangerous. I decided to go with you. Well, the ironclad heavenly dream ice silkworm, after all, can't escape the law of true fragrance. At this time, the Bing by Emperor Scorpion, who had been observing Tanmeng ice silkworm and Wang Ran from a distance, was also sure that this transaction could be done. Although the aura on Tanmeng ice silkworm is very strong, it is only ice silkworm after all. An ordinary ice scorpion of ten years can easily kill ice silkworms that are hundreds or even thousands of years old. I am the emperor of the Bing Bai Scorpion clan, the Bing Bai Emperor Scorpion who has been cultivated for 400,000 years, is it possible to be afraid of a big bug? As for the human being next to him, although the depth is not visible, how strong can the human be? Even though Wang Ran was a title duo among human beings, Emperor Bing Bai. Emperor Scorpion had the confidence to the heavenly dream ice silkworm from Wang Ran's hands. This breath, this appearance, this big bug has been cultivated for millions of years. Where is the ice silkworm? This is simply a panacea for living. As long as the Tanman ice silkworm arrives, not only will there be no hidden danger for my sister's next heavenly tribulation, but my next heavenly tribulation will not even be a concern. Not only that, the strength of the two can also be greatly improved. As soon as he thought of this, the eyes of Emperor Bing Bai and Emperor Scorpion showed a trace of greed. Even the corners of his mouth couldn't help revealing a sparkle. Seeing this scene, Tan Wing I Silkworm instantly felt so difficult. Finally, Wang Ran didn't pay his attention, and as a result, another Bing Bai Emperor Scorpion came. If you are simply greedy for his Tan Wing brother's body, he might agree with a twist. But you want to take him to drink and drink. How can this work? Therefore, Tan Wing Bing Khan's body leaned against Wang Ran's side quickly and his eyes slowly seemed to please him. Wang Ran looked at this spineless worm next to him, and he was really helpless to complain. He even wanted to go back and let this guy teach the students in the future, for fear that the atmosphere of the whole college might not be taken away. At this moment, Emperor Bing Bai finally spoke. The cold female voice suddenly rang in the ears of Wang Ran and Tanman Binken. Human, you give me this ice silk worm, and I can let you go. Hearing the voice of Emperor Bing Bai Emperor Scorpion, Tanman Binken suddenly felt that his bones were crisp. Although the purpose of Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion is impure, although he does not have bones. When Wang Ran looked at Tanman Binken's unpromising appearance, he was speechless, and his regret became more intense. Isn't it just a woman? Dot 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 oh, no, a female scorpion? This picture has never been seen before. However, after Wang Ran had said everything, it was naturally impossible to treat it as fat. Therefore, after Wang Ran glanced at Tanman I Silkworm disgustingly, he turned to look at Emperor Bing Bai and said, Don't think about this. I promised to take him away and I will do it. However, there is something I want to talk to you about. And me. Wang Ran wanted to invite Bing Bai Emperor Xi to join the Taoist Academy and become a teacher. After all, Bing Bai Emperor Scorpion's strength was not bad, and he was an extremely good candidate. But unfortunately, before he finished speaking, he was interrupted by Emperor Bing Bai Emperor Scorpion. Enough. I don't want to hear you say it's useless. Since you are not going to hand over the ice silk worm to me, then I can only get it myself. When the words fell, Emperor Bing Bai, Emperor Scorpion immediately shot. For her, Tanman ice silk worm can be said to be a life-saving medicine. And she is not alone, she and her Xvi sister. This kind of million-year-old ice silk worm, which is usually untouched in a lifetime, was finally met by her. How could she give up? 
Wang Ran's move is tantamount to breaking the road and killing his life. Therefore, the Bing by Emperor Huang Xi did not show mercy at all, and the shot was the pinnacle. Faced with the terrifying blow of the Bing by Emperor Scorpion, Dan Min Binken, who was hiding behind Wang Ran, was not worried. Anyway, with Wang Ran blocking in front, there is no need to worry. But if Wang Ran couldn't stop him, it would be useless to worry. On the contrary, the Tanmeng Ice Silkworm was still behind Wang Ran and Bing by Emperor Xi said. What ice silkworm? I am different from different ice silkworms. I am Tanwing ice silkworm. You can also call me Tanwing brother. Wang Ran felt that he had developed antibodies to the shamelessness of the Tanwing ice silkworm. Ignoring the Tanwing ice silkworm that forced Lei Lai, Wang Ran stretched out his palm towards the oncoming Bing by Emperor Scorpion. At this time, Emperor Bing by Emperor Xi was furious when he watched Wang Ran just stretch out his palm when facing him. He is the Bing by Emperor Scorpion and Wang Ran dares to look down upon himself so much. It is simply unbearable. Under the anger, the chill on the front claws of Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion became even worse. In the next second, Wang Ran's palm and the front claws of Bing by Emperor Scorpion slammed together. Suddenly, a muffled noise came from the palms of the two. Emperor Bing by looked at Wang Ran in horror. Although she was not big, it was still compared with the soul beast. Compared with Wang Ran, she is still very big. But at this moment, she felt her front pincers as if they had been hit on a piece of cold marrow that had never melted forever. No, even the chill that hasn't been melted for 10,000 years, under the blow of her anger just now, it will be broken into pieces. But in the face of Wang Ran's human palms, her ice emperor's claw, which was enough to kill a 100,000 year soul beast, was like a soft pink fist of a human girl, without harm at all. However, the shock of Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion was far from over. After resisting the blow of Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion, Wang Ran directly shot her on the ground with his backhand. Without pause, Wang Ran stretched out his right hand again, and a large number of runes emerged directly from the palm of his hand, instantly enveloping the entire body of Emperor Bing Bai. Immediately afterwards, a rope formed by energy transformation directly used the body of the Bing Bai Emperor Scorpion as a crab, and was tightly bound. Chapter 440 The Ice Emperor Hates It, and Tanmen Bing Silkworm Hurt Wang Ran made a lot of movements and it seemed that it would take a long time. However, in fact, time only passed one breath. The Bing by Emperor Scorpion, who was still shocking Wang Ran's strength just now, felt his body in a constant state in the next instant. Immediately afterwards, his whole body was instantly photographed on the ground. Before she could react, there was a feeling of weakness in her body. Not only that, but the next second is even more restrained, unable to move at all. At this time, Emperor Bing Bai also reacted. Wang Ran was definitely not the one she could provoke. No wonder Tan Wing Ice Silkworm still didn't panic after seeing him. It turned out that he had such a backer. However, she understood it was too late. The current Bing by Emperor Scorpion has become Wang Ran's captive. Where will a spirit beast of his level fall into the hands of humans? Thinking of this, a sorrow flashed in the eyes of Emperor Bing by Emperor Xi. She was not afraid of death, she was just sad for the fate of the soul beast for the future of that person. The Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion who was captured by Wang Ran had already begun to die, so she did not speak, but slowly closed her eyes. Wang Ran saw this scene and slowly said, Are you going to die so easily? Wang Ran could feel her will to die from the spirit fluctuations of Emperor Bing by Emperor Xi, so he said back, It's a pity that Emperor Bing by didn't answer her question head at all, and he said directly, Humans. Don't talk nonsense. I have recognized your human virtues a long time ago. Don't try to extract useful information from me. If you want to do it, just do it. Don't talk so much nonsense. Hearing this, Wang Ran suddenly felt a little bitter to laugh. What and what was all this? Helplessly rubbing his eyebrows, Wang Ran said with a wry smile, You think too much. I'm not going to kill you. If you want to go the other way, I want you to follow me. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Emperor Bing Bai opened his eyes. A flash of light flashed away. However, this light is not a light of excitement, but a light of contempt. Without following Wang Ran's intention, Emperor Bing Bai directly said, Then you still kill me? As Emperor Bing Bai's words fell, Wang Ran frowned slightly. However, he was not angry, but asked, Why? The ants still survive? How can you make a decision so easily? Besides, I didn't tell you what to do with me. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Emperor Bing Bai let out a disdainful laugh, slowly speaking. No matter what you ask me to do, I won't follow you. Besides, I don't think you humans will have any good intentions to surrender to human things. Only the scum of the soul beast realm can do it. Having said that, Emperor Bing Bai Huang Xi looked at Tanmen Ice Silkworm with contempt. For the powerful Wang Ran, she had nothing to say, 
even some admiration, but for a dog-legged Tanwing Ai silkworm, she extremely despised it. However, the eyes of Emperor Bing by Emperor Xi directly caused Tanwing Ai silkworm to blow up its hair. If you talk about scum, just talk about scum, you little girl. What do you see in his heavenly dream Ai silkworm? He is not a scum, just knowing the current affairs. Besides, is there a scum that can look as suave as his Danmen brother? The somewhat exploded heavenly ice silkworm seen by Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion twisted his fat body and climbed directly in front of Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion. Looking at the Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion who was with energy by Wang Ran, Tanwing Ice Silkworm said with a bit of shame, Ice Emperor, although you are very beautiful, you can't just frame bugs indiscriminately. I, Tanwing Ice Silkworm, a dignified million year old soul beast. How could I be a scum in the world of soul beasts? Being able to do things under the command of an adult is a rare opportunity for us. So, Bingja, I advise you to follow along, so that the two of us can also start a story, right? I have to say that Tanman I Silkworm has the potential to be dog legs. As soon as he decided to take refuge in Wang Ran, his position had begun to lean towards Wang Ran. Of course, there are many elements in the body of the Emperor Bing by Emperor Scorpion in Tanmeng I Silkworm. And hearing the words that Tanmeng I Silkworm said more and more outrageous, especially the last sentence, directly made the Bing by Emperor Scorpion, the Ice Emperor, feel sick. If it weren't for such things as goosebumps, Bing Dai would feel his goosebumps have fallen off. Therefore, after Tanmeng Bing Khan's voice fell, Bing Dispody directly emitted an aura that couldn't be colder. Staring fiercely at the Tanmeng I Silkworm, the Bing Dai spoke word by word, go away, you disgusting thing. Hearing the voice of Bing Dai, Tan Meng Ai Silkworm, who had just been happily and energetic, stiffened instantly. The expression of excitement just now solidified on his face. Ha ha. With an embarrassing laugh, Tan Meng Bing Khan felt a little empty in his heart now. This strange feeling was the first time he felt it in his life. Looking at the hit Tan Meng Ai Silkworm, Wang Ran didn't mean to sympathize. Wang Ran heard all the conversation between Tan Wang Binken and Bing Dai just now. Thinking in another way, if he were the Ice Emperor, he would probably also treat Tan Wang I Silkworm. This matter can only be blamed on the current Tan Wang I Silkworm, whose ek is a bit low. Unfortunately, relying on Tan Wang I Silkworm's current insights, he couldn't realize that the root of the problem was his own. The lost Tan Wing Ai Silkworm glanced at the Ice Emperor with some bewilderment. It's a pity that the only exchange for cold eyes is full of murderous intent. Feeling the disgust of Bing Dai, Tan Wing Bing Khan also fell silent. All of a sudden, the entire underground cave fell into a strange silence. After a while, Tan Wing Ai Silkworm couldn't help but reminded, Although you don't want to listen, I still advise you to follow the adult's advice. As Tan Wing Bing Khan said, he saw what Bing Dai wanted to say. Without giving the Bing Dai a chance to speak, Tan Meng Bing Khan quickly interrupted. Don't scold me in a hurry, just listen to me. With the interruption of Tan Meng I Silkworm, the Ice Emperor, who just wanted to speak, withdrew the words he was about to say after a little thought. Tan Meng I Silkworm is also a soul beast, and it is still a soul beast that can be cultivated for millions of years with the help of a lower race like Ice Silkworm, although he is very annoying. The Bing Dai decided to give him a chance to see what he would say from his mouth. Seeing the silent Bing Dai, Tan Meng Bing Khan breathed a sigh of relief. Chapter 441 Shi Xi Although he doesn't love face very much, if Bing Dai scolds him again, he doesn't know if he still has the courage, so he will continue. Fortunately, none of this happened. After taking a deep breath, Tan Meng Bing Khan slowly said, Ice Emperor, some soul beasts accidentally broke into my place before. Therefore, I know you will have a catastrophe in less than 100,000 years, and the power will be greater than once. Although I haven't experienced it, I also know that every time I cross a catastrophe, it must be a lifetime of nine deaths. I see your cultivation base. It is estimated that it will not take 10,000 years, the next catastrophe will come. Bing Dai was not surprised that Tan Meng Ice Silkworm could see through her cultivation. Although Tan Meng Ice Silkworm's combat effectiveness is not very good, after all, the realm is placed here. Therefore, as Tan Meng Bing Khan mentions heavenly tribulation, even though Bing Dis heart is very solemn, on the surface, he just nodded calmly and couldn't tell what she was thinking. Tan Meng Ice Silkworm didn't care too much. After seeing the Bing Emperor nodding, Tan Meng Ice Silkworm continued to speak, this time the catastrophe, it is estimated that it will be difficult for you to resist it. Although I can't help it, you should also understand that he is really strong. If it were him, he might be able to help you through this catastrophe. After the conversation, Tan Meng Bing Khan let out a long sigh of relief. Tan Meng Bing Khan didn't know Wang Ran's name, so he just used him instead. But who he was referring to, Tan Meng Bing Khan and Bing Dai knew very well. However, even though the words were over, 
Ten Meng Binken didn't hold much hope at this time. After all, the Ice Emperor was not afraid of death from the beginning. I don't know how many years later the catastrophe could affect her mood. The reason why Ten Meng Ice Silkworm wanted to say it was that he didn't want to see the Ice Emperor die in vain, hoping that a higher realm could attract the Ice Emperor. However, as Dan Meng Binken's voice fell, Bing Dis reaction far exceeded his expectations. Because, the Bing Dai expression changed at this time, and was no longer as calm as before. Even, it can be said that I am a little excited. Indeed, the Bing Dai was a little excited at this time. She can die, but that person cannot die. You should know that he is only 400,000 years of tribulation, and he is no longer sure. That person is going to survive 700,000 years of tribulation. Because she was hostile to Wang Ran, she didn't think about asking Wang Ran for help. But now with the mention of Tan Meng Ai Silkworm, the Ice Emperor instantly reacted. Without a chance, Tan Meng Ai Silkworm, Bing Dai directly turned his gaze to Wang Ran. Looking at Wang Ran's calm eyes, Bing Dai felt a bit dry in his mouth. Thinking about his previous performance, he didn't know how to speak. However, when he thought of that person, Bing Dai's eyes became firm. That dot 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 big dot 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 sir. Is what Tanman I Silkworm said true? You dot 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 do you really have a way to help the soul beast survive the catastrophe? Bing Dis voice was stumbling, and it could be seen that her heart was very uneasy at this time. It can also be seen how much determination she has made. Talking to Wang Ran, even the honorific title was used, completely discarding her own pride. Seeing all this Tanman Binken, his heart is hesitating. He didn't understand why the proud Ice Emperor would compromise nor why she put her posture so low. However, it doesn't matter anymore. At the very least, it shows that my persuasion is useful. As long as Wang Ran really had a way, then the Ice Emperor would not seek death. Without mentioning his careful thoughts, at least the Soul Beast clan would not lose a top powerhouse. Thinking of this, Tan Meng Binken also turned his gaze to Wang Ran, staring at him shiningly, looking forward to his answer. Under the scorching gazes of Tan Meng Binken and Bing Dai, Wang Ran was still so calm. At first he nodded calmly, but then shook his head again. When Wang Ran nodded, Tan Meng Binken and Bing Dai were overjoyed. But as Wang Ran shook his head, the two of them couldn't help but hang up again. My lord, what do you mean? Different Bing Dai spoke, Tan Meng Binken took the initiative to ask. Following the question of Tan Meng Ai Silkworm, Wang Ran finally spoke out. After taking a breath, Wang Ran slowly said, It's not a problem to help the soul beast survive the catastrophe. But I don't want to do that, rather than going through the catastrophe by the hands of others. Wouldn't it make more sense to go through it yourself? In addition, you shouldn't want me to help you through the catastrophe, but help others through it. At the end of the speech, Wang Ran's tone was a little more teasing, and his gaze at the Bing Dai was a little more interested. The Ice Emperor had asked him if he could help the Soul Beast through the catastrophe, not if he could help himself through the catastrophe. Although it's just the difference between two words, the information contained in it is vastly different. Wang Ran naturally heard the difference. He was really curious about who could make the Ice Emperor put down his persistence and change his mind. After Bing Dai heard Wang Ran's ridicule, there was no mood swing. The decision has been made, and according to her character, no changes will be made. What's more, Wang Ran said that he has the ability to help spirit beasts survive the catastrophe. The biggest worries were gone, and Bing Dai's heart became more calm. Therefore, facing Wang Ran's witty gaze, Bing Dai was silent for a while, and then answered, Indeed, I don't want to ask you to help me through the catastrophe. The target is someone else. As long as you agree, I am willing to follow your arrangements. As long as it is not against my principles, I will try my best to do it. Hearing Bing Dai's answer, Wang Ran nodded gently. Sure enough, things were the same as he thought, but he didn't know who this person was. With doubt, Wang Ran directly asked, May I ask, who is this person you want me to help? Hearing Wang Ran's question, Bing Dai was a little worried. She was also not sure. Now let Wang Ran know whether the person she wants him to help is good or bad. However, this concern only disappeared in an instant. After all, Wang Ran will know it sooner or later, and that person's reputation is also very big, and his concealment is completely meaningless. Therefore, in just a few breaths, the Ice Emperor made a decision. Looking at Wang Ran, Bing Dai replied softly. The person I want adults to help. The adults should have heard of her name. She is the overlord of the far north, Snow Emperor. Chapter 442 Bing Dis Choice Snow Emperor After hearing Bing Dis answer, Wang Ran whispered, The overlord of the far north, Emperor Gs, is about to cross the robbery. It seems that the timing of this visit is not bad. If it is a few more nights, maybe he will miss such a good candidate. Moreover, this Xdi, if nothing else, should be his original goal of this trip. Thinking of this, Wang Ran's face showed a smile. Looking at the Ice Emperor, 
Wang Ran slowly said, you don't have to worry about the Xi. One of my own purposes when I came to the far north this time was to find her. So, even if you don't tell me, I will help her solve her troubles. So, what is your choice now? Wang Ran did not deceive the Bingdai to make her submit. Wang Ran didn't even bother to do this kind of dishonest thing. And Bingdai, at this time, also admired Wang Ran's large number. However, she did not answer immediately, but stared at Wang Ran's eyes seriously, and asked seriously, My lord, I don't know what your purpose is to find Emperor Xi. The Ice Emperor had to be cautious. Wang Ran's strength was definitely much stronger than Xu Emperor, because Xu Emperor had no way to make the Ice Emperor completely lose his resistance with a single blow. Under this circumstance, Bing Dai had to carefully consider Wang Ran's purpose of searching for Xi. Wang Ran didn't feel surprised when he saw Bing Dai's cautious appearance. This is not a shameful thing. So Wang Ran directly answered Bing Dai, Don't worry, my purpose in searching for Xi is the same as what I want you to do, but I want you to be a teacher in my college. And during your tenure, the academy will provide practice methods that will enhance your strength. If you perform well, I will lead you to join my sect. After listening to Wang Ran's words, Bing Dai was confused. She originally thought that Wang Ran wanted to subdue herself become a mount or a thug, but turned out to be a teacher in his academy. I really couldn't believe it, the Ice Emperor subconsciously asked, go to your college to be a teacher, who do you teach? Humans? Hearing this, Wang Ran nodded without refusal, and said, naturally be a teacher, but the students are not necessarily all humans, but there are also soul beasts in form. Hearing Wang Ran's words, Bing Dai was speechless, there are soul beasts in form, that is, most of the students are humans. She didn't resist this incident so much, she just taught humans to cultivate. How can this kind of thing look unreliable? Although it is not difficult for her to teach human cultivation, the premise is that others dare to learn from her. But is it possible? Anyway, she is also in the body of a soul beast. It's not bad for those humans to see her not afraid. They still study. Therefore, after the Bing Dai was silent for a while, he directly said to Wang Ran, do you think that after humans see me, except for fear and greed, what else is left? Hearing what the Ice Emperor said, Wang Ran gave a soft smile, he naturally heard what the Ice Emperor meant. But is this still a problem, let alone a soul beast with a high level of cultivation? It is already capable of transforming into a human form, it's just that the soul beast aura on the body is too heavy. Is it just the secret of Zangman? The method of transformation is not too much. It's like those fierce beasts in the Stardew Great Forest. After practicing the method of Zangman, which one can be found after being transformed into a human form, is there any difference? Therefore, Bing Dis worries were not a problem for Wang Ran at all. Therefore, Wang Ran shook his head at the Ice Emperor, and said to the Ice Emperor with a smile on his face, Of course you don't need to worry about these. I said before, it will provide you with a powerful method of cultivation. This includes the art of transformation. As long as you have cultivated it, even if it is titled Duo, as long as you don't observe carefully, you won't find any difference between you and ordinary human beings. Hearing Wang Ran's vowed words, Bing Dai was silent for a moment. She did not doubt the information Wang Ran said. Since Wang Ran dared to speak, it proved that these things are true. The current Tice Emperor was just thinking about whether to agree to Wang Ran's suggestion. In other words, she was speculating whether Xi would agree to Wang Ran's invitation. However, the silence passed quickly. At this time, the Ice Emperor had a somewhat more solemn look. The Emperor Xi might not agree, but she had to let the Emperor Xi agree anyway, because, Xi's next heavenly tribulation would be too dangerous. In order for Xi to survive the tribulation safely and to survive smoothly, the conditions promised to Wang Ran were not unacceptable. As long as Xi can survive, Bing Dai will be willing no matter what he does. What's more, now, not only can you cultivate without danger, but you can also have more time with Xi in the future. Faced with such a situation, Bing Dai was not prepared to refuse. So, after thinking about it, Bing Dai nodded gently, with a dignified look in his eyes. The Ice Emperor spoke to Wang Ran earnestly, I am willing to agree to you, but there is a prerequisite, that is, you must allow Xi to agree. After hearing Bing Dis words, Wang Ran showed a satisfied smile on his face. Deal. With a smile in his mouth, Wang Ran said seriously to the Ice Emperor. At the same time, as the voice fell, Wang Ran's heart also moved. In an instant, the energy chains that bound the Ice Emperor disappeared instantly, and at the same time the runes that sealed her cultivation base also disappeared in the air. Feeling the regained strength of his body, the Bing Dai didn't say much after propping up his body from the ground, but stood quietly behind Wang Ran. Seeing this scene, Tan Meng Bing Khan's eyes revealed a touch of joy. However, instead of talking to Bing Dai, he asked Wang Ran, 
That Lord, what about me? What are you going to let me do? Hearing Tan Meng Bing Khan's question, Wang Ran's face suddenly went dark. However, although Tan Meng Bing Khan's character is a bit hard to laugh at, it has to be said that it is indeed a good choice for Tan Meng Bing Khan to teach the students of the Taoist and Tibetan Institute. After all, the Tan Meng Ice Silkworm is also a true million year soul beast. Not only the realm is high and deep, even the spiritual power is far beyond the ordinary divine residence. With such a teacher, the student's spiritual path will naturally be more stable and safer. Therefore, although Wang Ran had ridiculed a bit before thinking about regretting, it was just a ridicule after all. Now, Wang Ran still responded to Tan Meng Bing Khan, You too, go to my college to be a teacher. Chapter 443 Emperor 440 Wang Ran's answer made Tan Meng Bing Khan's heart instantly settle down. However, the next second came out of Wang Ran's mouth, making Tan Meng Bing Khan's heart tense again in an instant. However, although your cultivation base is very high, your strength is really a bit too weak, and it can even be said that you are sorry for your own cultivation base. Therefore, in addition to practicing the art of transformation with other people and other classics that must be learned by teachers, you must also improve your own strength. Not to mention more, at the very least, you have to use your cultivation base. With the end of Wang Ran's voice, the heart held by Tan Meng Bing Khan was instantly let go. Fortunately, Wang Ran didn't regret it, he just asked for more. Isn't it just to improve my strength all at once? Anyway, there is a practice method provided by Wang Ran. Tan Meng Bing Khan's heart silently said with emotion. However, after hearing Wang Ran's tone of hatred for iron and steel, Tan Meng Bing Khan's desire to become stronger became stronger. Seriously nodded towards Wang Ran, Tan Meng Bing Khan directly expressed his attitude. Wang Ran didn't say anything more about this, but slightly waved his sleeves at the surrounding area. In an instant, the underground cave that was originally filled with ice calcedony and other heavenly materials and earth treasures instantly became clean. Where are the treasures of heaven and earth? Naturally, they all went into Wang Ran's pocket. Since this place is about to become a land of no owner, why do you leave so many treasures? It might as well be straightforward and bring it back to the college for students and teachers to practice, whether it's alchemy or equipment training. Even if it's condiments, it's a very good choice. Dot. After Wang Ran put away the many treasures of heaven, material and earth, the entire underground cave fell into darkness in an instant. Tan Meng I Silkworm, who is the master of this place, naturally understands what happened just now. To be honest, Tan Meng I Silkworm has been watching these ice calcedony and the like for so many years. On weekdays, he doesn't think these things are precious at all. What's more, now these ice calcedony, since he broke through a million years of cultivation base, the effect has been much less than before. Although there are some effects, but it is not very obvious. Naturally, Tan Meng I silkworms can't say how rare it is to live these natural treasures. But at this moment, with everything in Wang Ran's pockets, Tan Meng Bing Khan felt a heartache that was difficult to understand. However, he could not express it either. Some things that were present, Wang Ran took away and took away. What's more, he didn't have a chance to express his heartache. Because, after Wang Ran took away these things, he directly played a spell. In an instant, the entire underground cave was lit up. It was like the ground directly hit by sunlight. As the underground cave lit up, Wang Ran also spoke to Tan Meng I Silkworm. Don't you have to feel bad about these things? What I want to teach you is more than a hundred times more precious than these heavenly materials. And these things are not used by me. Are they brought back to the college for all the teachers and students to use? Including you. Do you think it is? Make a contribution to the college in advance. Hearing Wang Ran's words. Tan Meng I Silkworm's fat insect face. A team of ice silkworms showed a smile that was even worse than crying. He dare not say that he loves these things. He can only answer with a wry smile. Sir, it's okay. These things are not rare in my heavenly dream. As long as you need it, just take it. I don't care at all. Really? I don't feel bad at all. Hearing Tan Meng Bing Khan's words insincere, Wang Ran just smiled. He didn't say much. The Ice Emperor also showed a touch of contempt, which made Tan Meng I Silkworm very injured. Why? He contributed all his family resources. So why was he despised? But Tan Meng I Silkworm didn't dare to talk to Bing Dai now, and could only take it all alone. Silently, ignoring the Tan Meng Ice Silkworm who had a lot of inner drama, Wang Ran spoke to them. Let's go, let's meet the overlord of this far north and see what she means. Following Wang Ran's voice, neither Tan Meng Bing Khan nor Bing Dai had any objection. Following Wang Ran honestly, the three left the underground cave directly. Not to mention that there is such a small traitor as the Ice Emperor around him, just relying on Wang Ran's tyrannical mental power to search, as the overlord of the far north, 
the location of the snow emperor is not a secret. After all, just find the one with the strongest cultivation base. For a guy like Tanman Ice Silkworm that can't be treated according to common sense, there is one in the entire Duluo continent that has come to an end. Therefore, after returning to the ground in the extreme north, Wang Ran and his party quickly found the place where Xvi practiced, a valley full of white snow. Looking at the snowy valley in front of him, Wang Ran's eyes also showed a hint of curiosity. He wanted to know what kind of existence Xvi was as the overlord of the far north. And behind the three of them, there was also an unusually tall existence at this time. This tall existence is not someone else, but the Titan Snow Demon, one of the three northern kings. As one of the three kings of the north, although only ranked third. However, the Titan Snow Demon, who has the bloodline of the Ice God and 20 years of cultivation base, is not unforgiving. However, at this time, this powerful Titan Snow Demon had a bitter look on his face, faintly swollen, hidden under his hair. As a loyal supporter of the Snow Emperor, although his mind was not simple, the Titan Snow Demon wants to come to visit the Snow Emperor on a whim today. By the way, I can find trouble with that little eye spare. As a result, he ran into the Ice Emperor just as soon as he left the house. Moreover, the Bing Dai followed a human with a large bug with a deep cultivation base. I am also a low-mouthed person, why do I have to provoke that human being? Obviously that human looks like an uncomfortable look. The result is also very obvious, with his own provocation first, plus his own expression of purpose behind. Under the circumstances that Wang Ran has not yet expressed his position, the Ice Emperor, who was originally upset by the Titan Snow Demon, and suffocated his stomach, made a move. The Titan Snow Demon is not Wang Ran, and is not an opponent of Ice Emperor at all. After the Ice Emperor's violent beating, the Titan Snow Demon realized that he would be fine again in the future. Chapter 444 A Sharp Inquiry Wang Ran still feels strange about this. Why did the Ice Emperor react so much to the Titan Snow Demon? How did he know that the two were rivals in love at the beginning? How could the Ice Emperor be happy with the Titan Snow Demon? However, it was precisely because of this incident that behind Wang Ran and his group, there was a Titan Snow Demon King who was devastated by the Ice Emperor. Of course, the Titan Snow Demon didn't know the purpose of Wang Ran. Dot. Just when Wang Ran arrived in Snow Valley and was wondering what the Snow Emperor was like, a sound suddenly came from the valley. Looking towards the place where the sound was made, a huge white bear appeared in everyone's eyes. Although it was the first time we met, the familiar appearance of Bei Ixun still gave Wang Ran a faint sense of familiarity in his heart. However, Bei Ixun would not care about a human being like Wang Ran now. The white bear, who had just walked out of the valley, immediately focused on the Ice Emperor. For the first time, Bei Ixun said hello to the Ice Emperor. Aunt Bing, you are here, mom is waiting for you inside. After saying hello to the Ice Emperor, Bei Ixun turned his attention to the last Titan Snow Demon. Seeing the embarrassed look of the Titan Snow Demon, as his old couple, the white bear laughed unkindly. In this simple scene, the lungs of the Titan Snow Demon are almost exploding. He wanted to bully Xiao Bing, but he saw a joke instead. That's right, the white bear is the old rival of the Titan Snow Demon, an ice bear king who has been cultivated for a hundred thousand years. Wang Ran didn't care about the little moves between the ice bear king and the Titan Snow Demon. At this moment, Wang Ran's mind was thinking of what the ice bear king said just now. The mother in the mouth of Ice Bear King should be the overlord Xvi of the North. Could it be that Xvi is also an Ice Bear? Wang Ran was a little confused, but he couldn't use his mental power to sense the specific situation of Emperor Xvi. And Wang Ran's doubts happened to be in the eyes of the Ice Emperor who was following him. In contrast, the Ice Emperor smiled softly at the Ice Bear King, then turned his head and explained to Wang Ran, My lord, Xiaobai is just sister Xu's gods. And hearing Bing Dai's explanation, Wang Ran understood it instantly. He nodded slightly towards the Bing Dai. It said he knew it. Upon seeing this scene, the Ice Emperor spoke to the Ice Bear King, Xiu Bai, I didn't expect you to be here today. But just so, you take us to see Sister Xu. Hearing the voice of Ice Emperor, Ice Bear King Xiu Bai did not refuse, but gave Wang Ran a bit embarrassed. Bing Dai said that a guest is coming, let him come to meet him. But everyone else is good, whether it's the familiar Titan Snow Demon or the unfamiliar Tanwing Ice Silkworm, both have the identity of soul beasts, and, or a soul beast unique to the far north. But Wang Ran, Ice Bear King Xiu Bai is sure, even if he is not a human being, he is definitely not a soul beast in the far north. Therefore, at this time he would be a little worried and a little embarrassed. And the Ice Emperor saw the hesitation of Ice Bear King Xiu Bai. He also understood his concerns. So, Ice Emperor directly said, don't worry about anything else, just take us there. Sistigs will not blame you, even if Sistigs blames you, 
this is what I mean. Hearing that the Bing Dai said that, Xiaobai didn't say much anymore. He took a few people and walked towards the interior of the valley. Isn't the valley very big? But everyone is walking slowly, so is the time on the road long or short? During this long and not short journey, Wang Ran was also in the conversation between Ice Emperor and Ice Bear King Xiaobai. He learned about Xiaobai's situation. As the Ice Bear King, Xiaobai naturally has his own place of residence. It's just that because he recognized Xi as a godmother, so every once in a while, Xiaobai would come to live and practice in Xi for a period of time. And now, it's time for Xiaobai to take a vacation here in Xi. This is also the reason why Xiaobai will appear in Xi. After clarifying these insignificant things, this short journey has also reached the point. At this time, Wang Ran and others were standing in front of Emperor Xi. Pina is astonishing, just like a dragon. Seeing Emperor Snow sitting in the Snow Valley cultivating, Wang Ran couldn't help but exclaimed. Without him, Xi's appearance is too delicate. As the snow girl of the ice sky, the Snow Emperor is no different from the spirit of this world. With this kind of existence, there is no need to describe how it looks. Although Kian Renks you might not lose to Xi in terms of appearance alone. But the cold spirituality of Xi was something Kian Renxiu had never possessed. However, Wang Ran was just appreciating Xi's exquisiteness. Therefore, after the admiration, Wang Ran calmed down. And at this time, the Emperor Xi, who had been sitting on top of the snow year, also slowly opened his eyes. Unlike the ice bear King Xiaobai, Xi's gaze was immediately placed on Wang Ran's body. Although nothing could be detected, Emperor Xi subconsciously felt that this man was dangerous, even. It can bring himself a crisis of death. It can be said that this is Xvi's sixth sense, the extremely accurate sixth sense of being a world spirit. For this feeling, Xvi himself was extremely convinced, because for so many years of cultivation, this accurate sixth sense did not know how many times she had saved her. So after opening his eyes, Emperor Xvi stood up slowly, opened his vermilion lips, and greeted Wang Ran, My lord, I don't know what happens to you in the cold place. Hearing the words of Emperor Xi, the Ice Emperor and Tanmen Ai Silkwim who had already known Wang Ran's strength did not feel anything. However, the two of the Ice Bear King Xiaobai and the Titan Snow Demon, who didn't know anything, were dumbfounded in an instant. Who is Xi? There is a well-deserved overlord in the far north. However, now Xi actually used the honorific title to Wang Ran, and still asked in such a respectful mouth. What's happening here? Is it possible that Wang Ran's strength is much stronger than Xi? But how is this possible? Didn't it mean that even the strongest soul beast emperor heaven on the land was not much stronger than Emperor Xi? Thinking of this, several huge question marks popped up in their minds. However, no one cares about their doubts. After Xi asked, Wang Ran directly said, Am here this time. I really want something to find you. I wonder if you are interested in becoming a teacher. I hope to invite you to become a teacher in my college and teach students to practice. With the lessons learned from the Ice Emperor, Wang Ran didn't say any more nonsense, and didn't think about selling it. Instead, he pointed out his purpose in a sharp cut. Chapter 445 Wang Xiaran and as Wang Ran's voice uttered, Bing Desai's instantly burst out in addition to the expected light, staring closely at Xvi's face, looking forward to her answer. However, Xvi did not immediately respond to Wang Ran's question, but scanned the expressions of several people present. The confusion of the Ice Bear King Xiaobai and the Titan Snow Demon, the expectations of Tanmen Ice Silkwim and Wang Ran, and the eagerness of the Ice Emperor. All of this was instantly captured by Xvi. At the same time, Emperor Xi was also in his own heart and made a general judgment for everyone. Wang Ran, the protagonist who ruled out the matter, did not say. First of all, Xiaobai and Artai must have no knowledge of this matter. Otherwise, the two would not show such a confused look. However, Bing Dai and the Big Bug must be clear. But this is very strange, that Big Bug Xi didn't know him. But Bing Dai, she was too familiar. If it were replaced by anyone, Emperor Xi could believe that that person would succumb to Wang Ran's strength. But for the Ice Emperor, this situation is simply impossible. If it wasn't for Bing Dai's own willingness, even if Wang Ran killed her, she would not have succumbed. Moreover, the expression in Bing Dai's eyes also expressed that she accepted it without any reluctance, even. I hope to join myself. Xi didn't think that the Bing Dai would harm herself. The reason she did this was definitely because Wang Ran had a special place, enough for the Bing Dai to pull herself into the group. But, what is it that can break the Ice Emperor's impression of humans in the past? He promised to join Wang Ran's camp, thinking of this, Xvi couldn't infer, can't help but feel a little confused. Therefore, facing Wang Ran's question, Xvi asked softly, why should I join your academy? Wang Ran was not surprised when he heard Xvi's words. He had anticipated all Xvi's reactions. This bargaining is just one of them. Anyway, 
no matter what the other party's psychological expectations are, Wang Ran is confident that as long as the other party is familiar with his treatment, he will definitely be moved. But, how did Wang Ran know that it was just a moment of time? Xi had already guessed the ins and outs of the whole thing in his mind. I asked this sentence only because I was interested. It is completely different from Wang Ran's speculation. If Wang Ran knew that the Snow Emperor had already thought so much in the instant he was thinking about it, he would definitely be unable to help but praise the Snow Emperor. However, Wang Ran didn't know this. But, Wang Ran doesn't know Xi? But someone knows her. Xvi's words sounded like he was not interested. But only the people around her understood. Xvi was interested. Exactly. Bing Dai is just such a person around him. Combined with the expression of Emperor Xvi, the Emperor Ice was very sure that Emperor Xvi had already wanted to understand something. So facing the Xvi's question, before Wang Ran could answer it, the Icely took the lead and said, Sister, I know this very well. Why don't I tell you about it? Because you can just think about it. Bing Dai said that she told the Xvi which meant that the two of them had a separate talk. This point, whether it is the Ice Bear King Xiubai, Titan Snow Demon King Artai and Xvi who are more familiar with Ice Emperor, or Wang Ran and Tanwin Ice Silkworm who have just met recently, Wang Ran did not say anything about this. He didn't want to guess about Bing Dis thoughts. But he knew that Emperor Bing also hoped that Emperor Xi would join Taoist Academy, and that was enough. As the protagonist of the incident, Emperor Xi, after hearing Wang Ran's words, was silent for a moment before speaking, it's okay to do this, please forgive me for the delay. The latter sentence, Xvi said to Wang Ran, Wang Ran is naturally aware of this point. Therefore, as Xvi's voice fell, Wang Ran also nodded gently, indicating that he didn't care. Upon seeing this, Xvi walked directly toward the depths of the snow valley. After seeing Xvi's movements, Bing Dai glanced at Xiaobai and Artai slightly and then quickly followed in the footsteps of Xi. The reason why she did this was naturally not because she wanted to share the responsibility for Wang Ran, but completely for the benefit of Emperor Xi. Because the next topic will definitely involve the issue of Xi's tribulation. But such things must never be heard by others, not to mention whether this will affect the prestige of Emperor Xi. Just to prevent the small actions of the caring people, confidentiality must be done. This is also the reason why Bing Dai just glanced at Xiaobai and Artai. Although the two are sincere about Xi, what about their men? You know, they are not alone. An Ice Bear King, a Titan Snow Demon King. The Ice Bear King is okay, and has a bit of silly temper. But the Titan Snow Demon, in the words of the Ice Emperor, that is, there is an ice hole in his brain. Who knows if this guy will leak the news and reveal the news about Xvi's triumph. Even if his people didn't make a move, what about other soul beasts? Although there are not many 100 year soul beasts in the far north, they still exist. Besides, if Xvi is really not sure to survive the tribulation, and ask it in front of so many people, wouldn't it make her embarrassed? Therefore, the Bing Dai proposed to have a separate talk with Xvi. With the departure of the Ice Emperor and the Snow Emperor, the Titan Snow Demon King Artai, who was beaten up, felt that he was doing it again. Wang Ran excitedly said to the side, Human, who are you? Even the Bing Emperor is willing to submit to you. Upon hearing the question from the Titan Snow Demon, Wang Ran chuckled lightly, and then replied, I'm the dean of a small college, and I'm also the head of a small sect. Hearing Wang Ran's words, the Titan Snow Devil curled his lips in disdain. Don't get me wrong, he is not disdainful of Wang Ran, but disdainful of his words. He was sure that Wang Ran's words were absolutely nonsense. The dean of the small academy and the master of the small sect, such an identity, how could it be possible for the Bing Dai to follow him convincingly? And even the Xvi was polite. With this kind of treatment, this academy should be the first academy of mankind, and the sect should also be the first sect of mankind. In a sense, the Titan Snow Devil's idea is indeed not at all faulty. In terms of strength alone, Tibetan sect was indeed Duluo's first sect. After all, do other sects have divine residences? There are Tibetan gates, and there are more than one. And the Taoist Academy with Tibetan members as teachers can indeed be called Duluo First Academy. From this point of view, Wang Ran seemed to be bullshitting. Chapter 446 Hundreds of people but if you look in another direction, what Wang Ran said seems to be fine. After all, whether it's Zhangman or Daozang Academy, there is a shortage of people. It can only be said that Wang Ran is the inheritance of Versailles literature, and he has installed a big one invisibly. If the Titan Snow Demon knew the truth of the matter, he would definitely sigh with emotion, as if forced to act. I, artist, would like to call you the strongest, unfortunately. Artist now knows nothing about it. At this moment Artist, seeing that there was no news coming out of Wang Ran's mouth, and adding that he was beaten by the Ice Emperor for provoking Wang Ran before, 
he was not ready to focus on him, but instead achieved the goal of Tanmeng I Silkwim. Although Tanmeng's I Silkwim cultivation base is very strong, who would call him the identity of the I Silkwim family is too weak. Therefore, the Titan Snow Demon did not regard the Heavenly Dream I Silkwim as a threat at all. Looking at the chubby Tanmeng I Silkwim, the Titan Snow Demon first swallowed subconsciously, then he also realized that his performance was a bit too much, and quickly said, Big Worm. How did you cultivate so many years safe and sound? Also, how did you meet the Tiger Lady Bingdai? Hearing the voice of the Titan Snow Demon King, Danman Binksuan couldn't help but twitched fiercely. Does this really think his Danman brother is a decoration? To swallow so blatantly, he really doesn't put his Danman brother in his eyes. Sure enough, the world was exactly what he thought, and it was full of dangers everywhere. If it was put in the past, he might approve it. But now, he dreamed of ice silkworms as backing ice silkworms and he was sorry for the thighs he was holding without being stiff. Therefore, facing the inquiries of the Titan Snow Demon King, Tanmeng Bing Silkworm did not give him a good face at all, and directly said hard, Silly big guy, who do you call big bug? Remember, you will be called brother Tanmeng from now on. Puff chuff ha ha ha. Hearing Tanmeng Ice Silkworm's words, the Ice Bear King Xiabai directly laughed. Nothing makes him more happy than watching the Titan Snow Demon deflate. If anything, buying it means that the Titan Snow Demon defies twice, like now, and as the object of Xiabai ridicule. At this time, the face of the Titan Snow Demon was completely black. You hit a wall twice in a row. This time you are not a big deal. After all, I have already suffered from the other party's losses. But now I was ridiculed by the Ice Bear King Xiabai, so I couldn't bear it. What kind of thing does he dare to laugh at him? the titan snow demon. Therefore, artist directly gave up the desire to talk to Dan Binken, but turned his head and looked at Xiaobai viciously. Being watched by artist like this, Xiaobai was neither guilty, nor restrained, still laughing. Is it really unbearable? Art I yelled at Xiaobai viciously, enough, Xiaobai. Do you want to be beaten? Was threatened by artist like this, Xiaobai didn't care, but said thief fly, at a don't you know how good you are? Just got beaten by Aunt Bing. As a result, he just said bad things about him. Just because you still want to beat me, don't look at which I'm your new count, or think about it first. How to beat me is the easiest. Also, Xiaobai is what you can call. Here Xiaobai words, artist was directly ignited. Is it true that adults don't slap their faces? What is Xiaobai slap in the face? This is simply the slap in the face and reveal the short. He even made a dismissive comment. So this, how could artist still bear it? Not much nonsense. Artist directly gave Xiaobai a note. I spare king, the name Artai is not something you can call rubbish. If you have the courage. Let's make a gesture and see who is stronger. Here are Test's words. Xiaobai had no intention of admitting counsel. Standing up, Xiaobai said directly, Just hit it. Do you really think I'm afraid of you? As the voice fell, Xiaobai and Artai walked directly into Xiu. You don't need to ask to know that they both definitely fought. Seeing this scene, Wang Ran felt a little bit dumbfounded. He really didn't know what was going on with these two guys. Their faces were like gunpowder kegs, which exploded at one point. However, he didn't care either, he just shook his head lightly and sat quietly on the ground, thinking about his next journey, and the two of Bingdai and Xdi, who had already gone to the depths of the snow valley, had already started their own conversation, sister, tell me honestly, are you sure to survive your next catastrophe, as soon as he stopped, Bingdai asked directly, her eyes were full of seriousness, hearing Bingdai's question, Xdi's face showed Raelo, however, because it was Bing Dai who asked her, Xdi didn't intend to hide it. After a moment of silence, Xdi took a long sigh of relief and calmly replied, Are you sure? To be honest, I always feel that I will die in the next catastrophe. Even if I get through by luck, it is estimated that I will pay a great price. So, I am going to give you the care of the far north. Hearing the words of Emperor Xdi, Emperor Bing's eyes flashed with fear. Sure enough, her judgment was not wrong, this time Xdi's catastrophe was really dangerous. Without hesitation, Bing Dai directly spoke to Xdi, enough sister, you can't survive the catastrophe, where can I have hope? So, take care of this far north. Just agree to the matter just now, he can help you survive the catastrophe. Xdi is a wise man. Hearing the words of Bing Dai, she connected the whole incident almost instantly. The biggest reason why the Ice Emperor was willing to follow that powerful human being must be because of his own tribulation. Thinking of this, a touch of emotion flashed in Xdi's eyes. It's not a bad thing in itself. So how could Xdi refuse to accept the kindness of this sister who grew up when he was a child? However, it is still necessary to verify in advance. After all, people's hearts are complicated. 
and no one knows whether what Wang Ran said is true or false. The Ice Emperor is so simple, it's normal to be deceived. Therefore, after the Ice Emperor finished speaking, the Xu Emperor did not immediately agree, but instead asked the Ice Emperor, Bingja, you said that human beings can help us through the catastrophe, how are you sure? Hearing the words of Emperor Xu, Emperor Bing also knew that she was worried that she had been deceived this time, although it seemed that he was very immature, the Ice Emperor was not angry. After so many years, this situation has obviously happened more than once. On the contrary, she still liked the feeling of being cared and worried by Xvi. Chapter 447 Xvi's decision Moreover, the Ice Emperor also knew that since Emperor Xvi had asked so, this matter could be said to be stable. Therefore, Bing Dis heart instantly relaxed, and even a smile appeared in his voice. Sister, don't worry. I must have considered such things. Wang Ran said that she is not going to directly help us through the catastrophe but will enhance our own strength and let us survive the catastrophe by ourselves. In this case, it will not take us long to verify the truth of this matter. At that time, if what Wang Ran said is false, we can make plans. Moreover, Wang Ran's strength is really strong, and I can't stand a single move in his hands. Therefore, I am willing to believe that he has the strength to help us survive the catastrophe. Of course, I have asked about other things. We are just going to be teachers and teaching students, Wang Ran will not let us do things that go against his principles. Hearing Bing Dis words, Xvi's heart also relaxed. Indeed, there is nothing wrong with Bing Dis idea. From this point of view, it's pretty good to follow Wang Ran. In the words of the Ice Emperor, the only thing that could surprise the Xu Emperor was that the Ice Emperor could not stand a trick in Wang Ran's hands. She thought she was high enough to look at Wang Ran, but she didn't expect that she still looked down on her. The surprise in his eyes disappeared in a flash, and his eyes were filled with relief instead. Xvi looked at the energetic Bing Dai with a smile on his face. Although the Bing Dai had 400,000 years of cultivation, he still tried his best to show his maturity. But after all, he lives in the pure northern land, and he has his own protection. Therefore, the Bing Dai still retains a lot of innocence and purity in his temperament. Since Bingja, you have to think about it so comprehensively. I am naturally willing to join you in Wang Ran's academy. But, are the students he asked us to teach humans? Xvi accepted it, as if covering the matter with a coffin board. Of course, she still has to ask about some things she doesn't understand. The Bing Dai was also clear about Xvi's stats and worries. So the Snow Emperor's question just fell? The Ice Emperor answered, not all humans. Wang Ran said that there are also soul beasts in form. However, even if it is all human, don't worry, sister, you are so beautiful, you will definitely be very popular. As for us, Wang Ran said that he would teach us the art of transforming, so that we can freely transform into human form, there will be no problem then. After listening to Bing Dis answer, Xvi didn't have any questions to ask. The matter has been settled, the two of them didn't waste too much time. Hurry back to find Wang Ran. After all, they will still follow Wang Ran in the future, but Wang Ran can't wait long. It didn't take much time for the two to talk. So when they came back, Titan Snow Demon King Artai and Ice Bear King Xiaobai who were fighting, they just went out for a short time. When Xvi came back and saw Artist and Xiaobai disappeared, he immediately understood what had happened. Sure enough, she just found Artist and Xiaobai who were fighting in the distance. Suddenly, Xvi's face darkened. Rao is the mentality she has cultivated for so many years and she feels helpless towards Artai and Xiaobai. With a guilty complaint towards Wang Ran, Emperor Xu disappeared instantly. After leaving, a terrifying energy wave broke out in the distance. When she appeared again, two tragic big guys followed behind her. It is Artist and Xiaobai, the two of them now, but the influence of Artist, who was severely hammered by the Ice Emperor before, was much worse. In other words, it was Xu himself who shot the hammer himself, and it was impossible to justify it. However, that's all. Artist and Xiaobai are not honest yet. Following the Xdi, Artai and Xiaobai, you take a look at me, I stare at you. It seems to say it all, I blame you, otherwise I would not be hammered by Master Xdi mother. Regarding the performance of these two guys, although everyone was a little bit dumbfounded, they did not take it seriously. After seeing Emperor Xu's return, Wang Ran directly asked, Xdi, are you sure you want to join the Taoist Academy? Said it was an inquiry. But Wang Ran was actually going to make sure. After all, Bing Dai had already told him the result just now. Yes, I'm sure. Sure enough, just after Wang Ran's question was uttered, Emperor Xu didn't hesitate, nodded and answered. Upon seeing this, Wang Ran also put a smile on his face. And Artai and Xiaobai, who were behind Emperor Xu, were instantly stunned when they heard the conversation between Emperor Xu and Wang Ran. They didn't expect that Xu actually agreed. Master Xu's mom, are you leaving the Far North? No. 
If you leave, what should you do in this far north? If you really want to leave, or you take me with you. In an instant, Artist and Xiaobei spoke directly. These words of the two of them all came from the heart. However, Xi was not prepared to take both of them away. Xiaobei is fine, but Artist definitely can't. He and the Ice Emperor left, and the three great northern kings had already lost two. If Artist leaves again, there will be no more three kings in the north, except for the three great northern kings. No soul beast can obtain the approval of all races. At that time, no one will be able to provoke this beam that governs the far north. I am afraid that the entire far north will fall into chaos. I am afraid that the current stability and harmony will be gone forever. So, facing Xiaobai and Artei's request, Xi directly shook his head, and then said, No, Xiaobai can leave the far north with me, but Artis definitely can't. Why? Lord Xi, I am much stronger than Xiaobai. Just as Xi said the first sentence, Artist couldn't help but ask. As a loyal Xvi party, Artai really wanted to follow Xvi's side. And Xiaobei calmed down after hearing the words of Emperor Xvi. Even when Artist said he was better than himself, Xiaobei didn't say anything to refute, but just watched Artai perform quietly. After all, Xvi said, he Xiaobei can leave with him, but Artai can't. This result is enough. What kind of bicycles are needed? Artist just said it if he wanted to. No matter how it was said, it was nothing more than an addiction. It was useless at all. On the contrary, his Xiaobai is now standing on the commanding heights of victory, and can quietly look down on Artist. Chapter 448 The Far North, Catch It All Ignoring Xiaobai, who was sitting firmly on the Dai Oyutai, Xvi looked at the anxious Titan Snow Demon. To be honest, that three-point reluctance, seven-point excitement look coupled with Artist's huge figure, really makes people feel weird. However, in Xvi's heart, he was indeed moved at this time. With a light sigh, Emperor Xvi explained towards Artai, it is precisely because of your strength that I cannot take you away. You should also understand that in the entire Northern Territory, apart from you and I, Emperor, no one can command the entire Northern Territory with prestige. Now Bing Dai and I are going to leave, so the far north must be entrusted to you. Hearing what Xvi said, Artei's face showed a touch of sadness. He understood that what Xvi said was indeed no problem, but instead of commanding the far north, he still hopes to stay with Xvi. However, Xvi hoped that he could command the extreme north and maintain the harmony of the extreme north. Therefore, even though he is reluctant in his heart, he can only accept it honestly. After a long sigh, Artai was just about to agree, when a voice suddenly rang from everyone's ears. You all want to join the Daozang Academy as a teacher. In that case, I still welcome it. The owner of this voice is not surprisingly Wang Ran. And hearing Wang Ran's words, everyone's complexion became a little weird. To put it bluntly, although there are only a few people here, it is already the foundation of most of the far north. You want to catch the entire far north in one go. Although in addition to a few of them, the far north also has several hundred thousand year soul beasts. However, those soul beasts and them once were simply too far apart. Even Xiaobei, who has not yet reached the level of the fierce beast, can crush any of them. Even after removing all of those present, the Bingdai alone could single handle the rest of the far north. Therefore, if a few of them join the Taoist Academy, it can really be said that they have completely wiped out the far north. Although I don't have any opinions about joining the Taoist Academy, I even have some expectations. However, it is impossible for them to leave the far north alone. Therefore, facing Wang Ran, Emperor Xi said directly, my lord's kindnesses are heartfelt, but if we all join the Taoist Academy and leave the far north, this far north, it must be chaotic. I'm afraid adults don't want to see this situation. Hearing what Xvi said, Wang Ran shrugged slightly and replied, I really don't want to see the chaos in the far north, the scene of the last life being burned. But, who told you that you would leave the far north after joining the Taoist Academy? Ah, don't leave the far north. Then how do we teach students? After hearing Wang Ran's words, everyone was stunned. Even the smartest Xvi didn't know what was going on. Indeed, if you don't leave the extreme north, is it possible that Wang Ran wants to establish the college in the extreme north? Of course this kind of guessing is impossible. Wang Ran gave the answer after everyone made a puzzled voice. Of course, if you don't want to leave, you will naturally stay in the far north. Although the Academy Sora is abundant, but after all, it is impossible to provide you with an environment suitable for your cultivation as in the far north. Under this situation, I naturally wouldn't ask you to go to the Taoist Academy to practice. Of course, if you add Zangman in the future, I would suggest that you go to the Zongman to practice. After all, 
the concentration of the spiritual energy of the Zongman is not comparable to other places. As for your teaching students, I will teach you a method of avatar, so that you can separate an external avatar that can exist for a long time. After listening to Wang Ran's words, Xi and others raise their brows in surprise. Unexpectedly, there is even this kind of operation. Seeing everyone's surprise, Wang Ran didn't care too, it was just the reason for the mismatch of information. Therefore, after his own voice fell, Wang Ran asked again, How, are you two still joining the Taoist Academy? Wang Ran's words were obviously addressed to Artai and Xiaobai who had just said they would go with Xdi. This, artist and Xiaobai also understand. However, after hearing Wang Ran's question, both of them fell into entanglement. They wanted to join the Taoist Academy before, but because they thought that Emperor Xu was leaving. But now, Wang Ran has made it clear that Emperor Xu doesn't need to leave the far north, so it doesn't seem to matter whether he joins the Taoist Academy or not. However, even though the two of them did not understand this so-called Taoist Academy, nor did they understand Wang Ran, but the Ice Emperor and Xu Emperor both joined, at least it can prove that joining this Taoist Academy is still a good choice. However, will you receive any constraints? They are getting used to it freely and don't want to put a shackle on themselves. Therefore, under such conditional bonuses, the two talents will be in entanglement at this moment. However, it doesn't matter if you don't decide yourself, just ask Xdi. No matter what, Xdi will not pit them. Therefore, after Artai and Xiaobei struggled for a few seconds, they looked directly at Xdi. After being looked at by the two of them, Emperor Xu also understood what they meant. Thinking of joining Wang Ran's academy, not only would he be able to increase his strength, but also ensure that he would survive the catastrophe. Xdi nodded slightly towards Artai and Xiaobai. Simple Xdi nodded and motioned for them to agree. Artai and Xiaobai did not hesitate, and directly spoke to Wang Ran, we are willing to join the college and become a teacher. Hearing the answers of the two, Wang Ran's face instantly showed a bright smile. This set of far north places is really worth the money. Not only brought the Snow Emperor back, but also abducted most of the top existence in the far north. When he was happy, Wang Ran ordered a little directly towards everyone. In an instant, several rays of light flowed from Wang Ran's fingertips and submerged in the eyebrows of Emperor Xdi and others. The speed was so fast that even the strongest Xdi in the far north did not react. And as this light fell into the center of the eyebrows, everyone felt that a large amount of information appeared in their minds. As I stabilized my mind, I began to absorb these contents, but everyone discovered that these contents were recorded in ancient books of cultivation. Among them are the transforming technique and the avatar technique and even the cultivation method to improve cultivation. Although the cultivation technique was only a small part of the front, the information revealed was enough to make Xdi and the others feel deeply shocked. Chapter 449 A Sweet Date A slap can make you feel like a god not only because of the emergence of new things on the Duluo continent such as cultivation techniques, but also because only that small part, according to the description, can support them to cultivate to the level of second level or even first level divine residence. Wang Ran was not surprised to see the shocked appearance of everyone. Wang Ran had anticipated this kind of reaction. Cultivation methods that are not under the civilization of the world system will always cause shock if they want to collide. After a light cough, Wang Ran spoke softly to Xdi and the others, you have all written down the classics. I have to go to other places to recruit teachers, so I left first. During this period of time, you will cultivate well, and it won't be long before I will call you to the college. Wait, you just taught us the classics so you are not afraid that we will go back. After hearing Wang Ran's words, Xdi quickly asked, his voice filled with disbelief. Even if it is a trusted person, it will take some time to pass on such precious classics, not to mention a bunch of strangers just met. If you think about it in another way, Xdi believes that it is absolutely impossible for him to do this. Even if you want to teach, you have to study it for 10 or 8 years. Faced with Xdi's question, Wang Ran, who was just about to leave, paused a little. Looking at the somewhat incredulous Snow Emperor, Wang Ran said with a chuckle, Since I can easily teach you these things, it proves that these things are nothing to me. There will be many good things in the future, as long as you are not stupid, you will make the wisest choice. What's more, can you try to tell me what I have just taught you? Hearing what Wang Ran said before, Xdi and others were very serious at first, but when they heard the last sentence, the faces of several people showed a trace of confusion. What does Wang Ran mean? Everyone was a little puzzled, but after Wang Ran said so, they still tried it. But don't know if you don't try, just try it and be surprised. Obviously, the information of those classics was clearly engraved in their minds but they couldn't say a word on their lips. At this moment, several people looked at Wang Ran in shock. Unexpectedly, 
their master Dean is really terrifying. This earth-shattering method of weeping ghosts can be displayed unconsciously. They didn't mean to be angry, because it was too normal. What's more, Wang Ran's ability to speak out proves that this is a rule and will not have a bad effect on their bodies. They really did not feel any discomfort at all. What they have now is the respect and fear of Wang Ran, who has become their leader. The effect of slapping a sweet date with another slap is similar to the effect of slapping a sweet date with another slap. Anyway, the current Wang Ran just missed a hand, already deeply shocked these top spirit beasts from the far north. Without staying too much, Wang Ran's figure gradually became blurred in the same place and then completely disappeared in the same place. Who Binja? Lord Wang Ran is indeed the same as you said. The strength is beyond measure. After Wang Ran's figure disappeared, Emperor Gs took a long sigh. He spoke to the Ice Emperor with emotion. The Bing Dai had already felt this for a long time, so he immediately nodded. And Tanman Ice Silkworm, he smiled and said to the Ice Emperor, Right, Binja, I persuaded you to join the Academy from the beginning. I was right. Right, it's sunny, the rain has stopped. Tanman Binken feels like it's doing it again. The Tanman Ice Silkworm now? The Vernal Equinox is full of pride, completely missing the way he had wilted before. After all, how do you count? Bing Dai and the others also have half the credit for joining the Taoist Academy. If he didn't have his own persuasion, the Ice Emperor would have been stubbornly resisting because of the defeat. What a pity. Tanman Ice Silkworm's idea is excellent. The skin is also very thick. However, Bing Dai didn't give Tanman Binken a face at all. After the voice of Tanman Ice Silkworm fell, what was exchanged was only a cold stroke of the Ice Emperor, and a cold blow. Although I am grateful for your advice, if you call me Bingja next time, I promise I will eat you. This time, even if the merits and demerits are offset. Here, the cold voice of Bing Dai. Tanman Binken's body shuddered subconsciously. Then, the whole person dot 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 oh no, the whole insect wilted in an instant. At the side, Artist laughed secretly at the sight of Tanman I Silkworm. What is this big bug like? He went to pick up such a thing as Bing Dai. He is not disgusted with cross racial love, and he even looks forward to it. However, you should choose a better one. Ice Emperor dot 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 what is this thing? Huh? Of course, Artist only dared to smile inwardly and mumble. If he said it, he would never dare. After all, he hadn't lived enough. When Xvi saw this scene, he also took a look at Tanman Binkin with interest. However, she did not intervene in the affairs between Tanman Binken and Bing Dai. With a light cough, Emperor Gs said softly to several people, Okay, stop messing around. Now that you have decided to join the Taoist Academy, let's do well next. No matter what we do, our name in the far north cannot be weakened. So, while waiting for Master Wang Ran's call, you can cultivate with peace of mind. Hearing what Xvi said, Everyone nodded without objection. Then everyone left one after another and returned to their own territory to practice. Tanman Binken looked at Bing Dai with some dismay, but did not dare to speak. After all, this had just suffered a bite, and it would take at least a few hours to get over. Therefore, Tanman Ice Silkworm just sighed lightly, twisted his body and returned to his underground cave. Now that his strength hasn't been raised yet, the far north is still very dangerous. So, Take advantage of the short safety period formed by the two breaths of Xiaobai and Artist, and hurry home. Seeing Tanwing I Silkworm's slightly hurried figure when he left, Emperor Gs smiled and joked to Ice Emperor, Bingja, what do you think of Tanwing I Silkworm? Cut, it's the weak I Silkworm, and it's not spine yet. Hearing the words of Emperor Gs, Emperor Bing replied with a slight disdain. The matter between Ice Emperor and Tanwing I Silkworm had been guessed by Gs Emperor for so long, so after hearing the Bing Dai's answer, Xvi glanced deeply at the direction where Tanman I Silkworm had left, and muttered, Weak and spineless. Chapter 451 Year the Snow Emperor did not hear clearly what Xvi murmured, so the Ice Emperor asked with a puzzled look on his face, Sister, what did you just say? When the Ice Emperor asked, Xvi's expression became a little serious, and he warned towards the Ice Emperor, Binja, don't underestimate anyone, especially the heavenly dream I Silkworm. Is he really weak? With his cultivation base. With the help of Lord Wang Ran, I am afraid that his strength will soon surpass you and me. And that seemingly weak character, who knows if it is great wisdom. The reason why Xvi said this was not to make the Ice Emperor please the Tanmen Ice Silkworm, but to be more cautious. Although Tanmen Ice Silkworm is not an enemy now, no one knows what will happen in the future. Besides, there are no Tanmen Ice Silkworms, and Tanmen Ice Horses. If the Ice Emperor had always underestimated the opponent because of his race, who knew whether he would capsize in the gutter. However, the Bing Dai didn't understand the point. Instead he spoke indifferently, Sister, what do you mean? Tanmen I Silkworm's strength may be improved a lot, I believe. 
but that guy still has great wisdom, besides, how does he have to do with me, seeing the appearance of Bing Dai not caring, Xdi just shook his head gently, without saying much, things still need Bing Dai to go to the realm by herself, and she doesn't have much to say, sister, it'll be cultivating with you during this period, it's the same when I go back anyway, the Bing Dai didn't entangle the issue of Tanman I silkworm, and directly changed the subject, Xdi nodded and agreed, dot, turning his gaze, Wang ran, who had left the far north, began his own journey to find people, it would take half a year for the big powerhouses in the extreme north to use the technique of transformation and the technique of avatar proficiently, give them a little more time and allow them more than half a year to take precautions, therefore, Wang Ran set himself a year to find a suitable teacher, one year's time was enough for Wang Ran to travel the entire Duluo continent, even the sun and moon continent on the other side can go and take a look, therefore, since leaving the far north, Wang Ran slowed down his pace, walking slowly from city to city, looking for people in the local area whose cultivation and character all met his requirements, however, there are certainly not too many people who can meet Wang Ran's requirements in every aspect, therefore, after traveling most of the Duluo continent, Wang Ran only took over 20 people, but, the character of these people has undoubtedly passed Wang Ran's test, not only the requirements for oneself, or the level of care for the students, without exception is the best choice, not only that, those with the worst cultivation base all have the 6th ring cultivation base, and the strongest are even approaching the 8th ring, don't think that only half of Duluo continent has elected so few such 20 people, you know, Wang Ran's requirements are very strict, not only must the human nature meet Wang Ran's requirements, but also the cultivation base must not be too bad, more importantly, the determination and will to cultivate must be strong, all of a sudden, Wang Ran's target was directly targeted at the crowd above the fifth ring, after all, these teachers now recruited can be said to be candidates for Zangman, the cultivation level is not enough to teach students, little determination to become stronger, unable to meet the requirements of Zangman, so, can half of Duluo continent elect more than 20 people, it is already very difficult, these two dozen people, under the resources of Zangman, undoubtedly, they can successfully break through title Duluo's existence, of course, Wang Ran hadn't encountered Title Duluo before, but, the personality of the Title Duluo that Wang Ran encountered was really hard to describe, so Wang Ran passed them all ruthlessly, I don't know if these people will know that because of their character, they have missed a great opportunity, will they regret their intestines, however, Wang Ran would not care about these, his journey is still going on, it's just that more and more people are following him, and they are all spirit masters with a strong cultivation base, this special team also began to spread on the mainland slowly, no one knows their details, only that everyone in this team has an unspeakable cultivation base, on their way forward, no matter how powerful the evil existence is, they will disappear after they leave, no one knows exactly where these evil people have gone, but everyone guessed that they were already dead, indeed, these evil existences that disappeared were all dead, in the hands of the teaching team behind Wang Ran, Wang Ran did not send them back to the academy to teach after recruiting these people to become teachers at the academy, but instead let them stay with him, in this way, it is to familiarize them with each other, and also to teach them some skills, however, the character of the person who can be selected by Wang Ran is naturally nothing to say, after they gathered together, the evil spirit masters on the road felt uncomfortable, of course, everyone who died in their hands was an existence that could be called an angry man, it's the most common practice like eating human heart and drinking human blood, they wouldn't take care of ordinary evils, and Wang Ran didn't agree with them, because the world is balanced, where there is light, there is darkness, and where there is good, there is evil, this is inevitable, even if they help each other, the same villain will be born in the future, with the existence of those evil spirit masters, the journey down is not boring, soon, the Uni period is drawing to an end, it took a lot of time to bring the newly appointed teachers, Wang Ran's plan to go to the sun and moon continent to recruit teachers was not realized, but even so, the soul master team behind Wang Ran had already exceeded the 40 mark, everyone is very strong, and they stand together, enough to have the confidence to ignore any sect except the spirit hall, but among this group of people, there is one that stands out the most, a long pale hair was scattered behind him, and it looked very old, however, his figure is unusually burly, and his face is also very young and calm, a pair of deep eyes seemed to be filled with stories, most importantly, the aura on his body is as heavy and strong as a mountain, compared with the white haired man, the other teachers in the team are in the sky and underground, this white haired man is not someone else, he is the peerless powerhouse of the last era, Tang Chen, one of the three peerless duel you owe in this world.